Hi, chat. Hello, chat. How do you do, chat? All right, so. So, chat. First of all, Winsanity, thank you for the prime. Appreciate that. Um, 
So I came up with a name I liked and an idea that I liked. And I don't really have as much of a plan as I was thinking I would. Uh, but I think I've got a general idea. Um, I haven't created the character yet, so we're going to do that first, I think. And we'll go from there, I guess. I think that's the plan for now. Um, but the name is a play off of the movie Fried Green Tomatoes. If you guys haven't seen that movie, it's great. I love it. Um, there's a character called, uh, Imogene, um, uh, Threadgood. Short, um, her nickname is Iggy. So I picked Emma Jean instead of Imogene. And I swapped it to Threadwell because I want it to kind of be loosely based on her character. But not exactly her character. Um, so I just, I have some like little things here and there that I want to throw in, but like, yeah. So, let us see what we can do here. We will... I'm going to get started with the character creation. Hold on, I know you guys are still blind. How old should she be? What year should she have been born in? I guess... I'll make her the same age as me. We'll do what we normally do. Behold, my new character. <laughs> All right, um, so we're gonna have to not worry about the face <laughs> because that's gonna come afterwards. I wish it wasn't nighttime right now. Land, thank you for the gifted sub. I appreciate that. Commander Marie, thank you for the 46 months. Bradley, thank you for the 36 months as well. Alright, so I do know I want her to be... like a dirty blonde. I really wish it wasn't dark out. Good lord, okay. <laughs> I have no idea what I want her to look like, really. Just that I wanted her to be kind of blondish. Um, maybe land. I might want to make her look sort of like the actress, but I'm not too sure. I don't know if I can achieve it with the hairstyles that are in the game. This would probably be one of the most close ones. 
Honestly, something like that might work. I hate... If I didn't hate the bangs on this, this would be accurate too. But I hate the bangs. That's a cute hairstyle. <laughs> just with the face, just none of these are going to look right. Oh, no. Hmm. It's not the worst. This also might work, actually. 108 and 115. Definitely wish there were more like really messy hairstyles. This isn't bad, but it's not exactly what I was going for. This might be good. 169. Uh, AutoCAD Wizard, thank you for the seven months. I don't want to go with this because I feel like everyone goes with this for a southern kind of character.
I wish I could do the face first. That's so upsetting that I can't. I hate it. All right, we'll go with that for now, and then uh, I'm going to mess with the jacket situation. Honestly, that might be kind of fitting. Let's go through some options, chat. Suspenders and a white button-up? I don't know. I, I'm probably going to look for something like that. This is kind of cute. I wonder... Are there suspenders? Uh, the face I have to fix after this, unfortunately. <laughs> I can't do anything about it right now. The way the character creator works is that you have to pay for the clothing first, and then it'll let you do... Um, okay, so vest... We might have to look here for what I'm thinking. I don't really know if we have like a suspender option. Might be also under bags. The heck is that? Um, okay, maybe scarves. Wait. Oh, you know, I think the suspenders kind of suck because they're they're only for one specific type of pant. Oh, that sucks. I'm remembering it now. Yeah, it only works with, like, one shirt. I 
I still like this shirt, though. one handsome woman i know they're kind of different colors oh dang it i'm sad All right, that's fine. Um, what different pants? I actually don't really want to do the overalls. I like those shorts. We'll come back to those. I don't think those are right. What's the inspiration for the character? Um, is she Threadgood from Fried Green Tomatoes? Not exactly like a one-to-one -one thing, but I definitely want to have <laughs> some influence there. This is just not going to work. It's just not going to work. I really don't want to do overalls. I hate the overalls on the women. They just don't look right. No, she's not going to cook and eat people. I mean, she might. I don't know, actually. We'll see how things go. <laughs> That's not the plan. I wish it was daytime. I'm so sad. <laughs> I wish I could see things properly. I wish there was just brown. Why is there not just brown? Green's not bad.
don't know, I like the other shirt a lot better. Doesn't go great with those shorts though. The waistline is funky. Maybe a belt would help. We'll keep these pants in mind, I think. 153 chat. Uh, Grower the Great, thank you for the gifted sub. I appreciate that. These ones look a lot better. Just wish there was a brown option. shoes did she wear? I'm once again sad about the lighting situation. <laughs> Going good, V. We're just making the new character. Trying to figure out what kind of shoes to wear.
Those things... Those things don't really just look right. I don't know. Hold on. Hold on, chat. I'm gonna have to look at a picture. Going to have to try. Then I'm look with the ponytail and the hat. I don't know if we could achieve the hat part. Which GTA shoes just didn't look so weird? Alright, I'll look for a denim situation. Something cute. Actually, let's go backwards. Oh, goodness. all the custom stuff. Ah! Oh, goodness. There's really not very many, like, 
cute denim options, I don't think. A lot of them are just like a denim jacket, which is so boring. This is a new dress I haven't seen before. Sorry, I was just going through the options. Oh, you're blind. Oh, I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, it's sort of becoming daytime. Yeah, I mean, there's honest, there's just not really very many denim -y looks that are just going to work. This gives her like a hot belly and I don't like that. Yeah, the kiki face is hard to deal with. <laughs> uh, Itchy Threadgood is the character I'm basing this off of. It doesn't have to be an exact match. I'm just trying to make it kind of... Yes, this is the poacher character that I was making. She's tomboyish, but also kind of, like, stylish, which is interesting. It's a hard look to achieve with limited options. Oh, hold on. Hold on, I have an idea. I have... I have an idea. Maybe, unless...
I wish this didn't clip so much. Anriel, thank you for the 24 months. Welcome back. I think we might be on to something here. I think we might be on to something here, chat. I just gotta find the right match. I want, a, I want like a... Denim-ish undershirt. No, not a one-lifer. I'm thinking, uh... This could be uh, just a petty crim that we can play from time to time. When I... Feel like it. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh no, it's missing. Dang it, dude. What, what goes with this? jacket goes with this. Man, that sucks. So I like the belt. You think the pants are clipping? No, I think it's missing. Two eighteen.
Good lord. <laughs> Oops. Sorry, I got focused. Sorry. I'm not trying to be quiet, but... I just want to find the right undershirt. Okay, 218. 181 is something I want to remember. That's missing the whole bag. That sucks, man. goes with this or at least what's supposed to go with it I don't know, Pigeon Zone. I don't know what you're seeing. I have no idea. I just wish I knew what this was meant for. It's true. Bodon does stink.
do be pretty stinky in here with the boat on. Oh, maybe this? Yeah, I think this is what it is. Dang it, I like this a lot though, like the um, under part. I'm not sure what color we should go with. I don't think we need any decals. I think I'm good with the shoes. Don't think we need any glasses or earrings. Does she need any kind of bracelet, I wonder? I don't know. <laughs> Probably not going to use that.
there's any vests I like. Maybe that, I don't know. Um, no backstory that I've really come up with. At least for the moment. Can you take a bag off? Is that a thing? Yeah, we're trying to make a crim character, but I'm, I'm getting stuck on the clothing stuff. It's not really any good. I wanted to have a bag, but I don't want to not be able to take it off, right?
<laughs> I wish I knew. I think we'll stick with it just because I think it's funny. Because she's supposed to be like a... A roamer. Yeah, she's like a, a train hopper. Do you prefer sauceless pizza? Um, that's a good question. I don't think so. I don't really think she'll be wearing a mask. Uh, very much. But I still like to have one. That's scary. A mask is funny. Get out of me. Okay. Ah, leave. Ah. 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 Go away. I kind of liked the deer thing. Not the deer, but like the, um... Creepy skull mask.
It puts the horns inside of the... The hat. Oh no. So the hat like that, and then the hairstyles I'm probably going to struggle with again. Is she seeing my character? <laughs> Am I bugging her as much as she's bugging me? Oh no. <laughs> Tell her I'm sorry. That's so obnoxious. Yeah. Tragically, the hats just, they don't work with some of these hairstyles. I wish I could use this hat. Andy hair works. Sure, we could use like some of this hair. I like the ponytail. With the hat. And that would work just fine. Oh no, another person. No, get out of, get out of here. I hate it. I hate it.
I like this messy hair a lot, though. Looks like a lighter blonde. I really hope this doesn't continue when I change over to Oh no, no, I hate that. Okay. This is awful. Yeah, I'm thinking we might need to go to a barber. Oh man, we can't remove the bag. That's okay. <laughs> we won't worry about that. Uh, I'm gonna have to find a... What is this walk? Doesn't look good when it's not Tessa.
I hate I I hate this walk so much. It is it is it just makes me mad when I see it. I hate it. Nobody walks like this. Who walks like this? It's not normal. So this is casual. Honestly, a lot of the walk styles are just not normal. <laughs> it's way too fast. Way too slow. Too fast. Business? Nope. Oh god, who walks like that? I hate this walk. I hate this one. The ugh. Some of these, like, just are not. They're not it. I don't think either of the heels ones. I think this is Tess's old walk. Yeah. Her normal walk. Muscle. Business three. <laughs> Widester? What is this? Oh, God. Sassy two? <laughs> Ew, I hate it. Uh, this is business three. It's a little too fast. I'm not... Armored? Oh god. Oh, this is Damien's walk. God, I hate it. Oh, it's so dumb. Janitor? What in the heck? Franklin? Nonchalant.
my What are these? Oh my god. Sassy. Shady? I hate that one too. Trevor walk like yeah, they're all so aggressive there's one oh god she's hunched over now so bouncy. I think we might go with something like this, more like deliberate. This is the Delman walk, I think. barber shop there's one up there what are all my emotes
Oh boy. All right. Well, at least we have hands up. Do that. And that. <laughs> okay, and then... Do this one. I think that could be fun. And then a, a weight we'll put on nine. good one. Okay, we got that. And then the hands up. I do actually prefer the other hands up. one Tessa does. This one has more like shaky hands. I like that one. <laughs> Headbutt could be a fun one. Get one too. All right, so we got that kind of stuff going. get our face on because <laughs> we kind of skipped that part but we're gonna have to run to it and if I run into somebody and they ask why I don't have any eyebrows I'm not gonna have any I'm not gonna have an explanation okay
Okay. <laughs> a nair accident? I had a little bit of trouble with that, that nair stuff. I, I tried putting it on. And uh, I, I think I think you ain't supposed to use that on your face. I'm gonna be honest. I think that stuff gave me some chemical burns, and I, I also, I think, I think I left it on too long. It was a, that was a bad idea. Oh my god, this run. Oh my- oh my god, I can't. Oh god, this run. Oh no, I can't do it. I can't. Nuh-uh. It ain't gonna work. This walk style is not gonna work. It's unacceptable. I wonder where there's going. I, I cannot do the run. We're just gonna we're just gonna be brave. That'll be. Oh my lord. I think I just almost died. Was barbecuing up some pork and the grease on the pig caused the flare up and darn near took off my eyebrows. I'll be careful with them barbecues. How does our, um, okay, it says Imogene. I don't know if the two names thing would have messed it up or anything. All right. So our face isn't terrible yet. Um... A little wrinkly, I think, so I need to figure out 
which um <laughs> yeah yet uh the face blend is always something that confuses me So we'll go with something like that. Well, this is already awkward. At least she's not stuck inside of my face. I always struggle with this part because it's like, um, <laughs> it's really hard to figure out what's affecting what. Uh, and you get like, Oh, it's so weird. And then you gotta worry about the skin looking all wonky because some of these have like old faces. So I think skin makes you turn, you can turn all the way down. And then it should, okay, yes, I think this is what you're supposed to do. And this will give you the complexion that you're going for. And you can do kind of a mix of the two as well. I want her to be a little bit tan. She spends a lot of time outside. This sort of makes her look old.
I would say she's um about my age, so late twenties. No, no wiki yet, as far as I'm aware. Okay, so eyebrows. There we go. Got some eyebrows. Um, she'll probably be kind of a lone wolf, but she'll she'll do stuff with other people probably. Own twist. Give her a uh, crooked nose. Oh, I didn't know we could do eye color. These are a little bit freaky. Honestly, I think we'll just go with the brown. That would be kind of normal.
Starts a little diner by the railroad tracks because we all know the secrets in the sauce. Giant eyes. All right, do we need any blemishes? Ew. Yeah, let's let's maybe not. No aging. Freckles. Nah. Do we need any makeup? I don't think so. I don't think she's a makeup kind of girl. Maybe some blush. And a red cheeks. A little sunburnt, maybe. And lipstick, I don't really... Honestly, I don't think she'd wear a lipstick. change feet size um <laughs> no <laughs> the shoes you wear maybe Sun is going down. Let's head out to the hunting zone. First, we got to get a rental car. Man. 
Make sure to steal a car, not know the owner, and have no signs of tampering. What's up, big dog? You know me, making that money. So how are things going over at your firm? So we have a mask, our hat, our ID. We have about 5,000 to our name. And I have to go rent a car. People still randomly get stuff in their storage or random cars? Um, I don't know. Fact of the matter is, we are broke. Uh, we gotta figure out how to get some money so that we can get stuff like lockpicks. rental place. We're gonna get a car. We're gonna go up to the hunting lodge. We're gonna see about getting a rifle. would be a free bison if I had a lockpick of any kind. Bright white. Oh no, dude. Well, even if the truck was unlocked, I can't operate the truck without a lockpick. You can't just hotwire a car. We have the rental papers. You guys. Listen, okay? I need you to listen to me. The mechanic for driving. If I was to get in this car, if it's unlocked, I cannot simply start the car. I ha I even if it has rental papers, I have to have a lockpick. I do not have a lockpick. 
use the papers? Rental papers give you keys. What do you mean? I've never heard that in my whole life. It says that on them? Oh my god. No one in my entire life has ever told me that. Alright, chat. I'm blaming you because you're metagaming me right now. She's a crim. She knows that crimey crime. No. No. -uh. I actually don't want to get a ticket. <laughs> I blame you guys. Metagaming. 100%. Trying to make me cheat. Teaching me things about the game that I don't know. The barbershop flips are everywhere. Turn this off. Alright, so she's definitely going to be somebody that goes hunting a lot. She's probably going to be in a lot of debt all the time. She's probably going to always steal cars. This is probably... Once I start figuring out how to get lockpicks and stuff, this will be probably the only car that she pays for. You guys have to understand, I have so little experience with the crim side of this game, it's not even funny. So when, when I say that there's mechanics that I don't know about, I'm dead serious.
Um, probably no bank stuff. Like, I don't think she's going to be that kind of criminal. <laughs> the original idea was just to mess with the new rangers. need to be careful out here because the mountain lion, but... Hoping they'd have tents in stock. Okay. I don't have enough for everything yet. I don't know how much ammo I need. Oh God. Get to it.
I'll wait till it gets a little more off the road. Oh my god. It's... How is it so evasive? What the heck? These bushes are awful. Oh my god! Okay, alright, this is... <laughs> Why won't it die? What the heck? Hello? <laughs> I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get this cat. <laughs> oh, I can't skin it. Okay. I was wondering. I think because if you run them over, it's, uh... You can only get them from the hunted ones. You know what I'm gonna do?
you know? I'm wondering... If I should go over to Gordo. She's new in town. So she's not really going to know too much about the uh, zone and the laws and things. So we'll see if anyone explains them to her. So yeah, she is a southern girl. Um, I'm going to say she's from the Ozarks. And she likes hunting. She likes outdoorsy things. She's kind of a roamer, civilian, uh, criminal uh, sort of situation. Yeah, yes, yeah, she is a criminal, petty criminal. thinking God don't get stuck set up camp right here I think So one thing I think I'm going to do is uh, I don't want her to shoot dogs. I think that she would, uh, she draws the line at that. She's not going to be going around skinning random dogs and cats. She's not that psycho.
<laughs> I should probably load the gun. Wabbit season. I don't know. All right. Wonder if we should go down there and skin those. <laughs> Calm down, Elmer Fudd. Listen, all right. I don't know if I should wait for more or if I should go down there and skin them. I'm wondering. Oh, Lord. I'm gonna be eating good tonight. Come. Why? Oh, that's okay. There we go. Any rangers on? I don't know. Do you not get anything from rabbits? <gasps> oh no. I 
I thought that white one was a bait animal. These ones I know were spawned, which is fine. No, I think people are saying you get more than one per bait. You just get a little bit of lard. Maybe it is only one. I don't know. Go ahead and place more then. So I think what I might do, if the rangers show up, I'm going to have them talk to me. I will probably cooperate the first time, right? Ooh, gemstone. Uh, and then the second time she'll know it's bad, but she won't want to give it up. Two things of ammo. Oh, there we go. We're going to pretend like she's ignorant. Um, she just came from a place out east.
She lives pretty off grid. So she doesn't really see a need for anything like a, a license or, you know, a gun license for sure. She thinks it's her God given right to bear arms. Oh God, he did a somersault. She hunts to feed herself. And she enjoys it. something. Thought I heard something. Maybe not. Get Scotch to tell them she ran over the mountain line? Uh, probably not. <laughs> oh, a boar. I don't know if anyone's getting reports. And I don't know how long... take to um, try 
dry. What I'll do before I leave is probably report myself so that someone has a chance to come up here if they want to. Oh yeah, probably do illegal fishing. Uh, no, the, the rifles can't kill people. Um, that was made so that nobody would use them as a sniper rifle, because sniper rifles are very, uh, very powerful in an RP setting. And it can't be something that should be used in that way. Unless you pay a very expensive fee for it. The concern being that, you know, not exactly the best thing for initiating sniper rifles. Generally, generally just not good. <laughs> Do this. Yeah, I don't know. It could be that it's it's Monday, so nobody's really on right now. Or it could also be that they're all looking in the hunting zone and not out here. Which is fair, because I don't do that either very often. But I'm curious if anyone's getting pings. Because we're way out here. It's probably unlikely. Another deer. Come here, Bambi. Boom. Yeah, I'll leave some scenes for sure.
never thought you'd see me hunting? Well, you know. <laughs> we made this character for fun. Messing with the rangers. There's a lot of vantage points that they could have on me, too. They might just be watching. Let me place my bait. I think, is this my last ammo? It might be, I don't know. Might not have ammo for this one. Yes, my last one. Oh, man. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no, I can't fit. Oh. 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 Literally. Okay, perfect. Amazing.
How much is it worth? Uh... Honestly, I don't know. Waste not. God, I'm so stressed. Why am I so stressed already? I did, I barely did anything. Oh, it's horrible. Now the question is, where do we store all this? Which hmm. this great ocean?
crime complete. Sort of. I genuinely don't know what to do with these pelts. Like, I don't know where to... I don't know where to put them. Because yes, I could put them in my apartment, but also... That requires me going back and forth with a bunch of pelts. <laughs> I easily get robbed that way. Yeah, we'll need to keep them in the car, I think. A fishing pole, maybe. I don't have enough. Yeah, we can stop by the lion, see if anything happened with it. Oh. have a bomb. <laughs> Issue is that I don't have storage in this car anymore. The back is full.
just see who's around. <laughs> Can mess with Eric. What the heck? I'll just go ahead and put all this stuff down here so it's not in my way. can I get for you? Hi there. Uh, I was just wondering if y'all would be interested in buying any of the meat I got from hunting. Yes, actually. How much do you have? I have about five steaks and I also have some lard, but I don't know what to do with that. Uh, I'll tell you what. I think uh, they uh, at the mechanic shops, they make use of the lard for uh greasing up cars so you can try to sell it to them however i will buy the meat off of you you said you have a uh, five meat i do uh go ahead and just uh place it on the tray for me This isn't the usual price that people get for meat, but uh, I'm just giving you that because it's the money that I have in my pocket, and I appreciate you coming by because most people don't come by to give us meat. I'll keep that in mind. Um, I'm also Thank wondering where I might be able to sell the uh, pelts that I got. Uh, I, Johnny, you hunt, right? I do not. 
Okay, Eve, you well, hunt, right? Actually, define hunting. Okay. I... Okay, shut up. I'll answer this question. Um, you have to. So the pelts are very, um, very fresh that you just got. So you have to. You can leave them in your car, or you can go go put them somewhere that you have, and you have to leave them there for I think an hour or two, um, for them to dry out a bit, and after that you can go and sell them up in Harmony behind the um, store over there. Um, if you look on your GPS, there's a little marker behind the clothing store up in Harmony um, where you can sell it, and it, you can only sell it during daytime. Well, thank you kindly. I appreciate the information. Of course. Uh, of course. What were your names? Oh, My name's first. Eve. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Sorry. Whatever. Uh, I'm, I'm Johnny. And my name is Adonis Monroe, CEO of Mojito and head of sales at Rooster's Reef. That's and my. He lives here. I don't live here. This is not my he home. Lives, well, it's he kind lives. He lives. He sleeps here. My home because you know it's it, it's my place of business. But like, it, I, I have a I have a house up here already. He's, he he sleeps right there. I don't sleep right there. And also that has changed because Eve says pick, <laughs> a, pick a corner and that that's where I live. But no, I don't live in here. Yeah, just point anywhere and then. No, no, no. Sleeps. I don't. I don't live here. I don't live here. I don't live here. I don't live here. Uh, no, don't, all right. don't pick a corner. I'll, I'll take your word for it. Do not pick a corner. Do not pick a corner. Any place that you point out in this in this store, I do not live here, okay? I live at my home, Polito Boulevard 5. Don't come there. Oh, I have a gun. What? What? Don't point anyone on my property? Jeez. And on, what, what, is, what is that? Castle Doctrine? I have Castle Doctrine of people enter my home. Stop threatening us. I'm not threatening anybody. I'm making I'm giving you a forewarning that if you come into my house unannounced, you might get shot with a gun. Well, how can hey, you cast a doctor if he's just here? using his uh right God given right to bear arms? You see, hey, that's what I like to hear. God given right. You're so scary, Adonis. I'm not scary. I'm not a scary person at all. How am I scary? You're so scary. Yeah, uh, when the hell did you get bear arms? No, I no bear is a bear is a verb. Huh? I'm pretty sure bear is an animal. I've seen a bear. Okay, where where did you see a bear? Boris is literally a bear. Oh, that's true. Boris is a bear. I forget yeah. that Boris is a bear because <laughs> what? He's so domesticated. Just because he wears clothes. Okay, yeah, okay, Eve, listen to yourself. Just because he wears clothes. He's still a bear. He can't Have you talk. Ever seen he just grunts. In the history of anything, wear clothes. Yeah, yes. Pierre. Who the fuck True is Pierre? Pierre? The foreign exchange bear. The, the foreign exchange bear that he exchanged with Boris for like a week. Okay. Have you seen any bears besides those two very, very rare bears wear clothes? Paddington. Who the fuck is Paddington? Gurgle and Winnie Paddington the Pooh. Bear. Winnie the Pooh. Okay, yeah. these are fictional characters. Oh, how dare you! Uh, <laughs> how, how dare how you? Is it, how is it offensive for me to say Winnie the Pooh <laughs> is a happening? fictional character? He's my hero. He is fiction. He can be your hero. You can you can believe in the ideals that have been produced to you by that media, but it doesn't change the fact that he's a goddamn fictional character. I can't believe you've done this first big what? toe, and now Winnie the Pooh. For, wait, what do you mean first big toe? What is... <laughs> you're ruining all my. Would, you're would you ruining all my my heroes for me? I didn't. I didn't do anything to ruin Big Toe for you. Big Toe did that. Yeah, but you still idolize Big Toe secretly. Because he's a many man. <laughs> he, because he's a many man. He, he's from Cancun and all this stuff. Oh, wait, no. Shut up, Adonis. What? This is making this worse. I'm not making this worse. Big Toe is just a phenomenon, and I'm sorry that I have to support him, but his music's too good. Wow. Yeah, where's he now, huh? I don't know. He he left us. I gotta take this. He's probably hanging out hey, with Fred, Winnie the up? Pooh. He's not hanging out with Winnie the Pooh. Hey, what's going on, Fred? I'm sorry. What any strange that. individual? I'm right. right. Anyway, um, your name is? Oh, nice to meet you. My name is Emma Jean 
thread well. Nice to meet you, Emma Jean. I just got asked if I wanted to step on someone. Huh? It was Fred. You know, you know how Fred is. You need. Uh, he needs. You, he needs Fred, to pay Frederick for that. Dutton. Yeah, yeah. He needs to pay for that. I mean, I just said no. Who pays for that? Yeah. <laughs> who who pays for that? Yeah. Who pays for that? <laughs> <clears throat> Oh, why'd you clear your throat, Adonis? Adon how was Adon How am I a bully? How did I bully? Any oh, because of the Winnie the Pooh thing? Yeah. It's not... I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Winnie the Pooh is not real. God. I mean, he could be. I could be wrong, actually. Even I have seen some crazy things in the city. <laughs> like, that man driving through uh, Dean World at fucking like 200 miles per hour on his bat bike. What about the Bernstein Bears or the Bernstein Bears? I don't know why you were bringing timeline. up more bears that are fictional. Oh my god. I <laughs> think <It's> not... <laughs> Yogi the bear. Yeah. He wears a tie. Let me get a bigger bear. I don't care how you speak. He's still a fictional. I don't, like, what do you, what, what do you want me to say? He's he's still a fictional bear. Like, it's 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 not, you know, it, that doesn't change the, the, the fact that you can do the yogi voice. Does not mean that he's 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 real. It's just a, he's a he's a character. But I saw him on TV. Yes, in a fictional, yes, fictionally. I guess I've never used the word fictionally yeah. before, but it would it would work in okay. this in this case. So yeah, I understand because you know he's he's on a, a show that okay. you could consider him fake, but no, that's not what I'm saying. Actor. I'm not saying I'm not saying that he's fake because he was on a show. I'm saying that he's fake because it's a fictional bear. And if it's not a fictional bear and it's in live action, then he's wearing a then the person is wearing a costume. No, it's it's a bear acting as you know, a bear that likes picnic baskets. What? <laughs> no, it's a human what is this conversation? Acting as a bear. Who likes picnic baskets? Baskets. I that was hard to say for some reason. Why would a human want to act as a bear? For money? Yeah, but you know, I that doesn't that seem wrong? It's just like No, it I, doesn't actually, because acting is a profession. Yeah, but you can actually give that to a bear that knows how to act. But then the bear won't be able to speak. But Yogi Bear speaks. Because it is a human who acts as a bear. Even, even if you could find the most talented bear that you could ever find in life or history, you would still need a human to speak for them. You would still need a human to do a voiceover for them. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I've I've birds talk it on us. Explain that. Birds? Okay, no, no, no. There are certain birds that are able to mimic vibrations and sounds very easily. That doesn't mean that they talk. They, they literally talk. They, they don't know what they're saying. They're just, they, they are just. They do know what they're saying because they, they know what not... to ask for. What? Okay, what do you ask birds, Eve? I don't How think birds is real. I'm what? Sorry? I think they just saw government drones. Okay, I'm not going to disagree with that. Okay. I don't know why you're not disagreeing. Birds are living, breathing animals they're not government drones there can be a government drone yeah. bird but birds that you see in the sky that you see fly around are absolutely living animals you shoot them down and they bleed you know what you may be right yeah they they're not drones but what if they're government agents but see, yeah they turn into birds okay no okay. <gasps> they're you animorphs they're, animorphs are not is anything real to you, Adonis? You're just yeah. saying everything is yes, fake. real things are I, real. Animals I Am I real? Of, I, I read yes, a book about real. that. Well, I think you're real. I, I okay. read a book about Here it. Here we go. You think I'm real. Oh. I mean, I, yeah, you seem real to me. You know, if I if I were to, like, if... Okay, I'm not going to say if I would do it, but if you were to get hurt and you bled, then you would be real, you know? Like, bleed, if you bleed, you know, you're real. Like, you, you ever pop a, pimp, a pimple and you pop it, like, maybe too early and it starts bleeding? Does that happen to you? <gasps> My face is clear okay but you, okay that that's irrelevant to i have, have you, no okay. blemishes have you ever had a pimple <laughs> no ever no it's weird you might not be real what you might not be real oh. i'm not gonna oh okay i, I have got, to I agree i think that's that's pretty abnormal 
That is odd. <laughs> what what about Fozzie Bear from the Muppets? What? Who? Why would I, I don't well, okay, think wh- that's a bear. What's I think that's about... a Muppet. Exactly. Exactly. You literally just said it's a Muppet, but but let me ask you. He's, I let me inquire. He's a, he's a bear though. He is the pic he's a Muppet depicting a bear. He's not a real bear. He's a he's a he's a puppet. What's the M in in Muppet stand for? What what two words are they combining? Mask? No. no. I don't know. But they're they're it's, he's a puppet. Oh, that actually might be true. Uh he's a musical puppet. I think you hate bears. I, look, I <laughs> don't have an issue with bears i'm not gonna say i love bears because i feel like most bears would kill me daisy by the way thank you for the 37 months and uh you mind me thank you for the i think if uh, three months welcome back if the bears just vibing then it's not really an issue you know i then i don't have the problem with the bear but the bear if the bear is like unchill very 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 not chill and running after me trying to murder me then i might be inclined to dislike the bear that's all i'm saying Does that does that make sense? Like generally, I feel like people don't like things that are attacking them. Is that is that a correct assessment for me to make? Unless it's something cute and fluffy, like okay, a bear. Some, things can be cute and fluffy and still like attacking you. Like raccoons. Raccoons are adorable. If you disagree, you're wrong. Raccoons are adorable, but then they go. <laughs> <laughs> what noise did they make? <laughs> then they go. <laughs> they like. <laughs> Like they just they make the most like devilish noise ever. I think ever, that was really accurate. Cute. Like exactly right. Like a raccoon is adorable. They have their little opposable thumbs and and they hold things and stuff. And they're like little like trash pandas. But then they they make that noise at you, and then you just like you know, you know, you know yeah. Like they're scary. They're scary motherfuckers. And I don't want to get banned by a raccoon and get rabies because that's gross. Well, just get your rabies shot right now, and then you should be good. Then you can cuddle okay, it. I shouldn't need to get a rabies shot. Okay, it's not like <laughs> I'm gonna get a rabies shot and then prepare. Like, oh my god, now I can get bitten by wild animals. I still don't want to get bitten by wild animals. I feel like that's very reasonable of me. Nah. Okay, Eve, your rabies shot is to get. Actually, I think I think it's supposed to get rabies after like, out of your system after you get bitten, but like. You're not supposed to like get a rabies shot and say, "All right, let me pet every wild animal, and if they bite me, it's not an issue." It's not like a. That's yeah. how it works. No, yeah, okay. Even if that's how it works, I'm not sure entirely, but it shouldn't be what you do. I'm safe. Define safe. Do you think getting bitten by an animal is safe? No, of course not. I work for Spider Man. What? He got bit by a spider. You became a superhero. Can't argue that. You know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? I actually can't. I actually cannot argue that because you know my typical argument of it's fake or it's not real can't apply because I've actually met Spider Man. So you've met Spider Man? Yes, I met Spider Man. Uh, what? Was, yeah, there was a time, uh, a long time ago, actually, maybe like a fucking a year or and a half ago. Uh, Danny had just been sent to the ICU for something that happened, and I was I was mourning, literally fucking sad. And Spider Man was like, <laughs> Spider Man walks in, and he's just like, "What's up?" I, I, I never expected Spider Man to be so casual. I thought he would be like a so heroic. Hello, citizen. What seems to be the issue? But no, no, no. He's very casual. He's like, "Yo, what's up? What's going on?" Very down to earth, really. Actually, damn it, Spider Man. Mm. A lot of things that i didn't think i would meet and that i thought were, were not real you know what mm. actually that's a good point i've met a lot of things that i thought at one point were not real you know i've watched many people get stabbed by chucky uh from the rugrats no. <laughs> oh yeah i was there that day that no, was crazy not, not chucky from the rugrats it was ha- the it was doll. like halloween week yeah yeah uh it was it was around that time. Wait, do you think these people? Do you think these were just people in costumes, Eve, or do you think these were like? Because it, these all this all did happen during Halloween week, huh? Yeah. They may have just been costumes. Okay, then I well, then I then I stand then I stand by it. Spider Man isn't real. I said it. Spider Man oh, wears okay. a costume. 
Yeah, but not a Halloween costume. It's his real suit. And to be fair, the suit did look pretty real, but it, it lines up. Halloween week, we saw a lot of things. I saw Chucky. I saw... Well, no, I didn't see him, but I heard about uh, Michael Myers making an appearance by, from Monty. You remember Monty Eve? Joker. Um, oh, my God. Was was he... Uh, who was Michael Myers? Remember Joker kidnapping oh, everybody? I don't remember that, actually. No way. Was he pretending to be Austin Powers? Who, Joker? No, Michael Myers. Oh. No, he was just... Or was I, 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 I didn't Angel. see him. I just heard stories about him. From like people who were he would he would invade people's homes and try to kill them. Monty came to the market. He was fucking. He was he was livid. He's like, oh my god, oh my god, I almost died. All British like because that's how Monty was British. Remember how British Monty was? Eve. British. Yeah, he's very British. In it. British in it. I feel like that might be. Is that offensive? <laughs> is, do, do, are, are British people offended by us saying in it and, and goddamn uh, oi? <laughs> or is that is that Australian? I don't know. I'm done with that topic. Anyways, <laughs> um, I met Spider Man, but now I'm convinced after all this time, even though I've been professing the story, that it might have been fake. He might have been a fake Spider Man. But I did see him web, web swing. So I'm also inclined to believe that it was real. I, I, I don't know. Maybe. Were you high? I was not high. Uh, I think this man was high. I was. I have to think about it. If I, it's high. I, I think, think he's he high was. right now. I'm not high right now. Yeah. I haven't. I haven't. Okay, I shouldn't be high. I should be off of the stuff. But um, why are you questioning if you're high or not? So you because I high. had a nice weekend. Okay, I had a nice weekend. Oh, okay. And so you're I may questioning have if you're high you. or not, but you're I not be, questioning no, the I'm fact not questioning that bears I can talk. Be high. Okay, well, first of all, those are two completely different things. One is completely plausible for me to be high because I definitely did snort something this weekend. Second, uh, bears. Wait, what was your? You know, bears can snort stuff too. <laughs> yes, I, I do I know that. Yeah, bears... bars was high on cocaine. Okay, well yeah. that feels like it feels wrong. It feels very, very wrong, actually. Who gave Boris cocaine? He stole Stag's cocaine out of his backpack. Well, at that, at that point, then. I mean, it's not, the, it's not Boris's fault. He didn't know any better, but, like, you know. Well, what do you mean? He, he probably knew exactly what he was doing. What? Why would Boris know, hey, I'm snorting drugs? I think he ate it. Oh. Mm, that's... Is that... Does that have the same effect? Uh, he was out of it. I, think you, I thought he was dying, but he wasn't. Out of it how? What did he do? He was running around like crazy. I think he was trying to maul people. Nancy! Hi. Hello! Hi. Hello! So... Adonis thinks I'm not real. That's not, that's not true! Yeah. That's not how? true! That, that, is, that is missing! I think we're just having a... A whole discussion on you. what is and is not real exactly. in general. It was pretty existential. It wasn't about Eve not being real. Why are you actually, targeting Eve? I'm not actually no because she said something weird, which was uh, she said that she's never had acne ever in her life, and I was like, when we were on the topic of things that were real or not, and I was like, you might not be real because I feel like it's pretty standard to at least get one blemish on your face at least once in your life. Some people are just perfect. That's that's true, but I just I, I've never heard of it. So Eve is the first perfect person that I've met. Which kind of checks okay. out. I'm, I'm gonna walk out then. Ask what? What you've never gotten? Wait, I'm just confused. I don't know what he's mad about. Anyways, I guess he I'm not perfect. <sighs> I guess he's not perfect. Um, by the way, could I get a combo meal, please? Oh yes, absolutely. What combo are you are you looking for? Uh, probably the soothing. Relaxing combo. I got you. I can do that for you. Uh. Okay, what is your state ID? You want my government number? Yes. I hate this thing. One moment. Okay. Or or if you if you if you can uh pay in cash, I can charge you at the register. I'll just I'll cover I'll cover both meals because I'm gonna be grabbing a meal as well, if you don't mind. Mm -hmm. Checks out. Alright, uh Nancy, what I kind of comment do you that. do? 
I am I'm so hungry, so anything that would really fill me up would be amazing. A filling combo. Your, your heartiest meal, please. I will get you our heartiest meal. What is Thank your you. state ID? 7856. 7856. All right. Charge should be coming Thank over you. and I will get that made for you guys. Thanks. I love the renovations, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh it's really Archie, good. Uh, my friend Archie and I uh, put it together. It, it actually came out really well. Yeah, it's amazing. Thank you. Nancy. Archie is using the large storefront to like um, map out one of the redesigns for um, the clubhouse. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, how's that going? Wait, oh, he, he yeah, he showed me. Does it look cool? Which, which clubhouse again? Mayhem clubhouse. Uh, yeah, we're killing street. time right now. Oh, I, so I just didn't want to continue doing Wait. stuff by myself. No, I think that's a bigger conversation. <laughs> with Mayhem has had that clubhouse. Mayhem has had that clubhouse for a long time. So that's not the one that was all the mess was about. No, it's about the hardware store. It's a hardware store. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. All right. Easy enough. We can shoot out someone. Oh my god. Yeah, this looks amazing. Thank you. Maybe I'll pop down and see the showroom later and see what Archie's doing as well. Yeah, he's been he's been mapping it out. Hell yeah. I'm glad it's getting used. Same. I'm glad Archie's a... Uh... I thought he would just help me with Mojito in and then kind of give up, but he's actually been doing a lot of stuff. I'm pretty sure he's done like everybody's house up here at this point. I feel like all the decorators are finding all the new stuff in the catalog, mm -hmm. and then they're just <laughs> either True. reigniting their passion or discovering it for the first time, which is adorable. Yeah, or just like absolutely starstruck. I was. Mm -hmm. you know, like, uh, I'm I'm not an interior decorator. I really just like put my foot down to make this place. But like, um, when I saw you did like, great I, like, Adonis. thank you, I appreciate it. Every day, I would just see something new pop up in the catalog, and I was like, this is insane, and uh. Now everything is uh now everything has its own uh, catalog like sorting and it's like I don't have to I don't have to look at uh, the section anymore. Uh, twenty two months. Mm hmm. Uh, by, oh, yeah, you guys already picked your food. Oh yeah, I mean I saw it right there on the tray. No, I was no. like I might as well just grab it. All right. Well, thank you guys for supporting the Mojito Wayne, where the taste is great within. Absolutely. I gotta go do my storefront stuff, but I had to step in for a bite. Um, I'll yeah. see you guys in a little bit. Okay. Have a good thank one. Thank you for Bye the food. Nice. Nice. Love you guys. Hey Billy. Oi, when did you get a katana? What? When did you get when did you get a katana? When you became rich. <laughs> True. This motherfucker is loaded now, isn't he? Oh, you're welcome for the food. Sorry, I didn't yeah. mean to donut while you. <laughs> That's all right. Okay, bye. I appreciate the conversation, y'all. Of course, of course. I'm gonna head out. Good one. You take care. Bye. Thanks for coming up here. She's so stompy when she walks. This vest makes her look like she has really broad shoulders, too. I hope all my stuff is still here. I'm going to be really sad if not. <gasps> it is. Yay. So we got our food. Prime things. Prime things. I need I need a mentor. much gas is. I don't know. I think I can get the car fixed here. Maybe. No.
I knew this one? I don't actually. Yes, yes. Very funny, chat. Very funny. Pepe left. She doesn't know. Fifteen. Okay. All right. We're not doing I'm gonna go to Harmony and look around at the like hardware store and stuff. Grab a couple things. Um, we got $500 for the meat. We had five pieces of meat. So, pre premise of the character. So, basically, um, I want her to be kind of a petty criminal. Uh, we just got to town, so I'm not trying to be too psycho yet. <laughs> I kind of want to see if she can make any kind of friends. Um, but generally she's kind of a lives off the land kind of individual. Um, she likes to hunt. She likes to fish. She currently doesn't have any licenses. She doesn't have a criminal record. She doesn't have a profile. I made the characters because I want to do, um, mess with the new rangers. Oh, I owe a gifted sub. Hold on. But I also want her to go through the process of learning that what she's doing is illegal. All right. There we go. I don't think she's got any kind of backstory yet. I kind of want to go with the fact that maybe she thinks birds are drones. She thinks that the whole island is under a dome. She's 
kind of a doomsday prepper sort of. Oh my god, everything's so expensive. Oh. Alright, we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to wait. Maybe sell our pelts first. My bad. Hey there. Hello. You work here? Yeah. What's up? I was told that I might be able to sell my animal lard from hunting. Animal lard? Um, you in the market? Uh, I we buy it. I just don't know how exactly we go about this. I've never actually bought it before. I got about 15. Uh, maybe he'd be able to help you. And maybe he knows more. I legit don't know how, how, how this goes. Heads up. I got some animal lard from hunting. I was wondering if y'all's interested in buying it. Uh, we don't normally buy it, but what are you wanting for it? We just... Hunters normally just give it to us, to be honest. But uh, yeah, if you're wanting something for it, how much are you wanting for it? I'll be honest with you, I am broke. I just got into town. I'm looking for ways to make some money. I went hunting. Yeah. And uh, I, I'm a waste not want not kind of girl. I think. No, nah, uh, I totally get that. Just trying to figure out what to do with everything I got. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, so you normally play, uh, places won't really pay for animal lard, uh, but if you wanted some cash, I can give you some cash for it. How many? How many you got? I got about fifteen. Fifteen. Okay. Anyways. Hello. What's up? Sure. All right. I'll see you. Trade for truck repairs? No, I think the truck being damaged is funny. <laughs> there you go. I appreciate that. No, no, you're welcome. 
Thank you very much. Is there anything else y'all need around here? Uh, we always do need animal art because not many people have been hunt hunting recently and we need it for our polishes though. Um, and if you get your meat, I think we take the meat as well. And How much you sell it, really. it for? Uh, you, you sell buy the meat? for, I mean. <laughs> it's more of the same thing. People just, you know, just give us the meat. So I'll probably, probably be, uh, the meat would be a bit less because, you know, the food's not that expensive up here. So. I see. Probably like, yeah, yeah, 50, it's probably like 50 bucks per or something like that. So it's not nothing too crazy. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, unfortunately, the main money in the hunting is all in the pelts, not in uh, the lard or the meat. All right. Well, I appreciate the information. Thank you. No, no, you're welcome. I'll get out Hope of you your hair. What in the capitalism is... They don't bother me. What? Kind of dystopia we living in. She said about one hour. <laughs> I have no idea if this is going to work. Little more time. Whee! Oh, someone else. I don't want to get robbed. fill our time with. Ah! Okay. I guess. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Jesus. It seemed a bit like desync, but I don't know, man.
bring this down to the city because it's got all my pelts in it. <laughs> I don't want to get them stolen. Uh, no. I can't store anything. I'm sad. Ooh, you know, I could go fishing, actually. That's what I'll do. We'll go out there and fish. I wonder if anyone's out there. You think? Yeah, we're living out of our car. Living out of our car, RP. Well, we have an apartment, but here's the thing. I don't... It feels ridiculous to go to my apartment and carry a bunch of pelts in and out of... Like, it's not very discreet. And not to mention, if someone saw me doing that, I'd most likely get robbed. Yeah, we gotta save up for a camper. And learn uh, probably where to get lockpicks and stuff. a place in grapeseed well i have to be able to afford a place first i gotta i gotta grind we're grinding now chat and we're probably gonna get caught with this doing fishing i have a feeling i have a feeling this might get us Woo! wicked is fine. She's just... Uh... Yeah, we'll make it. We'll make it. I'm sure of it. Yeah, we have a fishing rod. It's right here. Nah, no treble hooks.
What the heck? There we go. Truck is just far enough away. To not raise suspicion. Country music playing in the background? Here, hold on. So, chat, what do you think we should get up to? What do you think that we should do with this character? It's kind of a blank slate right now. Rob a bank? Well, I can't. Okay, I literally just made the character. She cannot just rob a bank. Okay. Leave animal bodies at beaver bush. Okay, well, why do you want her to be a psychopath right off the bat? I want... I want her to have a reason for doing stuff. I, I want... So... Maybe eventually she'll get a little crazy because these government people are overstepping on what she's trying to do. But... I think we might need to wait a little bit before we jump to that. <laughs> yeah, we'll save that for after she starts getting harassed by the police. How about that? I'll leave the option open. I think over time she'll eventually get fed up with it. Bodon had a suggestion. I did not see it. Bodon, can you say it again? Mm 
Not get caught, get bored, switch to Tesla and ignore it forever. Oh yeah, that sounds reasonable. Sovereign citizen, maybe. I think that's kind of how I'm going to play it when she does get interacted with. She doesn't need any licenses, any government things. She's kind of off-grid. I think for now she's got that kind of southern hospitality going on but once the city starts doing what the city does eventually she's gonna get to a point where she's just not nice anymore especially to police or anyone from the government inconvenient to throw away the phone and ID. Honestly, there's so much in the city that relies on the phone. I genuinely don't think it's the best thing in the world. And even just mechanics wise, it's not ideal. I know it would make sense for the RP, but I think it's just too much that relies on the phones. Knowing who's around, being able to contact people, you know. I think we would just not have a good time if that was the case. She has Bigfoot feet. Hey, rude. Phone in a foil bag. <laughs> That's a good idea. No, she's not been called Tessa yet. <laughs> I'm 
There are a lot of birds. I'm gonna have to go get more ammo. Redneck version of Breaking Bad, start a small drug illegal hunting operation. <laughs> I do think she'll probably get into meth at some point. Yeah, Kirk would be a good one. We'll go to the uh, hunting shop and grab some more ammo, I think, so we can shoot down birds if we need to. I think that would be funny. What y'all doing Hello. out here? Hello. Panning? Panning for... For what? For gold. For gold. I see. Yo, yeah. What are you doing? Well, I was just fishing out up the way. Oh, okay. Saw your car. Thought I'd ask what y'all's doing. Yeah, we panning. We catch any little fishies, we just let them go, you know, the way of the water. Interesting. Where do you get them, uh, them gold pans from? Gold uh, Rush? Like gold Rush, yeah. It's across from, kind of like by Hayes. Hayes. There's like a big open sign on it, and they cost like, usually they only have the large, so they cost like 32000 What in the... For a gold yeah. pan? Yeah, investment. but you honestly, you make your money's worth because you make up to like, well, usually for me. What, you fishing like up gold money. bars in there or something? Yeah, uh, actually. Yeah. What? Again. I am in nuggets, the wrong chains. line of work. I mean, you do not want to know how much we've made off of a gold pan. I, I think I might want to know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a million. Oh, a million for sure. Miles lowered. Yeah, I made like one point five. Pirates. Ah. Yeah, there, there's pirates. Pirates come around too when they try to take your booty. 
All right. What's your name? I, I think I'm about to come a prospect or something. I, I don't know. Uh, my name is Emma Jean. Uh, Emma Jean Threadwell. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Call you me Zeus. Zeus and Crystal. Yeah. Nice yeah. to meet you. Appreciate the information. I uh, just came into the city. I'm awful new, looking for things to do. I'm pretty outdoorsy, so this kind of thing is sort of up my alley. But I, I prefer hunting, fishing, living off the land. You know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I mean, if I ever get like a small pen or something, I'll just toss it your way. I I would appreciate that. Uh. Huh. Yeah, there's a uh, there's small, medium, and larges, but usually they never really stock the smalls and the medium. The How much is the small largest. one? Like five thousand. That is very interesting. It's not, it's not worth it though, unless you get it for like free. Usually you could dig up some pans with the with the, with the large pan sometimes. All right. Getting well, a pan from a pan. Okay, I will keep that in mind. You said Gold Rush was the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Rush, across from Hayes. Hmm. It's like in that little plaza area. All right. Well, I appreciate the information. You two have a good day. Good luck out here. Don't get uh, great day as well. pirated, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Bye. 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 Uh, it is legal to pin. That's actually... That is so depressing. I'm so sad to hear that. Like... Yeah. The gold pan stuff. Because I don't want to rob the gold painters. I want there to be something... I don't know. pirate arc well i don't know just given that she's alone i think it's a bad idea she also gave them her name Ooh. yeah i'm not trying to make everyone my enemy right now It makes me sad though that gold panning is a uh, super low consequence and they've made a million dollars off of it. The only real consequence right now is people robbing, which was not really my intention with the character per se. do that we're gonna do five Get some more bait while we're here
Yeah, we can sell the fish. I wonder if the pelts are ready now. I just kind of wish there was some, like, cop aspect of gold painting that was not just being sad that people just got robbed. You know, we can't... It's very hard to investigate people robbing people at the panning locations because... Um... It's just... I don't know. Actually, I'm gonna go back this way because I need to get gas. Woo! Yeah, I'm gonna have to look up like, um, gold panning regulation like IRL see if maybe we can get the cops involved in some other way but I also don't want to squeeze gold panning so hard that nobody wants to do it anymore right because I get RP out of dodo stuff right I can pull people over and I can give them a fine, etc. And I can... I can have that. With panning, it's not as easy for me to get out there. Um... I'll put a little bit in. License required for gold painting and gold mining. Yeah, I guess because it's on state land, we could... We could make that argument. There's any cop interaction. 95% of people never talk to cops. Well, I mean, people talk to me when I do hunting checks, fishing checks. I think that's a bad way to look at it. I'm sad because it replaced hunting and fishing. And it's worth more. I'm trying to think of things for the rangers to do and the cops to do up north. Oh, 
No, I don't think we need part of their findings or anything. I think that makes things too convoluted. I also don't think putting a time limit on it is good either because, uh... I don't like the time limit on hunting. I never liked that change. What's the hunting time limit? Uh, it's only at night. You can only hunt at night, which is silly. In my opinion. The illegal moonshine operations would be fun. Yes, it would make more sense to only hunt during the day. <laughs> I don't know why they made that change for the nighttime hunting. It doesn't make sense to me. I don't know why. I don't want to leave the car anywhere. I think I can just sell all my fish.
<laughs> oh, you know what we could do? Net. I didn't even see. I don't know how much I just got from that. Not a lot. Really not a lot. Okay. Well. This is, this is a tragedy, man. It's so sad. I... Why aren't fish worth anything? Why isn't... What happened, dude? Yeah, I know the illegal fish sell for a lot more, but like, also, why is there no payoff for doing things legally? That's, that's kind of my issue. Because with gold panning, you get a huge payout. Like, massive payout. There's a better way down. Hello. Hello. Hey what you doing? I was looking for a place to put down my fishing net. Oh. oh, what? You got a fishing net? 
Yeah. Spiro. It's Don't do that you, to man. Me. We have oh, the number one um, fishing expert right here. Yeah, but I don't use guy, a net. There's no this skill guy in that. Right here is like fishing master. He's won like about ninety percent of tournaments he's been in. Yeah, I don't use a net though, man. It's all about the rod, you know. You gotta know how to handle the rod. Yeah, the illegal rod. Oh, whoa, whoa, what? What? I mean, allegedly. Oh, allegedly, yeah. The hell is you this, is about, this a good man? spot for your net, ma'am? I I don't know. I didn't have a chance to look. Oh, okay. I noticed y'all down there. I was wondering what she was doing. Yeah, one of hey, our friends. One of our friends fell through the entire like. Dream? Cascades stream and it brought him all the way down it's here, so we had to save him. Is he all right? Yeah, he's, he's all right, right I think so. He's the guy that was just talking. I don't oh, know where he where went. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. I think he disappeared. We might, we might have lost him again, honestly. <laughs> I don't know. You know, fell back into the stream and he's down the river now. Saint! So you, oh, you no. make good money with that fishing net or, or what? I, I don't know, actually. I don't know if this fishing is good down here. Oh, okay. I just got I'll into get town. You. Oh, I get you. I get you. How's, uh... Oh, hey. You, might, you never know what you're going to catch, you know? Oh, my lord. Hey, oh, maybe not a good place to fish. Yeah, maybe... maybe. This is not the best place to, uh, yeah, to go fishing. Yeah. No. I, I just think for you might be safety. right. Just, just you. I don't know what that was. Sounds like an experiment that's one's bad. Hmm. What's, what's, what's your name, ma'am? Uh, my name is Emma Jean. Emma Jean Threadwell. He said Emma? Emma yeah, Jean, Emma Jean. Man. Oh, pleasure to meet you. My name is Evan. This is Spiro. And yes, then the Spiro. Nice to meet you. guy. I don't know where he is. Anyways, I guess we'll we'll let you do it. We're gonna try it's to find our friends. Yeah, I don't know where All right. Am. All right. Good Let's luck. Easy, hope you don't Jean. fall down the river again. I hope. I'll try not to. Shit, I'm gonna on the side of this. <laughs> what did I just come up on? Hello? There is a very good chance that this net will not be here when I get back. I'm actually shocked I didn't get robbed just now. <laughs> They might still, I don't know, we'll see. Oh. Oh. Maybe. Is it too... I don't know. Oh, wait. What the heck? Why could I place it there? What is that? There we go. Easy. We'll see if that uh, does anything. Um. Interesting individuals we have run into today.
She's also being very honest about what she's doing because she has no idea that it's wrong. <laughs> and so far, no one's corrected her at all. No one said anything. Surely... Two hours. I wonder if he'll even accept it. Well, it's so late. Yeah, the fishing nets are not legal. Oh, it's too late. I'm so sad. <laughs> I just want to sell the pelts. This is horrible. This is actually the worst. I'll try the illegal one. I don't know if it works. Yeah, now I have an idea as to why no one would want to hunt. So depressing, man. I'm gonna have words for Sincere in a minute. Blech. <laughs> it's so sad. I just, like... First of all, I didn't get a response at all. I hunted for an hour. I left a trail. I called 911 when I left. I've driven around with these pelts in the back of the car for two hours. I can't, I can't put anything else in the back of the car because it, they gosh dang weigh a b gazillion pounds. Is all my storage is one night of hunting. <laughs> what the heck, man? What the heck is this? What the heck? What in the heck? I didn't know it was this bad. Oh. He tried to tell me a long time ago. I know. Listen, I knew it was bad. I, like... <sighs> I'm just sad because I want this character to have a little bit of money before I get utterly destroyed. So that she can buy a couple things. Um... I didn't want to do jobs that don't make sense. <laughs> And I can't afford a gold pan. It's just, it seems so potato.
You know what? What do you want? What? Was he talking to me? I don't know if he was talking to me. I think... I think I am just gonna go hunting again because... The, the whole point of this character is to get caught hunting. I could hunt on that hill. It's dangerous up there, though. We're gonna go a little further out this way, I think. Bison not very good. Bison not very good at going up hills. No, the pelts are still good. Um, I can sell them. However, 
I have to wait another hour. <laughs> so on top of the two hours I have already waited to sell them, I have to wait one more hour with them in my trunk, which I can't, I can't really store them anywhere. Um... I could, I could store them. However, the most awkward place to store them is the apartments. And that's the only place I have that I could store them. Oh, I need to reload, don't I? I'm learning it's an awkward process is all. I think most people use a vehicle when they hunt. Uh, that they can just park somewhere. So this is a rental for me. I wonder if boar is worth more than deer. No, I can't put them in the glove box. I... I guess I could just put the pelts on the ground when I get them. So I don't want to get rid of my dried ones. Oh, this is a horrible spot. I hate it. Is it down further? No. Yeah. Uh, yes, the reset will delete all my pelts, but it's not in 15 minutes, it's in like two hours. Yeah, I don't know how much the pelts are worth, so maybe the cooldown is for a point? Like, I just, I don't know.
Oh no, my dear. No. I think I just scared away my deer. Ooh. Oh god. Heck. Heck. <laughs> yes, we've accomplished today. But hunting and fishing are not actually as fun as I thought they were. Please, just place the bait. Oh. Bro. Bro, okay. I can't. I can't. What is happening? Uh, Soul is Adrian, by the way. Thank you for the 46 months. And, uh, Oliols, thank you for the sub as well. Welcome. Did I scare it away again? <gasps> oh. Another boar. Oh, it fell. I don't know where these rangers are.
or any cop for that matter. Wait, I hear something. I for sure heard something. But where? Am I just crazy? Where are they? Where is my critter? Where is my critter? Wonder if I scared it away. <gasps> oh, my critter. Boom.
Oh my god. Look at all those drones. Flying Stylus, thank you for the two gifted subs. I appreciate that. Alright, well, I admit this has not been the most, uh, oh, this is a three-star, hold on. Uh, this has not been the most exciting thing. Um. I was really not expecting it to be this rough it is it's definitely a learning experience i had i known it would have been it's gonna be like this i might have tried to socialize a little bit more ahead of time <laughs> i don't know man Enjoying me actually getting to play, not hounded by constant duties. Well, I mean, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> it is a good change of pace. I just... I thought there would... I thought there would be more happening with this sort of stuff. Land, thank you for the gifted sub, and Joe Kitty, thank you for the 12 months. Gotta shoot some of these burps. Some of these horrible drones. Oh, it ran. What's the rundown on the character? Well, she is a... Southern girl. She likes to do outdoorsy things. She likes to live off the land. She likes hunting, fishing. She dislikes the government having a hand in most things, so she doesn't have any of her licenses. Um, she's never really been told not to hunt or fish. Because her whole life she grew up, um, you know, being able to do that on her, her family's land. Uh, but they also lived off-grid and they didn't have their licenses either. And I've been leaving trails and things. She thinks birds are government drones. Spying on her. <gasps> oh! I got one! I 
I've been hoping that like a cop would come up here. I have a trunk full of pelts that are all illegal considering the fact that I do not have a hunting license. Should not be here. Her name is Emma Jean Threadwell. Named after Emma Jean Threadgood from Fried Green Tomatoes. I don't think anyone's coming, chat. Uh, Sunday morning, thank you for the prime. Uh, no, we can't sell the pelts. I think we have to wait until, like, morning. But, uh... Yeah. We put a net down, up this away. I'm gonna go check on it. Was it up this way? I don't Maybe further up. It's here. I've seen a total of one cop out here today in the like north area and I think they were a part of a chase that was already ongoing so I'm sad. <laughs>
that's a cool forty-five dollars. I tell you what. <laughs> Oh no. Ah! Okay. We have 1097 in the bank. I don't want this yet. Come back later. Sir? I am about this close to decking you in the face. <sighs> what? For what reason? I don't understand. I'm s Okay. How much did I make from that? <laughs> okay. Okay. Keep in mind, I spent $500 on the truck. I don't know how much I spent on gas. $300 on a net. Uh, $500 on... $500 on a fishing... Uh, or not a, a hunting rifle. Probably another $500 in bait. At least a hundred on a fishing rod. <laughs> yeah, and I got someone paid for my food. They took pity on me. <laughs> that would have been another 400. <laughs> what, is <laughs> what is happening, man? What is happening? We're down bad. We're just down bad. That's it. And I'm not, I'm like not trying to hide anything either. I've told people what I'm doing. I've been driving like an idiot the whole time. Yeah, I left breadcrumbs. I called 911 on myself twice. <laughs> what do I do? 
What? What is happening? Why is this a thing? I guess I'll perma. And not only that, there is a distinct possibility right now that these pelts, that, that I won't be able to sell these pelts before the server restart. And they're just going to go into the void. And I'm going to cry. <laughs> and I don't know. I'm really upset. I'm going to cry, man. Oh. <laughs> Why did I bother doing this all day? But <laughs> I hate it. Heck you, Bambi. <laughs> uh, TD presents. Thank you for the uh, ten gifted subs. The community are amazing. See why the guy ended up stalking us instead. I know. I feel. I feel like I have to stalk the rangers now. Uh, I guess. I, <sighs> I could ask someone to store my stuff, but. awkward I could put it in my apartment, but... Well, gosh dang it. bring the pelt to our apartment just for the laugh <laughs> the shriek
All right, chat. God. Oh my god. Oh my god, I hate it. I hate this so much. Actually, you know what? No. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm taking these in there too. These are mine. My fish. Oh my god. What is... I hate this. Why is this so miserable? What a what a miserable experience. <laughs> I can't even hit the bells. Oh my god. This is awful. All right. No one's gonna know. So inconspicuous. Okay, yeah. Alright. <clears throat> These are the spoils of the day, chat. That... okay. This is fine. Where is everyone? Where are all the other humans at? What is happening? Why have I not seen a soul since I've come back into the city? Maybe I can sell the pelts? I don't know. We'll see if we can make it there and if it'll let us, but 
I don't feel confident. It's getting it close. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <clears throat> But that's all right. I, I, I'm so sorry. Could, did you need me to pay for that? Mm. No, I don't, I don't think so. I'm, you sure? I think I'm all right. But I, I do need to sell my pelts here. Mm, all right, what sorts of pelts you got? <laughs> Not too much. Just, you know, uh, deer, or everything you can find out there. Oh, my name, Curtis. Curtis O'Neill. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> oh, oh, nice to meet you, Curtis. Um, my name's Sammy. Um, I, I have a bird watching club. Usually I'm in the yellow pages if you ever need me, okay? All right, watching birds. I mostly shoot them, but, you know, Zach, I can I mean, watch a couple. Yeah, shoot. Uh, I mean, I don't recommend shooting them while we watch them. But well, oh, yeah, but these government drones... So you gotta, you gotta shoot oh, them out God, the air. She's right. God, it's true. Hey. It's true. They got them cameras in them. They're uh, watching you, spying on they you. They knew me. The, the ones in the stores with the glowing red eyes. Yeah, sure. Uh, but the ones that are flying outside. Yeah, no, those are birds. Um, yeah, no, you shoot them. You sure? I've shot them before. They have fat on them. They're not drones. Which technically birds don't really have that much fat on them. Um. They're mostly just, you know, hollow bones, feathers, other type of bones, type I of thing. They got cameras in them. 
Oh my god, but, there's I a mean, timer on it. Why is there a timer? Um, Why? Someone puts cameras on them. But, uh, <laughs> no, but they're birds. Why is there a timer? Mm, Alright, right. I'm interested in your little club. <laughs> Why really? is there a loading uh, bar? Take my phone number, I'll take a look, Z. Okay, uh, it's <laughs> Mr. Curtis, right? Uh, Curtis, that's right, spell with a K. Hmm? Oh, oh, okay, good to know. Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> Surely. Okay. Oh, hopefully, I'm not watching the birds when you shoot at me. <clears throat> hey, you got him. Oh, okay. Have a good day. And you you too. You got anything illegal back there? What you mean illegal? I'm talking about them illegal. I mean, you you seem like a lady of her rights. Mm, you got any, you know, any cougars out there? Any kitties? I did. Fishies? I did. I did shoot a cougar earlier. Ooh, hey. All Who right, are now we're talking. I think I might have one in here. Hold on. Right here. All right. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Most of these city slickers that come out here too scared to act on their rights. I ain't like the rest of them. What's your name, pretty lady? My name is Emma Jean. Emma Jean Thread, uh, Threadwell. Imogene Fred, well, pleasure. Name's I'm, Curtis, Curtis O'Neill, but you overheard that. I'm having the worst day. You having trouble? You know, I'm really upset with this man right here. And I... You hunt before? Well, I've been hunting. It's the first time I've tried making money off it. And mm. I've just had the worst day. And... I, I just saw how much that mountain lion pelt gave me, and I'm a little sad. Oh, yeah, yeah. You comes to learn that crime. Doing these, that's why nobody's scared to do them. Yeah, everybody won't, you know, buy not this because the rangers will who take it for like 10 times what you put in. If you even try, then you don't got a license and it's hard to get it back because you got to do a little thing special course. I could teach you all this if you want. I think that might be kind of nice, actually, having somebody tell me what to do, because hey. you, you're talking about licenses, illegal, legal stuff. I, I don't really... I, hey, I mean, yeah, you got rights, but they want you to be legal with it. Get firearms license, carry your guts. How I got this pretty little thing right license? here, Colt 1911. Surely. Why do you need a license for that? That's your God given well, right to have an, a well, firearm. That's, that's what I said. But the government told me that I gotta go get one so that I can go purchase it authentically with a lot. <laughs> I don't like doing it, but it's what I gotta do to live. You understand? I get that. Hey, I think I might need to get your phone number. Mm, all right, hey, here you are. Hey, take it here. Six two eight five four seven nine three four one. Curtis O'Neill spelled with a K O'Neill. If you ever need anything for me, anything at all, you let me. Know, all right, <laughs> and I mean all anything. Right. Well, it's good to meet you. Is Storm rolling in, or is it like in another hour? I don't know. I think it might be rolling in. All right, roll tide. Have a good one. Oh, wait. Oh, I think it might have already done it. All right. Well, <laughs> what? 
the heck, man? <laughs> 700 per legal pelt. One of them was illegal and it was only the same amount that I got for the deer. All right, chat. I just put on the five times timer. I'm gonna finish eating. Uh, oops, thank you for the uh, 1337 donut, I appreciate that. Mr. Waddlington, again, thank you for the five gifted subs, you're amazing. Um. Man, now that we met him, I don't know, should I... Hmm. Yeah, maybe another day kind of thing. sure if he get, is going to get back in, though.
me see. Keely, thank you for the 10 gifted. I appreciate that. And uh, Bonobi, thank you for the three months as well. Flying Stylus, thank you for the gifted. And uh, Scrumpy, thank you for the 100 biddies. know if that guy is streaming All right, chat. I think I think I'm gonna continue. 
with her. Uh, I'm gonna get up and walk around though. I need a minute. I'll be right back. Uh, thank you, Queso, for the 10 gifted, by the way. And, um... I'm easy to kill. Thank you for the two months. Von Peeper, thank you for the five months. Pyro Herb, thank you for the 11 months. Kiriel, thank you for the five gifted. Or, I'm sorry, Pyro Herb, thank you for the 11 gifted subs. You're amazing. Thank you so much. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay. Chat, you want to know something really annoying? I didn't save the outfit that I had. So the... Oh, no good. Okay, I still have it. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure that I get everything on. Okay. 
Okay, I'm going to save the outfit because I have a phone stuck in my hand and then we'll unblind you. Okay, I still have a phone stuck to my hand. <laughs> I can't. Why do I have a phone stuck to me? It's it, not even in the right hand. Okay, this is what we're dealing with right now. I <laughs> get off of me. Why is it stuck? I don't get it. Switching characters, I'm switching characters. No clear prop didn't work. That was the first thing I did. All right, character swap worked. Oh my god, I did lose the rifle. I'm so mad. Ah! Uh. Ha! Ah. I'm so upset. Curtis. Out of there, Emma! You call me, I didn't know you still around. Sure am. Alright, hey, where's you at? You up in the are you up in the country? Uh matter of fact, no. Funny story, I, I had some stuff down here at the uh apartment that I was just gonna get picked up, maybe bring out uh Ooh, not, all right. not too sure what I'm going to do with it at this point, but, uh, I don't know if you got a ride or nothing. Oh, yeah, I got a ride. Of course I do. I can come pick you up at the apartments. Sure am. All right, Cece, shortly. All right. Bye. <laughs> God, I... <laughs> I'm so upset. Oh, oi, Chihuahua. Oh, there you are. I like I this. In. Oh, you like this? This is, this is my pride and joy right here. I ain't sleep shitting it. I, I can, <clears throat> I could tell. Hey, <laughs> you should get yourselves into these. They're real rival. I just realized that I left uh, my my rifle in that other Ooh, vehicle shoot, I had. 
And oh, 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 you mean that box in it? Oh, that's gone. Yep. That rental company went and swept that right one right up. Mm -hmm. Hey, you go. You gonna learn today? First things first, we gotta get you your own vehicle. Which means we gotta make you money. Are you interested in making money? You interested in uh, well, you are you interested in there, lady? I I wouldn't say I'm interested in making money per se. Just you know, living my life. Uh, I really like the outdoors. I like living off the the land, you know, and I, I don't really care to be too much in the city. I don't care too much either. I still live here. I've been trying to buy a house up there, but every single country, every, every single city slicker has been buying it up in the country, and I ain't too fond of it. Can't even find a house out there for myself. been trying to get the government to give me one, but they won't, so I don't know what I can do. But any hoosies, no, enough about me, what about you? You said you, said you like living off the land, you playing good, trying to get a house up there? I don't know, maybe. I, I kind of like living out of a tent, to be honest. Mm, that's why I live out of this thing. Right now I'm just staying at the apartments because it's a little convenient for me, but I'd rather be just uh, parking it up there in a later. I had, yeah, well, but, I had the play. worst luck, I think. I, I was... <laughs> Tell me I about your day. How'd it go? Explain well, it to me. I, I arrived, and I didn't really know too many people, so not, I, to be honest with you, I'm uh, uh, not the most socially comfortable. It is a so recluse, I understand. I, I did what I do best, and I, I went and I got a rifle as soon as I could. And, uh, I went out hunting. That rifle cost, well, first, I had to rent a vehicle. That vehicle cost me about $500. Then, yep. I had to buy a rifle, which was also another 500 Then I had to yep. buy the bait and all the fixings for that. And that cost yep. me a whole bunch more. And a then, lot of money. And then the man... Down at the pelt sales that I, I learned about from, uh, I think her name was Eve at the Mojito. Mm. I, I tried selling my pelts up there and he said they weren't good enough. I don't know why he's so fussed about having to dry them himself, but... Hey, he has us tan them. And you know, the funny thing about that is you get to take, take them a day and a half. Day and a half for a dang old tanning. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And then afterwards, yeah. if you wait too long, they then rot. Yep. And then I had to uh, carry all them pelts around the whole time. And then I went, I had to buy a fishing rod because I want to go out fishing. And I didn't really see a soul out there. And um, I ran into these people that they was just digging around in the dirt. And mm. you know what was interesting is they said they was making... Like a million dollars from it sure is. from digging in the the dirt out there in the rivers, and I. Uh, I tell you what, digging you talking about? You talking about that metal detective business or that or that uh, shaking with gold the gold panning? Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's it ridiculous. Does. It makes more than any of these things you can do out here combined. And they or told were. me the 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 cost. For that gold pan, thirty thousand dollars. Yep. And then, you know what I did? I went out to, um, I think it was that Harmony place. And then they said, um, they they didn't want to buy the meat off of me. They said that most people just hand them the meat and the lard. And I, I, I tell you what, what? What in the capitalism is that? Yeah, what? hey, yep. You can't make no business off the meat I've done tried. Nobody buys it. Nobody anywhere. They only buy from coralie owned steaks because they're premium and they're from cows and not deer. And, you know, this is me. Oh. Daggum. See, this liquor's ruined everything. Ugh. 
Well, that's about how that goes. Hey, Zaz, you, you've, you've had the experience then, haven't you? <laughs> I, I could well, take, I suppose, I could... but it, it's been interesting to tell you the, the most. Um, and then I, I went out and I got one of them fishing nets from the gentleman who bought the fish off of me. <laughs> and uh, I, I put that in the, the river and he didn't buy them fish for very much. No, he don't. He buy he buy the uh, he buy the bigger ones for a lot more. But uh, even I, that ain't really got worth a, it. That was what was in my apartment. Is this? Uh, I caught me a sturgeon and a sockeye salmon. Ooh, all right, all right. That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Oh, you know, yeah. Your apartment ain't gonna be good for shit for storing that stuff, though. That's why you gotta I get noticed a car. I don't have too much room in there. Nope, no you don't. You don't got nothing for shit for sticks. Yeah, you gotta... What you need to do is you need to get yourself a car for a lot of, a lot of room, like a truck or one of these or something that, uh, that you can put things in, you know, live out of. That's what I recommend, because uh, that, that apartment, it ain't, it ain't gonna cut it. Another thing is that uh, pretty much only the rich can hunt and fish. Or at least hunt, because, uh, hunting, well, the drying times take so daggum long, you ain't gonna be able to store nowhere. So what you gotta do is you gotta throw it in a dirty-ass dumpster until it dries, and after it does, you come pick it up. At least that's what I gotta do. It stinks a, a little dumpster? bit, but Mm-hmm. Throw it in a dumpster, that's <laughs> what I do. But, uh, you gotta be careful not to do it too close to the tsunami, otherwise it'll just wash right out of that thing. I'll keep that well, in mind. So I was just also going to say, there's a company out here that'll just buy them straight off of you for a lot less than what you'll pay. A, a company will buy them? It, ooh, <laughs> sorry. Ow. This thing's built like a shit house brick, so it, you know, it, it can take this thing. This thing sturdy. Mm -hmm. I, I could tell. Yeah, there's a company. I forget its name. I don't know if they're still operating or whatnot, but uh, they normally uh, will just buy pelts off people. They normally advertise there, but I didn't see any of their advertisements up. They, they might not even be operating anymore. I'll be honest, we're a dying breed there, Emma. We're a dying breed. It just costs so gosh darn much to do this thing legally. And getting doing it illegally, it just it puts you in the dirt, and then you can't do it no more. <laughs> Luckily, I know well, how to do it. I appreciate all the information, because I, I definitely want to keep doing it, even if it does put me in the hole, because that's, you know, that's how my daddy taught me. Yeah, well, good luck doing it, because once you're in the hole... Uh, you know, I mean, you can you can store cash under your pillow and whatnot. My my brothers and sisters do that, but um, uh, what I like to do is I try and keep things as clean as possible, at least seemingly. Uh, so I got my license and I got my um, you know everything. But if you're even trying to do this legally, let me t let me let me tell you, uh, <laughs> it ain't it ain't it ain't easy and it ain't really worth it because the hunt license is like thousand dollars or something you know in that ballpark and same with the fishing license they're expensive you gotta get them renewed which means it's gonna cost you if you don't do it too often you gotta buy the gun the bait and all that fancy stuff the knife and if you lose it guess what it's more money out of your pocket and uh, you, you end up coming out with a net you know neutral at the end of the day if you ain't knowing what you're doing <laughs> oh no it's a hard business to get into, and I'm gonna be honest, doing it right is not really the best, you know, best for the mind. Well, I see where you buy from is the lodge. I met this girl last night. You said you lost your gun? Sure did. Alright, I gotta buy bait anyways. <laughs> Let me tell you, I, uh. <laughs> I sullied myself for a week straight. Trying to see, you know, how much money one could make off this stuff, and it ain't that much. Oh, 
Also, let me tell you, there's something I've been trying to get fixed for quite a while, but, uh... You ever try those fishing tournaments? The what? The fishing tournaments. They got tournaments for fishing. You didn't know about them. They're not? Well, let me tell you. <laughs> there's problems with them. Uh, but, uh, if, you know, if they work out, they work out, but, uh... Shoot. Uh, oh, you'll have gangbangers coming up here and holding people up to do them. Occasionally. Because uh, the way they work is that you think that if you're a good fisherman, right? If you, you think that if you're a good one, you know, and you catch the most fish, you get the most money from the tournament, you get first place. That ain't how it works at all. If you sign in with the man first, he just gives you first place. You sign in second, he gives you second place. And people know this. <laughs> <laughs> They'll hold you up until you they sign in first. So I gotta be careful about that. And <laughs> had that happen to me twice. <laughs> what? Bunch of scumbags out here. Yeah, <laughs> what if you want to go fishing? Right here. Now I'm gonna tell you, it ain't worth it doing it legally neither. Those fish sell for like two dollars a pop. I, I noticed. Hey, it ain't worth that the shit. Yeah. But, uh, you know, right. you said you got a, yourself a net up. If you find a nice place to put a couple down, uh, it can be worthwhile. Uh, like I said before, you're going to need a vehicle. Because uh, once you take it out, then they'll start drying. And then you can go sell them to the fishermans. But they will rot in there. And it will degrade eventually if you don't, if you don't keep up on it. All right. It'll make you pretty petty, though. Now, that gentleman off of um, Tongva, so the, I think. Let's see what the fish tournament is. Man off Tongva, the uh, the guy that buys your fish. He turned his nose up to my my bigger fish, and I'm not too sure why. That's because it they need to draw out for some fucking reason. <laughs> I don't understand why he wants them dry, but I guess he, he just locks the way you jerk it, fish. Alright, two what hours, 36 the... minutes is when that next tournament's coming up. What? All right. I don't know if you're going to be I, around that long. I'll tell long, you what, but... this, this city seems a little backwards. Hey, it sure is! You know, getting fucking rocks out of the ground pays <laughs> fucking loads more than a little fishy. Well, even if you're selling it backhanded through the black market. Let me tell you, I well, sat here for a week. Matter of fact, I did, I did find a, a gemstone when I was hunting. What color? What is it? Uh, jade. <laughs> yeah, that's like two hundred dollars, maybe even a hundred. Oh, it's worth shit. Lord. You need a lot of those for it to even be worthwhile. The ones you want are like diamonds, the tin, the tins and means or whatever the hell. There's some pretty ones in there you can find. <laughs> Uh, so what, what are you looking to do for right now? Because we got some time to kill. You know, we got a couple hours until sundown to hunt. Why don't you show me something you like doing to kill time? Because to be honest with you, I'm a very new to the city. Um, I, I just moved here from, from way out east. And it it's very unfamiliar to me. I normally I go and take my dirt bike and I go in the hills and I do cool little tricks uh, and I pass the time that way until till sundown. But uh, I don't. That's not normally a thing I do with others. But uh, now that I got your company, I can try and find something for us to do. Mm -hmm. All right. Um. I'm well, open let me tell to you anything. something. Uh, what sort of things are you looking to get into, huh? Well. To be honest, I hadn't really thought too much ahead of just surviving to, and I didn't really know what this city had to offer and I didn't really know even if I was going to stay, to be honest with you. So, um, honestly, I, I'm not opposed to anything, really. Anything at all? Well, I'll tell you what, I like hunting, but I don't like going out and hurting up anybody uh, in particular I, I I like to kind of keep that sort of contained that's not really what I'm all about 
I ain't a hurt. I'm, I'm a pacifist. I don't like hurting no one. I'll stand up for myself that I don't like. I don't like drawing no blades. My family, on the other hand, don't catch them on the wrong day. You understand? Uh, I'm sure you won't see them around too often, though. But, um... But yeah. You got a lot of family out here? Oh, yeah, O'Neills. I can show you my family home, or at least what used to be until the government kicked us out. Ooh, it's a little ways away. Right. I can drive us up there, though. Give me one moment. Yeah, it'll be a good way to kill time, I guess. <laughs> oh, and here's another tip for you if you're trying to make money from hunting and fishing illegally. Uh, uh, head down to a restaurant. <laughs> and uh, it pains me to say this. It really does, but uh, you can get like some nice curly fries. And for whatever reason, uh, the the man down there want to share curly fries with you, and he'll he'll pay you a little extra if you let you have some. I will keep that in mind. Curly that, fries. Ooh, where are yeah, you getting curly fries? Well, Hey, yeah, burger shot. That's where I get my curly fries from. Or onion rings. Onion rings. I think, it, I think it's, yeah, it's onion rings. <laughs> I don't really understand it too much either, but, you know, he likes onion rings. Well, I think most people could say they like onion rings, to be honest. Mm, yeah, love them. This is a shortcut right here. Oy! Ooh! Whoa! 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 Whoa. We're fine. I told you this thing. This thing's reliable. Nothing flies out of my drawers there next to my stove. Don't want my lunch getting out. I'm trying to think what else uh, you should know about uh, down here. <laughs> Fishing for fun is, you know, nice and all. You can always do that, but I'm telling you, you ain't, you ain't gonna make shit off of it unless, you know, you're specifically trying to catch them sturgeons. And all them fancy fish. I, I did that to pass the time earlier. Yeah, yeah, man, it'll pass the time. It ain't worth much. Uh, that gill net of yours, I ain't gonna press you on where it is. <laughs> but, uh, that, that, uh, that should bring in some money if you check it a little later. Takes a while, though. Got some rangers out here. First time seeing of them. Oh, you ain't seen no rangers down here? Not yet. Really? Well, back where I come from, they they weren't bothering us none. Uh, we had we had a lot of land, and um, I I wouldn't say nobody really ever monitored things up there. It could be lax some days. Some days they'll be all over the place looking in bushes at you, really stalking you, like waiting for you to slip up. Whoa! Ooh. Oh my Whoa. lord. I think I got <coughs> stuck on a rock. You need any help? Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna need some help flipping this thing. It's a little light. It's, it's bottom heavy, so if you push it'll just roll right over. Or not. Actually, hold on a moment. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> Shoot, I've had run-ins with so many rangers. Mm, there's this Wesley Arnold fella. He would not get off my oh. ass. I haven't seen him in a while. I don't know what he's been up to. <laughs> That one, that one was a sorry some bitch would try and catch me doing illegal things. They only got me one time. Uh, there's a, <laughs> there's a nice red-haired lady, never caught her name. <laughs> uh, there's a few others. 
Uh, there's a, there's, there was one that was like trying to be one. He's like, he's, I think his last name uh, is like a, like a noise. I don't remember. Like, I'll call him flip flops. I forget why. Hey, uh, what else? Um, there were more. There's one more. Um, forget her name. She was nice. Definitely way too innocent, but you know, nice. Well, I'm sure I'm bound to run into some of them at some point, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to talk to them much. See, I don't you really care me? for government intervention on my my goings on, you know. I understand completely. I don't talk to the piggies often, but uh, if they come and run up on me, you know, I try and, you know, show face. I'm more sociable than my brothers and sisters. Uh, but I don't, I don't take too kindly to them anyways. And, you know, intervening on what I'm trying to do. I think we're here. This is my old family home. <laughs> Officer Wiggles! <laughs> Officer Wiggles! There they are. Oh, are they pretty? Look Spike Piggy for the two months. <laughs> come, come back here. Come back here. They don't. They don't take too kindly to people. Well, I think this that is my might be for the best. This is where I live. All 18 of us. Yep, that's Frank. Next to him, that's Jimbo. They're twins. Is that one on Who's that one on the porch? Oh, that's, uh... We don't, we don't talk to him anymore. He's, he's lost his rise. I don't know if you noticed, but he's day drinking right now. He got, he got in a fight with his wife. He, uh... That's... That's corn. Cornwood. We don't, we don't talk to him too often anymore. So actually, let's get out of here. I don't, I don't want him to see him. All right. Yeah, he denounced the family name, married some man, some burly cop. He still comes around. But anyways, that's where I live. Whenever I'm not living in my RV. Might have to get me one of these, to be honest, if, uh, not... You want one? Not a tent or something, I think. This sort of thing might be up my alley. Let's go see if they got one in stock. They ain't too costly. I don't think. But people be buying them up because, uh, the city slickers love storing meth in them. <laughs> not that I'm against meth. I smoke it myself, but, you know, it's just... That's what they do. They like storing their guns and drugs in them. <laughs> At this point, I think anything's better than what I got right now, which is nothing. <laughs> you like the crystal? You fan of the glass? I'll be honest, I don't think I ever partook. I, You know, my daddy did, but... He told me I never to take part in it, and I, I, I listened to him most of the time, but... And I've been kind of rebelling a little bit since I got out on my own. <laughs> Howdy! I wonder what he's doing. Oh, he's doing... Ooh, <laughs> oh, I was looking back oh, at that Lord. man. I wasn't even paying attention. He almost went in the water. That man's selling drugs. How did you know? Go. Hey, he's slinging boxes, stolen car. You can tell the window shattered in. 
I'm not gonna lie, I've robbed a couple of them folks before for doing what they do when I'm at home. Howdy! He's checking his drugs right now a bit. <laughs> All right, well, let's head up to the city. Actually, how much time we got? Ooh, we could cut it. You know, this thing's slow, but we can try to make it up there. So your dad is right. You probably shouldn't get into the crystal. It's bad for you. You know, <laughs> shoot, it makes you feel like you're a god. I'll tell you, it'll make you feel like a different person. Maybe I'll give it a try sometime. I don't know. Do you ever want to know or learn? <laughs> You're talking to one of the best math cooks there ever was. I gotta trust you first, you understand? Well, I can understand that. So far, you seem pleasant, you know. No, don't, don't talk to the piggies. Doing your own thing, living off the land, staying away from the cameras. Let's get you back onto the city so uh, we can uh, see if we can get you one of these vans. I'm telling you, it'll change your life. Can I keep my pelts in it? Oh, yeah, of course you can. 700 pounds worth. About 10 pounds. Yeah. A little more than the uh, truck I had before. Yep, it's more than your truck. It's more in your apartment. Come on. It's all you'll ever need if you're doing what I told you to do and you, if you storm in a dumpster somewhere. Just make sure it's clean. Don't want no garbage getting on it. Pelt man might not take timely to that. Hell, if you're really fiending for money, you could try and, uh... What I've done sometimes is while I'm hunting, some people aren't very good at it. They'll accidentally scare away some of the animals. You can try and hunt them down yourself if, uh, if you find some wildlife on the side of a road somewhere. In that hunting area. I don't know why, but they love being roadkill. I, I may have had a run in with a mountain lion earlier with my truck. Did you hit one? Yep. Did you skin it up? Nope. Well, no, nah, you're, you're, that's like wasting, you know, precious resources. He, he well, could, it, he could it eat didn't look he like could... it was, um, it didn't look like it would have fetched me anything. You never know. It it looked um pretty mangled. Shoot, you just cleaned it up, stitched it together. Weather man not might not never notice. <laughs> Zaz will think of the ten gifted. Excuse your language, sir! <laughs> that thing ain't the fastest. It barely goes highway speeds. But it'll get you from place to place. I think that's all I need. It's a pity, and we almost are. They moved places. He tricked me the other day. That's the uh, car sales. Mm-hmm. It's worry about one of these from. They got they buy half selling them in the stock. We'll see. If they don't, we will try and find something else. Hoops. I think she's getting up. I think she's all right. Oh, she's fine. She's fine. Well, 
let's see. At the Premium Deluxe Motorsport. Mm. Look at all them fancy cars out. Ooh, and a nice truck. That's something you drive? I do like trucks. Mm, all right, let's take a look, sees. It's towards the end of this list. You want to look yourself? Oh my god. I don't think they have any in stock. How do we know if they got any? Mm, tablet will be grayed out if they don't got them. If they got them, it'll be solid and my you know, colored white. Like... Thing. It definitely sold out. Mm. Yeah. Like I said, people be buying them up to store their shit in. Never actually using them for recreation. There's another one in there at $7,000, but it's worse. Way worse. You think... Uh, if you want to look for a uh, better, a better vehicle, I can. We can take a look, sees. All right. I'll take a look. Yeah, I feel like a van might be better. I don't know what does it mean when they're just like completely blacked out. Because the grayed out, I know, means they're out of stock. are so expensive. Maybe a Speedo? I really don't think there's anything that I can afford. Yep. Uh, I think you'd like a dune loader. Like, uh, or you semi. Or you could just buy one of the Bison's. Or that one over there. That one ain't bad either. The Rebel. I don't surely remember how much they sell for. Uh, also, I don't know where. Um, I don't. I don't think they got anybody working the PDM right now either. So unfortunately, I don't think we're gonna be able to buy anything anyhow. Well, that's all right. I can. I think I can manage in the meantime till I can figure out what I want to get. Mm, all right. That's all right though. I really don't mind using the rentals, and honestly, with that tip you gave me about the, the whole dumpster thing, that, I think, solves all my issues. Yep, you just gotta be careful. Ooh, oh, you lord! Ready. Yeah, this thing goes a bit faster backwards than it does forwards. I think about them rentals though, and I, and I need I need you to ear clear is that uh, if you do do illegal things and it ends up putting you in the dirt, you ain't gonna be able to get a rental. I see. Mm -hmm. So uh, what you can do is you can uh, try and steal a truck or something, but um, t there ain't many bisons out there you can steal, but uh, you can steal one of these. I can show you a place to steal them from if you're interested. All right. 
Mm-hmm. You showed right. me how to steal them? Hey, I could show you how. I, I actually don't got one of the tools on me I need for that. Give me one moment. Go buy one. I, I just don't want us. Uh, well, I'll teach you later. Actually, we're about to lose time on our uh, on our hunting. How much how much bait you got? I got about six. Mm, I need more than that. I should have grabbed some of us, but we was there. Mm -hmm. The most you yeah, think you can hunt in a night if you're being real careful about it is about 10. Which is an oddly specific number for how much you can hunt in a night, but you know, the game wardens don't want you hunting more than it. Excuse me! Pardon us. Well, I tell you what, I appreciate all your help and, and all your explanation of stuff. This um, would have been an awful lot harder for me to learn all on my own. Of course, now you got this truck. I'll help you out with the hunting stuff. See them cars right back there? That that car right there? It's it's the it's the go-to car people like even stealing for hunting. Cause it stores a decent amount too. I think it steals uh, store about four pelts. If you shoot a bunch, drive off, go put it in a dumpster, drive back, you can get about eight or nine of them. You won't get, you won't get you know a lot, but before dawn comes up, but uh, you'll do decent with that M. I'll show you what I recommend. I'll get us there. You ever been to bowling, bro? <laughs> Yep, a long time ago. Before. I I used to harass the piggies. When they when they upset me. Cause you know, sometimes I like to drink in my private domicile, which is my motor vehicle, which is my home. So I think I should be allowed to drink and drive in my home. Cause it's my home and not my vehicle, whatever I choose it to be. Well, hey, they say otherwise, because they're like, oh, you're endangering lives. Oh, you're going to kill someone with your motor vehicle. I'm like, no, I ain't shut up. But, you know, they'll, they'll do well, stuff like that, and then I'll go and harass them. By, like, you know, they just, you know, pick on them until, you know, they they, uh, they give in and stop being such, such willies, I guess. Ooh. Another one of those things where they keep interfering with us. God damn All right, right. Oh, I know oversight. their interference. Yep, right here, by the way. This is where you get him from. All right. Mm -hmm. There's a couple out here that like to come up and uh, vacation here. They leave it uh, They leave it locked, though. Same with this one, if, you, if you're if you interested in this one. But this one, I'll tell you, do not, uh... That ain't good. Just believe me on that. But yeah, best remember on this place, if, uh, if you ever in need of a vehicle and uh, go so far under it, you can't be written no more. I don't recommend written anyways. Let's get out there. I'll show you my favorite hunting spot. I didn't really ask if you're adverse to stealing somebody else's property. I don't know if you're that way. I know I saw that you like, you know, I don't know. Are you adverse to doing that? I don't want to be enticing you to do something that you aren't willing. Well, I, the way I see it, if I need it, I need it, you know? It's not like you're stealing it. You're just borrowing it. I'll bring it back eventually. 
Exactly, exactly. I still exactly. gotta be thinking about these things. Let's see. I ain't hurt nobody. Hey, of course, you don't want to hurt no one. It's, that's that's what I live on. Unless unless they're stepping to you, then you, you're you're right. <laughs> you're right to defend yourself. Uh, Derp Daily, thank you for the eight months. Give us a Second Amendment floor. I'm glad I ran into him, chat. How much bait you say you got? I got Do about you... six. All right, I'll give you two. Hey, all right. Doing a little off-roading. Ooh, that's a tough drill at bush. Goddamn. I think there might have been a rock in there. I don't know what it was. Stiff as bricks is what it was, though. Oh, we're coming up on it right there. This little spot. I'll put I'll put all my bait like right out here. I'll, I'll mark it on the ground, and I'll get ready for hunting right about here. I just realized we're about four hours early. Then you just go across the street, or the, uh, not the street, the, uh, railroad? Yep, I just go across, drive up the hill a little bit, and wait. That's what I do. Pretty good spot. Yep, mm -hmm. uh, we can only be hunting like about mm, 22.20. So uh, let's see if we can get back to uh, buy some things real quick. I'll show you why this is my favorite place to hunt, too. Because if you head a little bit south, or east, I mean, uh, you'll make your way to the hunting spot where you can sell your pelts. Uh, you can head into the city and store your pelts in them dumpsters. And if you ride this railroad, abandoned railroad track here, you get right back into Polyter. I ain't been hit by a train yet, so <laughs> I'm still kicking. I was about to ask, uh... This don't seem very safe or smart, or... What'd you say? Uh, I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. We're going through a tunnel. <laughs> this uh, didn't seem very smart, but I guess if there ain't no trains, I suppose it's all right. I ain't seen none. Shoot, I think the railroad company went out of business or something. It just seems on gas, because if I take the road, it's like 20 more minutes. Yeah. Plus, plus nobody bothers you out here. You ain't going to run to the highway, man. But unless you want to take the road, but it takes a long time. I'm pulling off in the wrong area. I'm going to get stuck. Over here is normally where there's like a motorbike park. You can steal it if, if you're trying to get away from the piggies if they're chasing you. But there ain't one right there. I guess they uh, busy today. Ain't, ain't out in the hills chumping and hooting. Let me ask you something. All right. If we're just going to be up here hunting and, and whatnot. And any of them people come up. Uh, 
Am I gonna get you in trouble? Mm, I can teach you how to not get in trouble. Hmm. You, you might get me in trouble, trouble, but I, um, you might get in trouble. There's ways to get out of these things, always. You can come up with a story like, Oh my gosh, I thought this was my God-given right, I'm so sorry. See, that you might run into one of them cops that really want to push your buttons. And uh, send you to prison anyways for what you did, for what you for what you should be able to do without a license, but you know. If you're looking on poaching some animals, I can definitely teach you how to do it without you know getting away. Alright. Here we are. Sorry, I didn't mean to pull away from his. I just remember I have a bunch of pelts in the back of my truck. I need to store them anyway. Oh my god, I thought you were in. Oh my lord. I think we're just struggling a bit. She's a little bit. It's a you know, par for Ooh. <laughs> I love him. Can we keep him, chat? I'm going to pull right over here. It ain't nobody in their right mind going to check this dumpster. So, go check if it's clean. Gonna do a little sniff test on it. Gonna make sure it's good. I'll store some things in it. Hmm. <laughs> it's all right. It's not too bad. I think someone left some little lunch in there, but it'll be all right. How can you tell? I got a real strong nose. <laughs> oh shoot, I forgot to get your curly fries. That's uh, all right. We can get that after we finish our fish at hunting trip. I do still have these fish on me. Which fish? I have a salmon and a sturgeon. Oh, you should have put it in that dumpster. Oh my gosh, why didn't you say so? All right, I'll go put it in the dumpster. Hey, okay, let's go put it in there. Here, I'll park it here. Sorry, I thought that was your dumpster. No, you're all right. Yeah, we can. The dumpsters fill a lot. They're huge. All right. I, I guess we'll just dry him out in the dumpster and then he can take them fish. Exactly. My, my dead dry dumpster fish. I also believe I think he only buys them at night. I could be mistaken on that though. Been a while. I don't really fish all too much. I'm more of a hunter. <laughs> why is that a thing? Why? Why? What the heck? And then later we can check that old trap you said you set up. <laughs> yeah, best way to do that is uh, not just one, but you want a lot of them. Like a lot. Because of the fish, the fish don't sell for that much. And, uh, yeah, you, you know, you'll, you'll make like maybe a couple grand off the $300 he spent. 
So if you buy a lot of them, you make a lot more money. Interesting. Yeah. All right. I only bought the one, and then I went to uh, put it in the river, and as I was looking for a spot, I saw, I, th I think it was four gentlemen down by the riverside where I went, which was very odd. Uh, they did not look like they had any kind of vehicle, and one of them said that their friend had fallen in the river and flowed all the way down, so... Oh I don't know Lord. exactly what they was up to, but they didn't hassle Guess me. Guess they none. was doing something fishy. <laughs> That's a good one. Thank you. Look at this beautiful mountain range. I love driving up here. Just to see this site. One of the reasons why I, mo I moved over here because uh heard the sites were beautiful. Mm -hmm. I've seen people murdering people on that bridge before. Oh, my mm -hmm. lord. Yep, drove right by. Got a gun to his what? head, fall off that bridge. Yep, I call it murder bridge. It sure is pretty, though. Maybe I ought to get some kind of self-defense gun. I'm not sure. I recommend it. If you're trying to, you know, trying to say your god given right and not be registered and documented by the government, you should get yourself an illegal one. I, I, don't, I don't know where my connects have been. I haven't talked to them in a while. Sure, can find you one, though. Here we are. Yeah, you can put yours close. You can put it far. I don't mind. Shoot, it's still too early. What time is it? Oh, we're about five minutes early, I think. Yeah, but those people over there, don't mess with them. Don't hunt on their property. Don't hunt too close to their property. I barely got permission to, 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 to hunt here where I am. They're angry. Angry little motorcycle people. Well, I suppose if they's living over there, they probably don't want us shooting our guns and whatnot. Oh, go ahead and put yours down. Oh, I mean, they shoot their guns all the time. They just, if they're going to complain about that, they ain't got nothing really to complain about. All right, I'm gonna drive the car on back if you want to run up after yours is put down. <laughs> Actually, I'll just drive you up there. Why not? Come on. Gotta do it quick too. They these suckers. They'll come in quick, and you'll accidentally scare them off. It's no good. I, I did that with my truck, actually. I scared off a deer. Damn. He just went right the other way. Oh. All right, get your rifle. Oh, look, there's one. I don't know if that's mine or yours. It's one of ours. That one's hunting close by. Oh, I, I just heard him. I'll let you take that one. I don't want to scare off yours if it comes on by. I'm holding off for a second. All right. I think mine is stuck in a tree. You see it? Yeah. Where? It's in a tree. I'm gonna go for him. Go for it. Get him. Think so. All right, let's go get him.
<laughs> he got stuck on the tree. Ooh, well, didn't need that door anyways. All right, you go get yours, I'll get mine. I don't know where you shot at. I'm sorry if it didn't park close to it. I think you fell down here. <laughs> oh no. Poor dear. Uh, try and separate yours from mine a little bit. I'll put mine on the left hand side. You put yours on the right. Understand? You got it. All right. And probably you probably want to put your bait a little farther up. Just a little bit, not too far. Just so uh, they don't get caught on those trees. There you are. Perfect. All right. Oh man, I hope the rangers come this time. I'm getting him sent to jail. Let's go! Shoo -wee! Yep, this is pretty much how the night goes. But if we get an animal that we're not supposed to shoot, I'll show you how to deal with it. Don't happen too often. I think it's because uh, I don't want to do this on my lonesome. Mm. All right, let's just run up the hill. There's a piggy. Oh, mount line, mount line. I see him. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and shoot the piggy. Keep it on the mount line. All right, good. Now we're going to do a little thing that I call scaring off the wildlife. And what, you're going to have to trust me on this one. Run back down to the truck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, he knows My 100% who, who I am. Come on, little kitty, get on out of here. Get your gun ready. Get out, get out, get out. Take a shot at it. I missed. Hold on, I got it. I don't got it. I still see it, I still see it. Shoot, it's still running. We gotta go get it! <laughs> Ooh, oh, Lord. Woo! You got the hops. You wanna get Come your, on. uh, your boar? Hey, we'll get it later. I ain't too worried. I ain't worried about anybody stealing my stuff. <laughs> Being ridiculous. Now, you see, I, uh, you gotta scare them off and you shoot them as they run away. The uh, little rangers won't look too far for you. Did it run all the Where the hell did it run off to? We might have lost that one. That's all right. I, th I think it's still running, actually. Is it? You see it? I don't Way see it. Way over by that bridge. If you can maybe take a shot at it, then, 
you know, it's go crossing, for it. It's crossing the bridge right now. Is it? Way too far over there, I think, for us to shoot him. All right, well. Oh, Ooh. sorry. No, you're fine. Hop on in. We'll go back so we can get our other. We don't want to spend too long out of here. And if you lose him, you'll lose him. That's what you gotta do. You spook him a little bit, get him to run off, like under a bridge or something, or far off behind a tree line where the rangers wouldn't look. And you pop him. Uh, some rangers are really thorough like that Wesley fellow was. He looked everywhere because he did not trust me, and he shouldn't. Ooh, this ain't the right way. <laughs> no, not meta unlock. <laughs> just drive at him. <laughs> Alright, let's get our base down and go again. I I'll, I'll, I'll harvest it later. We'll farther up. Oh, Lord, I'm hiding. Well, he didn't do anything wrong, chat. He has he has his own um license and everything. I don't know if he ran or not. Don't come on back now. They're still patrolling. They're looking at me right now. All right. Good on you. Good on you for hiding. You don't got your license or firearms license. They would have stuck you up real good. They might be watching me now. I don't think they trust me. <laughs> hey, they talked and thought I was uh, hunting out of my vehicle, which I mean, I technically am, but. As if I shot are, out of it. Are you still in the area? 
Yeah, I'm right by my deer. Of course I am. I told you I could skip. I, I, I get those uh, those rangers and them police officers to leave me alone quite frequently. I think they're gone, so you can come up and put your bait down. All right. Probably gonna get caught. <laughs> you sure are a slipper one. I'm gonna call you Snake. You gonna call me Snake? Hey, I think it's a good nickname for you. <laughs> I feel like that might not be the nicest nickname. Why not? I don't know. There's some some connotation behind that. Oh, you mean snakes are nice, they hide in the grass and the root, they do like the little thing. I don't know if I want to be known as a snake in the grass. A little slippery little snake. Slippery little sneaky snake. I tell you what, if before I met you I probably wouldn't have run. That's smart of you, because I don't want you getting in debt. If more officers come in, oh, you're getting in the back of this thing, and you're ducking. Oh, I Lord, I think I just saw... Back there. I think I just saw an, an officer fall down the mountainside. <laughs> <laughs> they do that a lot. Oh Lord! Oh, oh Lord! Move! <laughs> Curtis! Curtis! Uh, <laughs> I'm alright. I'm alright. Take the shot at the same time. I'll take the far one. You take the close one. All right. Actually, I think the far one's yours. I'll take the close one. You take the far one. You ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, pull! Good shit. Let's go. <laughs> Man, uh, you just... It ain't worth it doing out of the license because look how much money we lost because you had to hide. <laughs> you, we ain't, we ain't going to be able to get this much game out here hiding in the bushes. But I understand I want to, you know, live it off the... Woo! Woo! Did you hear that? You hear that? Mm. I heard a snake. I heard a snake. Was that not you? That weren't me. It was over by you. I'm sure it's fine. It's probably just a grass snake or sitting cave. Hopefully it's not a python. There's a lot of them out here. I wonder which officer that was. <laughs> oh, 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 Lord. Get me out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that one sounded like a pop or a case. Or Sound like a rattlesnake. Uh -oh, you be careful with them. They they didn't hide from you. <laughs> you want me to look in? That's fine. I I don't want to go snakes, over there. Snake, snake. I, yeah, you I, well, take a look. I'll I'll take a look, but I don't think. Well, you know Alright. I don't want you dying out here. I don't got no any venom. Ooh, put your bait down. <laughs> I 
seconds, Emma. <laughs> I found in. I guess a little more speed this time. I'm not sure this car is capable of speed. No! They can sure try. Come on, little feller. You break. No, jump out! Jump out! Get out! Oh, no, no. Lord. Yeah, This thing don't work too well. Two people in it. Here's one. You know, where's the other? Hey, raccoon. I heard a little coyote. Yeah, I heard it too. We might have spooked him. Oh, you think we spooked a coyote driving up? That's possible. Yeah, I wasn't paying too good I, attention. I don't see no more deers that. or nothing. Well, that one looks like your one, so why don't you take it? I wish you saw what I did. Let's go get it. Ooh, you know what? Better than Snake, I'm gonna call you Viper. Viper? Yeah, I like that one more if that rolls off the tongue well. This thing in a position where I can get as much speed as possible. <laughs> I'm actually confused by that officer. Because there's. Oh. Jesus. Hello. What in the world? Hey, just a meteorite. Uh, Dingus, thank you for the um, seven months. <laughs> there we are. Now we shouldn't slide. Uh oh, get out, get out, get out, oh. get out. See that coyote right there? The coyote where? Right, right in front of the train track. He's going through a bush. All right, I see a deer. All right, you want? I'll take the coyote. You take the deer. All right. All right. 
All right, pull one, go. All right, three, two, one, go. Let's go get him. Good shooting. Ooh, oh. Ooh, oh. All right, go grab, uh, go grab your deer. I'll grab the cat out. Betty plays a mean harmonica. <laughs> Maybe. Have you got a high quality felt yet? I don't think so, no. Just looking at my pelts, I don't think I've got anything real nice. Hey, they, 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 they seem like they're a lot harder to come by for some reason. Right, I'm going to pull her up. Get ready to place your bait. Oh shoot, I just realized something. All right, we're, I'm gonna need to drive on back after this one, after we shoot. What's the matter? Uh, truck's full. Oh. Because we're doing it with two people normally and with a single person, I'll never fill this thing up. Yeah. With two, I'm gonna fill it up real quick. Put it on the tree. All right, good. You all right? Sorry, right, I didn't mean to put bush. you in a little bramble. <laughs> There's one deer. There's two deer. Let me know when you're ready. Which one is you going for? I'm going for the first one. You go for the buck. All right. I'll get the doe. You ready? On go. Three, two, one, go. Good shooting, Tex. Let's get him. Actually, I'm going to drop you off at him. I'm going to go put some of the pelts uh, in a dumpster. And then uh, I'll come back for you if, after you harvest them, all right? All right. All right. I'll be right back. If the cops come hide. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> I'm gonna be skinning a deer. <laughs> it was weird because um, if they had come down to investigate the scene, they would have seen that there were two X's. And then they also would have seen that there were casings just kind of all over the place. And they probably would have come over to my bush, which I was kind of... I was kind of waiting on, but they didn't ever come over. And then, for some reason, they went over to the other one? Over there? Very strange.
definitely someone over that way. Did I ask for the information? I was just thinking out loud. I can't remember what I said exactly. I didn't. You mean chat is just out here telling lies? <gasps> oh my god. Can't believe someone would do that. I'm here. Oh shoot, where'd you put the oh, where'd you put them? Over in this bush. Grab them, put them in the truck. Is the other one in the bush or did you grab them both? Rolled them up tight. They, they should both be in, or uh, there should be one in there. I got it. <laughs> Good luck, you're not mad. Oh, you did it. Ooh. Ooh. All right, let's go put our bait quickly. Let's go. Get oh, your gun ready. Lord. What's wrong? There's a mountain lion. What? Oh, we're behind us? Mm-hmm. We're gonna need to scare that one off. Oh, please don't slide. Don't slide. Don't slide. Catch on tree. All right, good. Is it just a mountain lion? Nothing else nearby? I think so. What do you see? Where is it? Oh, there oh, it is. All right, yep. I'm going to drop it. Get, get in the truck. Get in the truck. I'm going to drop that, and I'm going to immediately get in the truck, and we're going to chase that mountain lion down. Get it? Oh! Hey, my boys! Sorry. Oh we're, oh, we're fine. All right. It didn't run off. Normally, that spooks it. I guess we're too far apart for it to matter. All right, same deal. Get your gun out. Actually, get on top of this thing. Trust me on this. And get your gun ready. Oh, this will be good. <laughs> get out of here, kitty! Come on. What runoff? What are you doing? Look at look at. He's just doing a silly little dance. There it goes. Keep it. Keep it running. Keep it running till it's downhill. Ooh, come on. Till it's just on the bridge, probably, is good. Maybe even on the beach. That's good. Ow. Oh, shoot, you miss? I did. Where is it? Oh, it's still there. I might be able to hit it. 
It's too far. Damn it! I probably should have chased it more. Actually, you know what? It's close by. I think we can get this thing. I am giving up. I don't know. You said them people don't like us getting too close, right? Yeah, hey, we'll be fine. Oh, it moved right the last second. Shoot! I'm gonna give you keys, just in case. If you're able to get on the top, that would be good. Hop on up. I might be stuck. <laughs> Hop on on! I think we lost it. That's all right. We'll get, oh, we'll, we'll get better at this part. Say, it ain't, it ain't an easy thing to do. You gotta have a little bit of a... Gotta be able to train your aim. But we'll get you better, don't worry. I think we're well on our way. We are. There we are. We hit dirt. Watch your head. Oh, <laughs> Lord. I think he's long gone. Hey, it's fine. Look how stable you are, though. Oh, there it is. Oh, he's scaring his off. Could try and take it. <laughs> nah, we can go I, ahead and get I don't ours. know if I want to draw that kind of attention. Well, there's, no, there's, no, there's nothing in the rule book that says you can't be taking someone else's game. It's not like they were going to take it. They're probably just scaring it off. All right, get your bait ready. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Was were we not gonna get that deer? No, we're gonna get it. We don't. It, it's all right sitting there for a moment. It won't get too cold. They kill the rig, rig, rigor mortis. Sit in. It'll be <laughs> fine. Oh my god. Yeah, it's still warm. Just can't leave it over here overnight, you know. Plus it's not that cold out, it'll be fine. <laughs> I'm so glad he came and, and uh, joined us. Catch it on the tree. There we are. That's how I gotta do it. Oh, he's another one. It's Kermodo. All right, this time I gave you keys. So yes. I'll, I'll try. Oh, there's two of them. You good at driving? What do we... Uh... Uh... Or you think you're a better shot? <laughs> Which one would you rather do? I'll give a shot at driving. <laughs> yeah, all right. Hope I don't mess this up. And don't be afraid to send it down the hill. I was, but I shouldn't have been. Just scare them off before they get to the bait. Good, they're going in the same direction. Go on! Don't hit me against the tree! Go on, send it down the hill. That'll be fine. I can't see him. We're fine! Oh, oh Lord! <laughs> Curtis! I'm alright! Come on, go, go, go! Get back here, you son of a bitch! We're gonna I make don't see him, where is I think they went, I think they went the other way. I'm imagining yakety sacks right now. <laughs> I see them running up the hill. Maybe not. Maybe not this way again. Yeah, it's a good idea. I don't know if I can make it up this though. Oh, oh Lord. shoot. Ah! 
Maybe next time we do this, we get two Never vehicles. Listen? One that one that can store it all. Nope, can't do that. <laughs> Just trying to set up the mudslide again. Next time we do this, we probably should get you a rental and me a, a car. It's, uh, you can, I can just use this. We can use mine to store it and yours to hunt them down. Because this, <laughs> this ain't working too well now, ain't it? Let's go back the other way towards the beach. I think that'll be faster. Please don't I, put I, it in the ocean. I think that's a smart idea. Well, maybe you ought to try it. <laughs> All right. You got me close, didn't you? <laughs> All right. Well, now there's mountain lions roaming the forest that we could try and hunt down that'll probably give us a pretty good pelt. That's if you want to do it in the daytime though. They'll stick around for a while until they go and find their den. I wonder if we'll be able to even find them. Well, that's the thing about hunting. You gotta find them. They don't call it, they don't, they don't call it <laughs> shooting. It's called hunting. Suppose you ain't wrong. All right, go on and hop out and get ready with your bait. Ooh. <laughs> um, I don't think it was me. I have a few drop frames, but I don't think it was right now. Uh, Zax, thank you so much! Hope you had a good stream. Thanks for the raid. We're goofing around with, uh, Kermodo. Doing a little... A little poaching. Sorry about the tree. Oh, you, <laughs> you alright? So focused on the tree that I missed all the rest of the sticker bushes. Mm, I see the boar, but I don't see nothing else. See a bunny. Oh, there it is. You see that deer? I, I do. All right. Uh, I'll go for the deer. You go for the boar, all right? Three, all two, right. one, go. Good shooting. You can stand on top, I guess. It don't matter, huh? <laughs> Just be, I'll be real careful. Uh-oh. I'll be real careful. I'll be re. I'll be re. I'll be re. I'll be real careful. <laughs> There's your boar. It's Kermodo, yeah. Sure is. Sure enough. Doesn't sound like him, does it? Ooh, a quality pelt. I'm gonna tell you, it's a lot of money. 
I got a good one too, actually. <laughs> All right. Now let me go skin that other one, then we get the bait down, and we're good. Get on top. Or get in. I don't care you do. If you feel safer. I mean, about as safe with that door missing. My door missing. All right, go ahead and get your bait ready. I'm going to skin this thing. I'm all right. All right good. Didn't, didn't hurt yourself. I I just I tripped. Yeah, all right. Oh man. Maybe I shouldn't have hid when the cops came. Where my bait? What happened? Where my bait? Where my bait went? I think when the um, cops came, I, I ran and you placed yours. I, so got I got two more in the glove box. All I right. got one more. Oh, I got two more in the glove box. I guess we could put a lot more bait down than I thought we could. Yeah, the cops came down. I heard them coming. They they blared their siren. And uh He's been telling me this time, whole time that uh, we'll get in trouble and get put in the hole if we uh, if we talk to the rangers because we're missing our stuff. So she she was like, "I'm hiding. <laughs> I'm out of here." So we went and he hid in the bush, and it turns out I don't think the cops even looked. Born I'm not in front sure. of us. Man, line in front of us. All right, this is gonna be this is dangerous. This is daring just territory. There's one. Where's the mountain line? I heard it. Did you hear it? I I didn't hear it at all. Crazy, my own bad shit. You there is this again. Do you see oh, it? I I hear it. Hold on. You heard it? Hold on. I don't know where it is. Is he down here? Oh, you are crazy, lady. Oh, I think he's stuck. That ain't no man line. Oh, Lord, have mercy. He's right here in the, the little gap here. There's no way the hunter, the, the hunters are gonna look there and shoot him. I, I don't. This don't feel very sporting to me. If you don't want to shoot him, you don't have to. I don't see him though. Oh, there he is. Oh wow. I I don't. That just don't feel right. All right, if you don't if you don't feel like it's it's a good idea to shoot it, let's not shoot it then. I'll get my my boar though. <laughs> Why is it so? I changed my mind. All right. <laughs> he just doesn't care. Yeah, give it a sec. 
I'm down here. I'm in here. Don't skin him just yet. Oh, jeez. Oh, why? I just hope the cops don't come. Lord, you're a beacon. <laughs> what? You are gonna get a Scott Viper. What you mean? You are what am I doing wrong? Okay. I didn't do nothing. And I just be, be a little careful, all right? Because if you skin it too soon, uh, and the cops come, like they're just gonna see the blood and viscera everywhere, and they're gonna be like, mm, they're gonna look at that, and they're gonna look into it. I've had it happen to me before. There's one. There's my ear. Get on in. Oh, all in all, it's been a good haul. I wish we had more bait. I guess uh, we can shoot a lot more deer than I thought we could. It's a good thing, though. You know how he's talking about me being a beacon? Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, I might have put a, a mountain lion uh, in my apartment. <laughs> you just walked in with it? Kinda. It was well, a really nice looking pelt, though. You know what? <laughs> just, just be a lot. Be very careful of doing that. The second someone sees that, they're gonna get you. Oh my god, I thought you were in again. Why wow, you are so slippery. Alright, let me show you something, though. Something that you need to know that I... That I was shown. I want you to get out your phone over here and film like you're shocked. See all that blood everywhere? Oh, Lord. Hey, you made a mess. Officers will see that. Entry wound, okay. if they don't, if they don't if they, you know, if you leave them there a while, they'll bleed out, and then they'll, you know, they'll leave enough blood, and they'll be able to see it, but if you don't, if you, if you take a second to chop them up, uh, or easier chance that the officers won't see it, so, it's a little balance between the rigor mortis sitting in, and, uh, getting caught literally red-handed, so... Just be a little careful. Alright, I'm gonna take us back on to dumpster first one, and then I can take us back to the other dumpster. Then I can take us the burger shot. Oh my god, this is gonna use so much gas and I turned off a little early. Ooh. Julie! Well, 
I think we did it. We did do it successfully. Poached and hunted. I like it back here because there's a cat named Tuna I like to pet. But uh, he ain't out right now. But this is the dumpster I've been storing. If you can help me start loading it up. Oh, I, I heard, hear Tuna. I heard a cat. That's probably Tuna. How do I... Ooh. Really? The meat? Hey, this is gonna be a quite bit of money! Mm -hmm. Here's Tuna! Hey, Tuna, how you doing? Good kitty. <laughs> I'll get your last one and I'll load it up for you. Ooh, hope All right. Jesus. What you put on the ground over there? Well, I was picking up the lard and I just realized how much that weighs. Oh yeah, it ain't, I'm telling you, it ain't worth it to keep on you, ever. Ever. Well, them guys down at that Harmonies, oh, they, uh, it. they took it and they gave me $1,500 for it. Oh, they gave you, they gave you that much for it? They took pity on me. They sure did, didn't they? I told them I was poor and I needed help and they, they bought it off me, I guess. Well, Maybe nice they'll do it again, mine. I don't know. Hopefully. Hopefully they'll do it again. You got more? I do. Alright, let's drop by there, see if he can sales it. If you can, well, good on you. They said uh, they got... Make your money. They take the meat, too. Oh, did they now? They never wanted to buy my stuff when I was trying to sales it to them. <laughs> Well, I think I just, you know, tugged at it's their heartstrings. It's because I ain't poor. Or that. I, I ain't the heartstring puller type. I ain't get it the old manipulating. Ooh. That was your intention, right, Viper? To manipulate and steal from those poor folk? Well, sorta. Yeah, all right. I like you. <laughs> Maybe not the actual intention, but if it happens that way, I suppose. <laughs> Out of there. How the hell are you guys going, y'all? I'm doing all right. I'm just looking for a yeah, quick little repair on this thing. Probably just did uh, uh, just fix up the facade panels and tweak the engine a little bit. Okay. Okay. Also, also my my friend here might be looking to sell you some stuff that you might be interested in. All right. I got some lard and some some meat. All right, we'll just get your uh, car sorted, then we'll help you out with that. Say less. All right, good. I like this place. It's very homely. Are you hungry? I could eat. All right. All right, good parts. Let me see here. You just take this then. It's some food in there for you. Oh, also, oh, I forgot. Here, take this as well. You get that onion ring? I did. Save that. Well, thank you. Of course. Hurts. Yep. I thank you. Is this uh, car going under? Mm, me, Curtis O'Neill. Here's my ID for you. Awesome, thank you. Ooh. 
was that? Right. Did he just floss? <laughs> what in the world? What? What are you doing? What? What are you talking about, Viper? You... You started flailing. Doing what? You was flailing. What was you doing? I don't know what you're talking about. I... Whoa. Oh, all right. I, I think I you're guess. seeing things. I... Did you get that charge? Mm, $2,000 <laughs> for an engine and a body? Oh, did you want an engine and a body? Hey, you know if I'm fucking, I'll pay for that. I don't oh, okay. care. I'm rich. Okay. JB with the sneaky upsell, damn. Why is he the way that he is? You... But. You... You just did it again. Did yeah, what? What? What are you talking about? Uh, you said you had some meat and some lard? I do. Yeah. I'm looking okay. to sell them, but I don't know uh, if you're interested in buying. Uh, we accept donations of lard at Harmony. We don't often buy it. Uh, how much meat do you have first? I have 15. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay, so we have a contract with... Um, What's the place name? Some, something Steaks, Corleone cool Steaks. Yeah, unfortunately, they're Dang. the only ones who can get commission. Um, permission, not commission. Words are hard. Please forgive me. Um, do you know, get um, steak for us. So unfortunately, we can't buy it, I'm afraid. What in the... Oh, that, that's how I've been informed. I can ask Etta, but uh, I believe it's the same answer. But... You putting us humble, humble hunters and fishers out of business, you know that? Mm. We ain't gonna be able to make no money. You know, I there. feel for you. I feel for you. I'd rather get locally, you know, sourced from, you know, good, sensible people Where like yourself. Where do you normally get your lard from? I'm not sure. I'll ask Edda where we normally get our lard from. I think we normally... I don't know. Let me get back do to you, you know so where I can we give you a straight up answer. Otherwise sell it. Uh, I just, I'm a waste not mechanic want not yeah, no, kind of person, you. and I, I no, can't I even that. fathom just putting this somewhere that. Well, like I'm I said, we do take no donations of blood, it. but we tend to not pay for it. Um, I will ask Edda, but uh, I believe it's the same answer. I'll be right back with you, okay? All right. Your car is fully repaired in a lot too. Oh, hey, all right, good. I guess we're heading out, huh? I, I thought he was gonna ask. Oh, is he, is he doing something? I, for I us? think What's so. He, he said he's gonna ask her. Oh, her, I thought Not he was gonna sure. call someone. I, just, I thought he was gonna get called back or something. All right, we can wait. Hi. We have a uh, large meat for sale? Uh, we do, yeah. Okay. Uh, got, how much of each? Um, I have 15 fresh meat and 22 lard. I'm not really sure. We don't normally buy 
uh, or pay for them, but I will uh, give you money. Not a problem for it. So give me just a second. Let me calculate. Well, hey, I appreciate All that. All right. Of course, of course. That works you said for 22 me. lard and 15 meat? Yes, ma'am. All right. <laughs> Could hear you will help out us hunters. Hmm? Listen, y'all are putting the time and the effort in, so y'all should be paid for it. That's what I like to hear. You know, I, I don't mind doing a donation and whatnot, but I feel like I ought to make a little bit of money off what I'm doing. I mean, you did put a lot of hard work and a lot of hours in, you know. You deserve to be recognized for that. Could I just ask what the name of your vehicle is, sir, please? I think it's a journey. A journey. Okay, thank you very much. I think that's what it was, yeah. I think that's the brand name I call. I just call it my RV. You know, I would call that too. It's a very nice RV. Thank you. I try and keep it pretty. For a bit there, when I when I was making a lot of money, I had it plated in gold, but the gold was oh. actually... It turns out it was just gold paint. It wasn't actually gold, and it scraped off. All right. Um, How about I pay 25 per? Um, that would come to a total of 925, but I'll just round it up to an even 1,000. How does that sound? Sounds great. Okay. Not a problem at all. Uh, probably let's see. Is it okay if I just hand you over the catch now? I don't think you'll get up yep. the hill very fast All if right. it was solid gold. That'd be heavy, like, you know? Hey, yeah, you're probably right. This thing All don't right. lie. This thing has, sucks to move. There you go. Okay. And there's the uh, goods. Perfect. Thank y'all so much. And if you get any more, please bring them on by and I will happily pay for that too. Sure of course. Thing. Appreciate we'll keep you. That Absolutely. Right, thank Jeff, you for can coming you grab to the rest harm of me. It? I can't. Of course. Thank you. I will, it will be a good one. Sorry, it's heavy. <laughs> it's a lot. It's very heavy. See what I mean? All right. Well, now, well, now money they say we can bring more wouldn't. on by. Yeah, now we can bring more on by. That works out, huh? All right, now we're gonna drive on back to uh, to the lodge. After we get back to the lodge, I'm gonna grab my pelts and I'm gonna bring it back here. You probably could have saved the trip by going back to the lodge. I'm not gonna lie to you, uh, but that's fine. I'll sell the pelts I got. Mm-hmm. We can try and sell your fish. We can go to Burger Shot and get some more food. Ooh I you feeling? You got Sounds one more hunting trip in you, or is that going to be your last hunting trip? I think that might be my last hunting trip, but I can hang around a little longer just to, you know. Get your belt sold? Yeah. All right. Sounds good to me. How about this? Because you're going to need your... We're going to, you know... Probably hunting out there one more time, anyhow. Uh, I'll pay you for your pelts. If you want to do that, that I mean, I'm fine with that. Mm -hmm, of course. Just so you don't gotta wait around again for those sets of pelts, because I know how cumbersome and annoying that can be. Yeah. Yeah. It was uh, an adventure, to say the least, earlier. Yeah, yeah, hunting and fishing, they, you know, they got they got the rough spots, but... Oh, my hold on. God, that is... Actually, I think my net was down there. Oh, down here? Yeah, I had it set up in the river. I don't this know if it's still there. This is a smart place to put it. I don't think nobody checks this place. It might not still be there. I might have gotten washed away. Hmm, shouldn't have. Where'd you put it? Uh, to the right. I don't see it. Let's see. Get down there and check.
Oh, there it is. Should I grab it? Booty. Huh? Whoa! Hey! You able to get it? I think there's too many holes in it. What do you mean? Oh. Might have left it here too long. It should still work. I can't collect anything from it. I can't collect nothing either, huh? That's all right. I'll take it down. Oh wait, I can't. I can't touch it. That's right. You can't touch somebody else's gill net. Oh, I, I, I don't know how you set it up. I'll get all tangled nope. in it. What's wrong? Um, I'm trying to take it down. Can you not? I don't think so. Well, I don't. I don't know what you're seeing, so I can't. <laughs> I can't rightly help you. Mm. Well, I'll just leave it there, I guess. All right. Hey, polluting our waters, but what can you do? It'll wash away soon enough. <laughs> I think it's scuffed, yeah. Ooh. Watch your foot, Curtis. I ain't gonna slip in that water. Oh, well. Well, you live and you learn, and you learn that the gill nets are, uh, just about as bad as everything else he can do out here, so. I have... Uh, definitely pick that up. But that's all right. Hey, yep. I I think I'll hopefully make the same amount that I made, or I got out of it. How much have you spent so far? Uh, I think I've made like two hundred fifty dollars today. That's it? Well, if you factor in all the costs of everything, um, I started Monday with about 5000 and I, mm -hmm. I currently have about 5250 hey! 5000 <laughs> Shoot. All right, well, Granted, I mean, you do I got have more... It, I haven't got sold more everything. For you. Yay, we got more waiting. Mm -hmm. So I have made a little bit. But not nearly as much as I thought. Yeah, no, you ain't... It, there's a startup cost all this. The gun, the bullets, the, the meat, right, or the, 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 the bait, right? All that's got startup cost to it. Then you gotta buy your own vehicle. Mm. So uh, it's it's a little bit of a venture when it comes down to all that. But uh, when you start getting up and going, you start making a decent amount of money, especially whenever you bring them them onion onion rings. I love them. You said it was the, um, the fish guy that likes the onion ring? Oh, speaking of fish guy, they both like onion rings. Speaking of fish guy, though, I'm gonna double check something. We get an email. Oh, there's a fishing tournament about to start. Mm. I ain't particularly fond of doing the fishing tournaments. Purely because I don't like the way they work. I, I, have I tend to agree. I think uh, it seems a bit silly to do that at all. 
Yep, but people do it, and you know what's even worse? People will go up to it, say they're going to join the tournament, and then go gold panning instead. What? Yep. Well. <sighs> sounds about right. Yep. <laughs> I plead the government to at least <laughs> do something about it. But. You know. Oh my god, bro. It's been like a year and a half. Oh my god. I'm gonna... I'm gonna have an aneurysm. But what can you do? It's fine. It actually happened to me today. I was fishing out there. There were two people. <laughs> and I was the third. I was the only... It was only three of us oh out there. I made god. sure of it. And Why they bought first and like second, this? and I got no place. I didn't get third. Someone else must have signed in and walked away. They went and did something else with their time instead of fishing and still got third place. They... Did they fish at all? Probably not. There was no one out there except for the, us three. You don't need to if you sign up to the fishing tournament for some fucking reason. It's a headache. <laughs> I can't, dude. I actually cannot. Like, why? Why? Well, first of all... Mm, look at that fish jerky. If people are doing that, those individuals probably need to not be on the server anymore. I just, I'm All just right, gonna go out and say it. Then. Go ahead and grab it up. If you're, if you're, I've never uh, tried giving on you rings to the fishing guy, but he probably pain. likes them too. If I were to guess. The chance he don't though, and that's gonna be really, really funny. Just make fishing a whole, just so, so much not worthwhile. Well, I got my fish jerky and I'm ready to sell it. All right. I oh think. shoot, I forget where I the fish don't really guy know. is. Where's the fish guy? He's up there. I hope right? I'm ready to sell it. You should be. I don't. I don't think it's night time. He just don't really like doing shit to such an eye opener. I think he yeah, I know. A day now, though. But yeah, that's what happens with the fishing tournaments. I wish fishing was better uh, for the state, but you know what? There's not much you can do. It's not like you can do anything about it. Yep. <laughs> You're such a turd. <laughs> you just moved here. Look at that view. Oh, ain't it pretty? That's the reason I why. The country. <laughs> now let's get you on. What the about fishing that stand? place? That hookies? Where? Oh my god! Did you? Oh did my you lord! See, did you see us? Oh. I don't think so. No. I, what no, happened? Man, hit, the, 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 that truck hit that man, and he did like a. <laughs> 
15 foot leap in the air and then like a oh, Lord. three front flips. I was distracted. I was looking at the hookies place. I thought that looked like a nice restaurant. Oh, it's nice. I don't think anybody owns it though. Maybe I've always wanted like more diners along this road or Great Ocean. This, uh, yeah, this or uh, Los Santos Freeway or whatever the hell it's called. Because there's some good diners that I think would be really nice. Uh, there's one up a leader that's really nice too, but uh, I don't know if people go there. Yeah, that mojito. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I went there. It was uh, it was good conversation. They were talking about um, cocaine bears. Hey, look. Hey, I'm fine. Hey. Are you good? All right. All right. Something about bears dressing up in human clothes. I, I don't really know. That sounds crazy. Why would someone go and dress up like a bear? I, I think they was talking about a bear dressing like a human rather than the other way around. A bear being a human? <laughs> Silly. Ooh. And there's some bear named Boris that does cocaine. Bear named Boris that does cocaine and pretends mm -hmm. to be a person. Shoot, I believe it. Government's probably in on it, so. I believe that too. That gum government. I'm telling you, these birds, birds all around. They got the, the drones going on, and mm -hmm. I'm convinced that. Every society we've got, we've got living in a dome. You ever heard of the I, dome theory? Oh, I ain't heard about it. You share yeah. with me. Well, honestly, the dome theory could be in the, anything you uh, think of. Uh, at any given moment, we could be covered by a dome, and you just never would know. Because you would That's never true, be able to, to tell. It's glass. We Dad. simply can't go that high. And the birds, they, they're the detectors and they tell, they tell the government when you get too high up in the air so you can't detect the, the... That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. God damn, you've, you've opened my eyes. Mm-hmm. God dang, government always trying to mess up our freedom. And I think, I think planes are they just might. transport Ooh. into in between specific domes. Oh, you think that the planes are in on it? I think so. What's he saying? He's saying he wants us to come back later. God damn it, he wants us at night. All right, yeah, I thought so. Hey, he's an asshole. He's very shady. It, there's a reason they don't let you open the doors when you're in a plane. On account of if you open the I'm doors, so you'll figure out that the... they're transporting you between the domes. Whoa! Oh! We're good. Good lord. Oh my lord. I almost went in the river. We would have been boating back. <gasps> that makes a lot of sense, so you can't see the dome, so you don't know the dome exists, mm -hmm. so that they can keep you in the domes. Mm -hmm. So you don't get outside the domes. What do you think is outside the dome? Mm -hmm. Probably a paradise where the government lives. You think? Yeah, they're trying to keep from us. Yeah, they're trying to keep everything nice for themselves. What if it's the opposite? You think they're trying to protect us? What if there's just some kind of fiery hellscape outside and they're trying to keep us from finding out that they ruined everything? Hmm. 
Mm, that could be it. That could be it. It's a good theory. And we just don't know nothing about it. Could be apocalyptic in that we're just living in a, in a fake society built by the government. Mm. That's a that's a good thought. I've never thought of it like that before. Now, do you suppose that this dome is in some way permeable? You think there's atmosphere in the dome, or do you think the atmosphere comes from outside? If that, if it were a hellscape out there, I would guess that that it would be inside the dome. In its own contains ecosystem of sorts, because if they ruin the world, then it would then it would uh, be it would be bad, wouldn't it? Then we'd be breathing in all the bad. And, mm -hmm. Do you suppose it's a dome, or do you think it's actually a sphere? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think the I don't think we live on. Hey, they be saying that we're living on some sort of orb. I don't think we're living on orb. I think we're living on a disc. <laughs> I ain't never seen it round. You might be right. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, so... uh, Sorry. All right. I'll be sharing some onion rings with them. Oh. You think that disc is real thick? Mm. There you are. My is the disc thick. Mm. I mean, I've never tried to dig to find out, but probably pretty decent size. If I were to guess. I could be wrong, though. Do you think they're thick, or do you think they're thin like a wafer? I think that we're in a sphere. And the the dome is part of the sphere. Oh, so like one half is so like a dome shape. So we are kind of in a, in a disc situation, mm. but the bottom part of the disc is round. I sees. You know I what I mean? Sees. Yeah, I get what you mean. And the top part of the disc is just the air. But I, yeah, so I one half know. of the dome is air, and the other half is dirt. Yeah, because that would account for all them um, caves and trenches and, and whatnot. Hey, kind of like an Orby. Also, make sure to sell your pelts one at a time because he doesn't like you sell multiple at a time. All right. He will give you a lot less money. It takes so much longer, though. And here's the good pelt. Let's see how much he gives me because it could either be a lot or very, 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 very little. Why do you think this is worth, Jim? All right! That's $10,000. For the... the nice one? No, in total. Oh. And that wasn't even the most amount of pelts you can get. So, it's, it's decent. It's decent money. It's not, like, crazy. But it's all right. I do have that pelt in my apartment. I'm wondering how much that'll get me. Oh, that that illegal one? Yeah, I gotta sneak it out though. Do you know how good it is? It good or me? Eh? Well, it looked pretty good to me. It looked like it had a bunch of spots all over it. 
All right. And so on the those quality ones... scale, I think it would be uh, uh, the pinnacle. Here's the issue with those, right? He won't give you regular money for those. He will give you bands of money that uh that if the police find on you, they they think it's suspicious. I don't know why, but I guess he doesn't like dealing in, in actual cash. So you gotta find someone that wants to buy that from you. Huh. All right. So it, it ain't it ain't gonna be liquid cash. It's cash you gotta sell to someone else that, that's buying it. Uh, I'm sure you could find some people. Uh, people up in the city uh, that like doing their drug thing uh, tend to buy it a lot. Well, that's good to know. Mm, I had one connect, but I don't think he's around no more. <laughs> yeah, Breaking Bad. <laughs> we got a money launder. All failed up. Mm. All right. Now, we're going to go north. Um... Actually, shoot, when's that fishing tournament start? Uh, do you want to do the fishing tournament or no? Uh, I don't think so. All right. I think I'm good. You want to know why people do them and do what they do? Why? Those fishing tournaments, if you're first place, you get $10,000. If you ate onion rings right before, that's $20,000. Oh, my lord. Hey. Uh, maybe we ought. I don't know. What was your plan? Ex well, well, I don't like doing it because I don't like plan? the way it works. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Belly. My uh, plan is I'm normally because uh, I had a system a long time ago. Back Belly, before thank I knew you for the five dollar dono. Thing. Uh is that I would I would hunt and then I would do metal detecting in between hunting and I did this for a week straight I would do metal and detect in between the hunting <laughs> and then I would hunt again and then I would go to the fishing tournament and then I hunt again and then I metal detect then I hunt again and I metal detect then I hunt again then I go to the next fishing tournament and then the day would end. I did that for a week straight, and let me tell you, it, my mind went to mush. But I made $1.5 uh, million. Dollars. Oh, my lord. Well, I tell you what, I'm not really looking to make a bunch of money or nothing like that. I think. Hey, um, just get yourself up on your feet. That's important. Uh, I think you've given me plenty of tools to prepare myself for yeah, what I've not, signed up for here. Yeah, I would not do what I would not do what I did. Don't do that. Don't do, do, do not do what I did. I do not think I have interest in doing that. I have a feeling yeah. I'm going to run into them, uh, them rangers eventually. Eh, probably. You probably will. They're, they're slippery little, little, little <laughs> snakes. They, they'll, they'll just watch you from Belly, a bush until you, the, you uh, do five something bad. Gifted like, subs as well. Appreciate like that. stalking you. That's what they did to me to try and catch me, that Wesley fella. Well, I think I'm up for the challenge of that. But hey, it's like a game I don't cat know mouse. if I want to... Uh, drag you along into all that or nothing so if you don't want it that's all right well, I think, are, you, uh, are you looking to be more are you looking to be like you know you don't care what the government thinks you're just gonna shoot it right in front I, of them and you know stick it to them well i don't know about that i, I might at least try to hide what i'm doing if i'm doing something wrong but all right yeah you can do the old the old drive them off and then shoot them out and run away it's hard it is difficult, but you can do it. I 
I don't mind. My brothers used to poach. I still poach. I just do it where nobody catches me. Yet. I'll probably get caught eventually, though. <laughs> I'm sure. Eh, don't go metal detecting. It'll it'll break your brain. It is it is the most <laughs> boring thing you can do in this city. Same with that gold pan and stuff. I don't know how people do that. It'll make you a lot of money, but is it will it will make you not want to wake up ever again. I can only imagine. Damn. I only did it because I wanted to buy my family homes and then the government let me on for a year and a half. It's all right. Well, <laughs> I got this home with me. So what's the plan now? Well, we're going to go to a burger shop. I'm going to get some extra meals just so we don't starve out there because I'm kind of peckish myself. Um, I'll probably get one meal for you since you're about to go to bed. And I'll get a... I'll get a meal for myself. Ooh! Anyone working? I don't see nobody. I think Burger Shot dead as a doornail. I'm gonna be honest. I, I feel like the city is dead as a doornail today. Hey, right now especially. Oh, good lord. That ain't fitting at all. <laughs> uh, it's a shame. This is this is normally the time I like to be around, but mm. I'm not going to Maldini's. I hate that place. Let's go to Uwu. At least there's some some nice folk there. Uh oh. <laughs> oh lord, you did that right in front of him. Yep. <laughs> I don't think he cared at all. No, I think he had some uh, better business to be taking on. Whoa. All right. What time is it for us? Mm -hmm. Uh, it is almost 2 a.m. Howdy! Hi there. Hello. Welcome to Uwu! How can I help you guys? Uh, I would just like to get a meal for me and my friend here. I think we'll just get two uh, combos of your charismatic curry. Okie dokie, we can do that. Definitely, well, definitely. Alright. Alright, thank you. I appreciate you. Yeah, no problem. You guys out going out hunting? Hey, we just, you know, we uh, we like doing our business out there in the woods. Wow. Hunting and fishing. Sure do. You know, our, uh, our smart Omnom rice is really good for that. Oh, makes you, makes you so focused. We got some special ingredients in it. Mm, all right, I guess we'll try. <gasps> yeah. Do you want that instead of the curry, or do you want the curry? Mm, can I get two two curries and then then two of them rices then? Yeah. All right, let's do that then. Yeah, yeah. It's real good for like things that are like real repetitive and all that, you know. All right, yeah, yeah. All right. Let me go ahead. Bam. Okay, cash ready. Or did you already pay? 
for the no, first two? No, I haven't. No, oh, there okay. you go. Let me fix that. Okay, let me charge you again for oh, the... Well, well, there, I just paid $714. Okay, okay, I got you. I got you, so don't worry. All right, let me get two more of these. All right. Let me get this on the tray for you, sir. All right, thank you. Yeah. Okie dokie, you guys have a ooh ooh tastic day, okay? Thank you kindly. Have you a have day. a pleasant mm -hmm. one. Yeah, be safe All out right, there. I appreciate you. I heard there's some violent panthers out there, so stay safe. Oh, yeah, I'll eat you up. Mm -hmm. They're nice folk. Yeah. One of them in there, if you call them, they'll purr at you. They'll purr at you? Hey. Oh, oh. All right. Is that is that a good thing? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, I put a bunch of food in there for you. Ooh. All right. I appreciate that. Of course. Now what do we do? Mm. Got a lot of downtime. Ooh. <laughs> Wonder where he's off in a hurry. I wonder as well. Oh, we're going to see him. Oh, they went this way as well. Look at that. <laughs> uh, I guess we could go to the fishing tournament. It shouldn't start too soon, I think. Hopefully. Unless you don't want to do it. I don't know how you feel. I think I'm still open to anything. Alright, let's try it out. I think it already started, so if uh, the people I've been talking be about well, the people I'm talking about have already been there, then, uh, <laughs> um, probably should have had a look on getting first or second or third place. Which means it's basically pointless to do it, because you ain't making any money unless off the sturgeons. Which the sturgeons will only give you, like, at most, like, a thousand to five hundred dollars per. And the charge is, like, five thousand dollars after everything, so... It, it don't it don't end up working out too well. I've had rangers out there before charge people. I'll see them charge people with poaching per 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 uh, fish. So you just gotta be careful. You ever take like a, a boat or anything out here? Mm, me personally, no. I could probably buy one. That's a good idea. I might do that. There ain't nowhere to park it except for the city, though, which is annoying. That does seem a bit silly. Ah. Had to drive it all the way out, and by the time I get out here, I'm at half tank. <laughs> and there's no way to fill out a fill up out of here either, so. Could always just borrow one. That's true! Unfortunately, right now, I still don't have any lockpicks, and they don't sell them up north. Turn us around if you want to go grab one. That's all right. See, look at that toy. Maybe next time. Look at the toy. I told you. Oh my lord. 
Oh, you, you give her a kidding. call. Or I guess you weren't kitten. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can you drive for a second? All right. Oh my lord, you didn't even stop. No, all right. I guess I'll drive. Thank you, sorry about that. <laughs> Look at you, you learned the wiggle. And she fun to drive. Feels, feels like I'm walking. <laughs> like a penguin. I try holding it more each wiggle. There you are. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh my lord. Hey, I love driving this thing. Come on, get us killed. Oh, you're fine. This thing's built so strong. So, tell me about your family. Oh, I got such a large family. There's Cletus. No, Lord. Oh, my Lord. I was looking the other way. I'm sorry. <laughs> There's Clay, Cletus, Clara, Cass, <laughs> Deuce, Clyde, <laughs> Drew, Gabe, Kevin. NASCAR Neil. NASCAR. A uh, Florence Troy. Neil O'Neill. Yeah, Neil O'Neill. How's it spelled? Same way. <laughs> Just without the O. And then NASCAR. Uh huh. I spelled with Q's though. That's cool. Or it's <laughs> like French or something. His mother was or I don't know. They like driving. Did you want to drive again? Oh no, I'm just saying that NASCAR loves to drive. It's like his favorite thing in the whole world. He wants to be in NASCAR. The, the circuit, not, not, not him. He doesn't want to be in himself. He ain't no Ouroboros. A uh, what? A uh, Ouroboros. That's like where a snake like to eat itself. Why would it do that? I don't know. It's silly. How do animals do anything they do? I don't know. It's like a mystery. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, I got tons of family. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's Grammy, Grammy Judith. Ain't seen her in a while, though. Got tons of family. After we sign into the tournament, we should, uh, 
we should stop by the bait shop, buy some bait, and then head on back uh, down to the river. Oh, you're past it. They didn't need that light pole. yet. Six minutes, 28 seconds. Oh, I ain't enjoying my group. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure thing. Oh, I was talking to Emma there, but also, you know, you oh. can join too. <laughs> oh, perfect. Curtis. Mm-hmm. That's me. You and got me your me? friend come on back down? Or no? Yeah, you're in. Alright, I'll go ahead and get us ready for that. But I guess we wait oh, for this okay. man. Yep. Went. Should I share my onion rings with him before I do this? No, you uh, oh. for this for this you wait until it ends. How? How do he, I know? If you when eat it too soon, he's not gonna want to share with you because you're gonna be stale. How? How do I know when to share them with him? You either keep it a mental note on how long it's been, or you go on your phone and set a timer or something, and it's what other people do. <laughs> He'll tell you how long a tournament lasts. And you can keep, like, a mental note. Just don't miss it, because if you miss it, then he won't want to share with you either. I don't, um, all right. That makes sense. I think so. But, um, I think maybe I'll just let you tell me when I should share my onion rings with him. All right. I try my best. I ain't best at keeping time, though. Well, he should be. He should be ready to start anytime soon now. Let's see. Three minutes. Mm-hmm. people if you just put them on top because <laughs> you'll never fall off this thing it's a joy i love it so much say so you a hunter sir too sir All right. <laughs> Wearing skinny jeans out fishing with tennis shoes on. I was just thinking the same thing. He don't look like he's dressed apart. Hey, he don't. He don't look like he belongs here. Has he got holes in him jeans too. Hey, he got. Holes in his 
Fancy skinny jeans. I don't know how I feel about oh that. My Lord. A city, driving a city slicker car with fancy rims on it and a purple paint job. That flashy car that. I don't know. A uh, duffel bag on for some reason. Like he's about to, I don't know, well, he's trying to steal something. I. <clears throat> I have a duffel bag. What do you mean? Yeah, but like you store your pelts and like your gun and your things in it. Him, was he storing in it? Another pair of tennis shoes. Probably the tennis racket or something. City slickers would do. Maybe. What, what do they play? Quidditch? I don't know. What's Quidditch? I don't know. I read in the book once. <laughs> One minute. I think you gotta sign up before him. We both do. Yeah. Cause that's how this thing works for right now. Hopefully not too long, but yeah. Ow. Ow. Okay. Cat. Alright. Fine. Thirty seconds. Right. Six. Go. All right. You join in? I did. All right. Now we go fish. Uh, bait on our way back after we finish the first job but uh, the fishing guy lets us do do his fishing work for him while we're doing the tournament so he I, I don't know he just he just likes doing both at the same time I guess interesting hey it's just a good way to make money Now I do ask if you if you catch sturgeons in the legal fish, please, good lord, do not put it in my truck. Keep it on yourself or throw it in a bush somewhere or something. All right. I do not you need don't... to catch a poaching charge. All right. I'll try not I to can get, get you I can give any you my legal fish but I don't want to keep them on me you know I can you can just have them no you you do what you need to do well I don't want them look at this guy speeding ahead of us knowing that I can't go that fast So like on the other side um well Ooh, for the first several hours it was pretty miserable i won't lie um i had i had an idea for the character and it just you know things did not transpire how i expected <laughs> i i 
Like, where's the fish and fly? Wait. Where now? Hold on, let me see. Top right, of ahead. Good, good, good. No, we are not a millionaire. We made, um... About $250 today. Our other stuff is just lurking in a dumpster somewhere. All right, let's get to work, you know? Grab my rod. <laughs> you know, an officer tried to get me for brandishing for having that rifle in my back while fishing before. Is it alright if I put mine away? Hey, go ahead and put it in there. Preferably the glove box, just so they don't check that. They normally don't. And now you just catch fish. Do you want my fish to sell? They don't sell for a lot. It's not really worthwhile. Um. I but think if I I'm give right. you my fish, it, it might be it might be a lot more. I don't know. I'm not too worried about it. All right. I just enjoy fishing, to be honest. It is quite relaxing. I quite enjoy the serenity of the water and the trees. So you think your family's ever going to come back and help you out, or...? Good lord, who knows? <laughs> uh, Purple Ninja, thank you for the sub! Sometimes they just appear, sometimes it's a family gathering. I do love it when my family's in town, though. <clears throat> You'll have to let me know next time they come around. Yeah, all right, of course. Mm-hmm. They're normally around a lot earlier than now, but yeah. <laughs> oh man. Chat, we are still on five times sub time, by the way. Oh, that one had a rock in its mouth. Ooh, a citrine! That one's worth money! How much you figure? Mm, those can be 300 to 400 dollars, which makes it a little more worthwhile than a jade, which is 100. But if you get enough of them, then you can sell them all at once and you get a pretty penny. That's why I don't throw them out. I keep the gems. Plus they're pretty anyways, and I like them, how they shine. I got another jade. All right. Well, you know, that's another hundred dollars.
I won't lie to you. It's disappointing whenever you, you feel you feel a stone and it's got and you pull it out as a god dang jade. But you know, money's money. It pays for gas. $100 is a no pixel penny. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> oh, what a what an interesting day it has been. Oops. Missed that one. It's rubbing my eye. Mm. Oh my god. What in the heck? What in the heck is happening? Um, well, first off, Mucka, thank you for that gifted sub to max volume. And then Anonymous coming in with the 50 sub bomb like a crazy person. Thank you so much, Anonymous. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> Timer go up. <laughs> Catching any fish? How's it going for all y'all? Uh, it could be going better. Yeah. It's just one of those days, I think. I am. My, my day started pretty bad, but it's gotten a lot better, actually. All right. Well, that's good. My day's been Met pretty my bad, new I... friend here. Oh. <gasps> what, what happened with your day? Uh, I woke up to all my properties being locked down, and I guess I'm being raided. I'm not really oh, sure why. Oh, my lord. Yeah. Well, I think you, do? you had you a, do? a worse day than I have. I don't think what I've done anything, in the world? but I'm friends with some crazy people, so I guess... I don't know, to be honest. Was it I your really specific don't... property, or is it like... Uh, one that you <laughs> share with someone? Oh no. Uh, no, well, well, it was my... I do share... My, like, uh, place in Polito with my girlfriend, but... It's also my apartments, my boats... My car is parked around the city, uh... <laughs> oh wow, they got everything. <laughs> oh no. You're fucked. I, I don't know. Is this guy we locked down the I other day? I don't have anything anywhere. I haven't done anything. It's crazy. Oh. Well, then you're fine. Is then. this, um... Yeah, just... Take yeah. this. Hopefully I'm fine. I don't... I can't. I'm nervous. Put some I'm things a... in the trunk. I can't. Put some things in the trunk. After you reel that one in. All right. All right. Well, I hope that whole raid business goes well for you. <laughs> yeah, me too. I think this is like the fifth time I've been raided, but I've never. <coughs> Nothing's ever come out of it, so. I can't believe somebody could just lock. Your whole life down like that. That's terrible. Ed, that ain't freedom. It's mm -mm. Sure ain't. <laughs> Got too much stuff on me. Okay, um. I'm gonna put. Not my fishing rod, what, what am I thinking? My knife and the rounds, I think, in here. Well, hmm. What sort of things your friends get up to? Um. I still can't. I 
Don't worry, I ain't no snitch. All right. Now they get into <clears> crazy <throat> stuff. It's not, not really for me. I, I literally can't. You got any friends up. that uh, perhaps uh, have a way of procuring firearms? Do I have that weighs Possibly, so much? But it's just a bunch of you stuff, I guess. You don't tell me their name. Just, just know that uh, I might be interested in procuring one. If you know any of that are able to get their hands on like a, a shotgun of sorts. <clears throat> shotgun. It's going to be kind of expensive these days. How expensive is it going to shotgun be? That's for the stubby one now? There's $30,000 for that? Yeah. Gee. What do you think, Viper? I, I was not paying attention. I was oh. <laughs> playing Tetris in your trunk. <laughs> what? How, how would you feel about a shotgun? A shotgun? Um... I think that might be kind of fun to have. I, I don't know if I could afford a shotgun right now. I could help you out with it. Don't know what I would do with it, really. Defend yourself? I don't know. I think probably something more discreet would be a better idea for me right now. Alright. Your friend's got anything discreet? Um. Uh, I mean, I, I mean, if I, I can make some calls, I guess, you know, it's, it's dangerous out there. I've even been robbed fishing before, so. Yeah, I've been robbed here before as well. That's why I got my piece on me. Yeah. yeah. I don't. I don't take too kind to the gangbangers coming up here and thinking they run this place. I shut that well, shit down quick. I, I tell you what, they're gonna have a hard time making off with anything in my pockets. Because <laughs> you got nothing. Well. I, th I think it's just a little too heavy. <laughs> yeah, it's terrible. I don't know. The gangs, they rob gold panners, fishers. I got robbed doing dodo recently. It's just like... <clears throat> it's rough in here. It sure do be. At least out here, it's nice and serene. Yeah, that's why I moved to Polito. Get away from all the noise and... The Mayhem are pretty cool, you know, so... <laughs> Most of the gang violence so stays in the city. Oh, man. I ain't gonna come up here too often, but when I see them, I, I, I tell them to get back where they're from. Which is not up here. Right. It is down there. It's been a good subathon chat. Thank you for all the support and everything. You guys have been amazing. I hope you've been enjoying the RP. I know um, the first half of the day was a little bit, <laughs> a little bit, not as I good. I only stay in the city as long as I need to. I will get right back. I'm glad Kermodo came and helped oh, me out. I'm being down there. It smells. I like it much better up here. Uh, yeah. Oh shoot, yeah. I didn't even realize I need to go talk with the man. Mm -hmm. I'll catch this last one. I remember when that, uh, 
These aliens are running around and there is a spore virus or something. Aliens? Yeah. I saw one with my own eyes. An alien? Yeah. That's nonsense. They ain't be aliens. Huh? The government has oh, that like stuff from some us. kind of conspiracy theory, to be honest uh, with you. I agree. No, I saw it on Facebook, so it must be true. Yeah, I saw an alien with my own eyes. Even they were up here in Polito. I'll be back. All right. Now, how would them aliens get through that that dome? The dome. Yeah, the dome we're all living under. Oh. I I was telling Curtis I think um that it's some kind of fiery hellscape outside of our dome, but he thinks it might be some kind of utopia. And they just trying to hide it. The government, they don't want us to know. And uh, if we have to, like, switch between the domes, we go in the airplanes, right? And there's a reason that you can't open the doors of an airplane when you're up in the air. They don't want you to know that they're transporting you between each dome. Yep. Yeah. And I don't think they'd let no aliens in that way. Oh. I um, doubt it. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I never thought of it that way. I mean... Huh. I don't really believe in aliens, to be honest with you. I think, uh... We's probably just alone in the universe. You think so? Probably. The universe is so big, though. Like, it's got to be something out there, no? Nah, I doubt it. But then, what were these these things I saw? That a bunch of people saw them. There was like sounds all over the city and. It was crazy. I, I think well, I saw cops like just die right in front of me trying to protect everyone. Maybe it's that um that 5G stuff getting into your brain. Yeah, that's true. Do you wear My your mom protective did covers? Warn me about that. Um No, maybe maybe I should. That's uh, your problem. You got to do that every night when you go to sleep. Where can I get yep. that? I don't... What do you mean, where do you get it? It's tinfoil. Covering... Oh, tinfoil. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh it it reflects like... everything. 5G, oh. uh, UV, X-ray, all them. Oh. Yep. HD... HD. Yep. CCTV. ESPN. Uh, you gotta dangerous. protect your brain. To be honest, I, uh, during that alien, or whatever it was, I guess, I did get pretty <laughs> sick. I was coughing up blood in the, in the burger shop bathroom, and apparently they were, like, taking people and doing weird tests on them. I, I don't know. My friends told me I should have went to a doctor, but I just kind of ran up to Polito and hit out over here. I got alternative medicines at Wild Child, and I felt better. I don't know. I was worried about the doctors. But maybe I should wear 
Take well, maybe they was injecting something in to the dome. Some kind of chemical. Some kind of gas. Chemical. Yeah, you That's never like know. In the air we breathe. Yep. Maybe it's in the water. Oh. You never know. Oh, the water. Mm-hmm. They control us from the outside. Somebody's what? out there. Oh, why would they do that to us? It's all about control. control. They want to manage the herd. I don't want to be controlled. Well, then, uh, you better wear your protective covering. Because otherwise... It's gonna all get to you. you, know, you make a good point. I think tonight before I go to bed, I'm gonna... Make myself a covering and... Make sure I'm wearing it. I don't think I caught your name, by the way. I'm, I'm Emma Jean. It's nice to meet you. My name's Dominic. Dominic Bastius. Like he's been too long. I, I'm a little concerned about him coming back. Yeah. That um. Maybe stop to get gas or some snacks. You went to Mojito Inn. They got really good gumbo over there. I thought we were about to get robbed there. You think? Yeah, I usually hear a car coming like that means Howdy! I'm get robbed. You all right? Hey, I'm fine. I almost got stuck. Uh, stuck? And by, and by I mean I almost got stuck. I mean I did. You need help? No, I'm good now. Okay. I'm on my way back. I'm almost there. All right. We're all right. Still thanks here. for checking on me, though. It's all right. I I just you took a little longer than I thought you were gonna. Well, I I went I went down the hill to go get some ammunition, or and not ammunition. I went to go get some uh some uh, some 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 uh, bait for later, but uh I I got the truck stuck in in a ditch. All right. On the way back. All right. I'll be here. All right, I'll see you shortly. Bye bye. Bye. He's okay. Nice. Do you get robbed up here often? Um. To be honest, I just started fishing again recently. Uh, stopped for a while because I was getting robbed a lot and I was hunting, but I lost my weapons license, so can't really hunt anymore. Yeah, I guess I just started fishing again since I can't hunt. Well, I mean. Sure you can, to be honest. I've been hunting without a license all day. 
Oh, no, no, no. I... Last time I tried that, uh, I got arrested, <laughs> so... I ain't gonna let the government tell me what I can and can't do. I did it again. Uh, are you stuck? Nah, I flipped it again. Oh. All right, you need help? Oh, no, I'll be one moment. I'll be there soon. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. I do what I want. Yeah, I mean, I, I did a few times, you know, just go hunting and a couple times, you know, I got in a chase and a bison that I rented and I got away, but uh, last time there was a lot of cops. There was mm -hmm. a lot of cops and uh... mm -hmm. I feel like this was one of the ones that got yeah. away from us the other day. Ended up being a lot of charges. I have so much stuff. Ooh. You fish up one of them fancy chests? Oh, wow. I wouldn't even bother keeping the fish up, by the way. Viper. I ain't it ain't gonna be no good. You, you gonna keep them? You keep, you're keeping a little dinky ones. Yep. All right. All right. <laughs> yeah, I'm enjoying myself, Rob. It's been fun. It's been an uh, eye-opening no, experience. You still do, uh, get guns from these uh, treasure chests. <clears throat> Can you now? And... Apparently, but. I don't know if that was you true. You can fish or not. up a gun? Apparently, like, treasure chests have guns in them. <laughs> that is good to know. That'd be pretty nice, but. Mine usually just have watches in them. It sure would be nice. Well, I don't really need them, but, you know, I, I hear guns are expensive now, so you say. Yeah, I used to be able to buy, like, these browning pistols for, like, 2 or 3k. Now they run you around, like, 20-something k. Shoo, <laughs> Yeah. I, think then I the am gang, disappointed people though. Just, uh, people in gangs just stop buying them for 20k and just go around. I think that's why the fishing and uh, gold panning people started getting robbed more. So they started robbing civilians for their guns instead of paying 20 or 30k for guns. Oh, must be it must be lucrative having a firearms license then, huh? Yeah. How much are they paying for civilian firearms? Um, I don't really know if people sell them anymore because there's like some new law that passed. But I think for a while they were selling for like eight to twelve k. Well, how much is the charge? I'll just put ten k plus how much the charge is. <laughs> yeah, I don't think the charge is that much, but I think you lose your weapons license. Oh shoot. 
Yeah. I lost my license a long time ago. I still have mine. I try and be smart about things. Okay. But thank you for letting me know there's a charge that'll get my license taken away if someone finds my firearm. Yeah, what? I think it's gotta be, you gotta report well, it. Well, what if I report it as stolen? Well, see, that's what I did, but, um... I thought a simple, like, uh, 911 call about it would be enough, but I had to go, like, file a report well, yeah, or something. Yeah, they don't, they don't ever check that. I know that, because I'll try and call them over 911. Whenever someone's been robbed <laughs> down here, they never come. Oh. I'd probably just go talk to an officer and be like, Hey, someone in blah, 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 stole my, my, my firearm. Didn't get a name, but it was this person. Now, see, that, that yeah, right there is, is exactly why... I don't want them documenting anything that I've got. Oh. We're trying to live off the grid. I don't need a license. I know how to Damn operate right. a firearm. I do it for my family. Wait, do you, do you not have a fishing license? You don't need a <clears throat> license to fish. Oh. Well, you know, I mean, there's... Certain species that are... I... You know, you know what? Yeah, you're right. So, <laughs> yeah. There. I got a bunch of stuff out of this box. Ooh, what'd you get? Rolls of money? And uh, Rolex watches? Watches will go for a decent amount if you get a lot of them, but they will weigh a lot. Uh, the money um, is pretty much worthless right now. Some people buy it, but... People only tend to want to buy them bands and not, not the little shitty rolls. Yeah, it's getting hard I, to find people want to buy these things. I'm guessing you don't want these in your car. The rolls? Oh, I already got some in there. I don't mind. If they find them, they only find them. Yeah, just don't put anything illegal in there, and they got no reason to, <laughs> you know, look. Well, I tell you what, they come up here and ask me for my stuff, I'm probably not going to provide anything to them. <laughs> Neither of you heard nothing, though. You got it. I didn't hear nothing, no, no. Uh, by the way, go ahead and eat the, uh, the curry. Oh, that's right. It's about that time. Um, <laughs> um, um, um. Wait, um, well, darn it. It also, you know, that curry is real nice, too. It makes it feel hearty.
God, I hate it. Yeah. Uh. Hopefully we all place. Oh, hopefully. Well, I mean, there's three of us. I, I, I'm pretty sure there's only three spots we can even. No, I've uh, I've been fishing by myself and not placed during the tournament. What? That's because you're fishing by yourself. Well, I've had uh, I've had like. Like yesterday, for example, it was me and this other guy, Aldern. I won and he didn't even place at all. Yeah, remember what I was telling you? I have a feeling why I know why he lost. I, I do too. Really? Why did... Mm. What happened? I think it's something we're like... gonna have to um, take a deeper look at. Deeper look. Yeah. Hmm. But the I'll time be looking I didn't into one, it. I uh, think I didn't hook enough fish. And I also arrived a bit late, so I'm not sure. Like, I kind of missed some a lot when I was, uh, reeling in the fish. So I was like, oh, maybe I missed too many fish. I'm not sure, though. Didn't you say you placed? Oh, uh, yeah, but the time I came, uh, I was the only one in the tourney and didn't place. That time I was thinking, why did I not place? And I was like, well, I did miss a lot of fish that day. So I was thinking maybe well, I was, you, you need there needs to be luck. enough people in the tournament for him to pay out. Otherwise, he says it's you know not enough people. That uh, makes sense. The other thing, on the other hand, well, that's just uh. <laughs> Hopefully, something will be done about that part. Well, uh, hopefully more people can fish. I remember when I first moved into town, there were so many people fishing. I met a lot of good friends that way. Yeah, so did I. About a year ago, there was tons of people out here. But yeah. I feel like when you're new in town, you know, it's a good way to come fish and meet people. And... Absolutely. I'm not really sure what happened. People, people don't fish anymore. There's so many sturgeon. Why are there so many sturgeon, dude? Good lord. With my friend I did not place. I was with you two, and it was us three, yeah. and then I didn't place. It's interesting, isn't it? There is no one else there. Yes, the van is going to smell very badly. Tournament should be in soon anyways. Did I say thank you to Rat Judge for the 10 gifted? Did I miss those? Am I crazy? My chat looks different now with everything um, updated. I don't know why. Nice. And it's harder for me to see what's coming through on my feed because it's on my other screen. I don't like that. All right, mostly had watches in that one. That's what I like to see. 
best ones are the gold bars. The Sable 7 like TV? Okay. You can get gold bars from these things. Yeah, you can get some gold bars. What those the are usually the, the good ones. Jimstone! Jade. Damn. Those shades add up if you have room for them. They do. So you got a journey over there. Those things got a lot of room. Hey, I love my journey. I live in it. It, it gets me from place to place. It does everything I need. It's a nice ride, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Blacky for fail. Thank you for the five gifted. Any time now. What are you? You don't cross the stream. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Your, your, your fishing rod was over mine. It's, it's fine. What You're the hell is it? This is fine? Th this okay, right get here? It, get this get it out of my face. Get It ain't jousting. Kind of is. <laughs> All right. Oh, nice. I placed first. Oh, okay, I got second. Nice. Uh, what? Did you not? Did you not place? How do I know? It would have uh, popped up on your email. phone. Do you have more money? No. Did you not sign up? I did. He told me I was good. Did you sign in the fishing or did you sign on to the tournament? I signed on to both. You may wow. have accidentally undone it. That's all I can think that you may have done. Out of there! Plain County Mountain Rescue, would anyone like some complimentary coffee first aid? Oh my oh, god, I thought you were going to rob us with that mask. Yeah, I thought, oh, no, I thought no, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. Good lord, I was going to pull <laughs> on you. Yeah, no, same no, no, here. Sorry. I was about to... Uh, oh, no honey, the, food the or water? <laughs> All right, um... Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm good for now, I appreciate it, though. Do you have a bandage? Nice I, I scraped my yeah, knee yeah, earlier. Ooh, all right. Yeah. Thank you, you so kind. Oh, this no, is I'll leave a coffee as well in case anyone knows. Thank you. I can actually use a coffee right now. Right, will you stay safe, everybody? Give us a call if you run into any trouble. Oh, coffee? Absolutely. Thank you so much. Yeah, there you go, of course. Like I said, anything else you need, just give us a call oh, on the other pages. All right. All right, stay safe, everyone. Thank you. Up on in, Viper. That's uh, two sturgeon over there on the ground. If you want them, I can't carry them. No, I don't want them. Are you keeping yours? Uh, yeah. Do you want those? Do you want me to go get them? No, that's all right. All right. 
I'll give you half of what I made I, since you're I think I'm just a up. little pack rat. I, I collected everything from that. <laughs> it's all in your trunk except for the illegal stuff. That's impressive. All right, let's go. Uh, sorry, we're going the other way. My bad. Well, sorry, sorry about sorry. The, the smell, too, by the way. I... Oh, no, it's There's fine. A lot of <laughs> I'm used to smells. <laughs> all right. Let's go, let's go put this in the dumpster next to the other dumpster. And then we can hunt Do for I, the rest of I the night. I need to talk to that man with the, the fish stuff, or...? Uh, we can talk to him later. We shouldn't be out too long. Uh, that man in the car might go talk to him for us. Be real nice if he did. What in the world? Howdy! Yo. Have a good one. I'm pulling my gun. I don't trust no city slickers and fancy race cars on an ocean or a river. I, I, I got his finger right there for him. Like I'm trying to think. <laughs> I think those were gold panners. There's a chance we don't make it up this. <laughs> oh, look, he did it for us. We got money. All right. Thousand dollars. Not bad. Money. Also, yeah, I owe you 10 off that 20 since yours fumbled up. Oh, that's all right. I'm not too concerned about it. No, no, I got. Miss, I got way more money than I know what to do with. I know he definitely told me I, I signed up, so I don't really know. Um, why that happened? If you signed up, you should have gotten third, or at least second, because you, you did the way well, it currently like works, he you signed up on second. after us. That, which is why I'm thinking that something fumbled, which is why you didn't get any money at all. Maybe. Hey. Uh, I mean, you can always check your bank statements to see if they deposited any. I don't mind giving you at least some since you didn't get any. I feel bad. Well, we got what's in that dumpster, don't we? We do got what's in that dumpster. Yeah. Oh, and I can sell them other fish that I had. That's true, but we do got to go at night for that, and but we got to hunt at night. We are oh, at Lord. Me. I, I do not want them tailing me right now. Ooh, you see them? Are they tailing us? I don't think so. Oh my good lord. I'm sorry. You, re you really kept everything, I, didn't you? I'm a pack rat. I can't help it. I can't help it. Maybe your name should have been Rat. Oh no. What's wrong? It's all gone? No, it's in the other dumpster, silly. What? The other dumpster! Oh, did we empty this one out first? No, we, we emptied the other one. No, we definitely didn't empty this one. I remember we haven't come back here since we put it all in. No, uh, you're, the, the, the dumpster we filled is up there. Where? Further up. Also, don't keep the fish oil. It is li Nobody actually buys that. Oh, alright. I thought this was the... Where am I? 
We're at the same place. We're just one dumpster back. There's two dumpsters. There's one over there, one here. Oh, I see. Yeah, we're here to store all the fish. All your illegal fish, too. You grab everything. You can keep my gemstones. I don't need them. Let me know when you're done in there. All right. Doo -doo -doo. There we are. Anything else in here weighing us down? Uh, do you mind taking the uh, murder meal? Grab your gun, grab your knife, and grab 15 bait. I will know when you grab those two things, and I'll get us back out into hunting position. Got it. All right. Here, you know, let me put my rod back in there. You can keep yours in there, too. I don't mind. Um, so apparently, uh, the I'm fish... I'm sad that your fishnet uh, broke out there. Oh, this ain't gonna work like I thought it was. Oh, Lord. I need to be able to get up this. I guess I can't no more. It's all right. So the, the fish, um, the smaller fish, we don't have to put in the dumpster, Ooh. but we're not going to the fish guy yet. Um, the big fish, apparently you have to let them, like, dry. Uh, Ooh. he won't take them fresh. And then, um, no. he, he also only takes them at night, which is really, I don't know why. This ain't the best off-road vehicle that was ever built, but it can do it. <laughs> I believe in you. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I guess it's curing the fish, the big fish. Um, apparently you can't sell the big fish until you've waited a certain amount of time. And like, you can only sell them at night. So a couple of those fish I probably could sell right now. Plus all the small fish would be fine. But we have to like. Oh shoot! Uh. Well, it won't make hunting impossible, but it's gonna make getting up that hill nearly impossible. Oh, when it's storming. Oh Lord, what? We can what try to get Disturbing. Might as well try. Oh, yeah, they make oh, it Lord, up the hill. Oh, Lord, all the deer. We got a boar, and we got... Is that a mountain lion? That's uh, deer. 
Pops over there. Is that a boar? That's a boar. All right, you shoot the deer, I shoot the boar. Uh, on go, all right? Three, all right. two, one, go. Well, wow. oh. Did you miss? Apparently twice you miss, I missed. You missed. I got it, I got it. <laughs> How did I miss though? <laughs> I don't know, but get in. Actually, you don't need to get in. Unless you like the rain. I don't know how you feel about it. A little water never hurt nobody. It's true. Although I am kind of a lightning rod right now. You are a little bit that's of okay. one. That's okay. That's alright. There's trees off on the distance. I'm sure it will hit you. <laughs> After three weeks of PD shenanigans, it's been a relaxing mental break. Yeah. <laughs> I'm worried about resuming PD shenanigans and what is waiting for me when I come back. I'm scared. I'm so scared. Everything's gonna be on fire. All right. said we should be eating, eating the smart stuff but I guess we you should try at least eating your smart cookie I guess I don't know why but I guess you should try I don't know all I said the I'm ready. All right, go. Sink. We got this dam. We're getting Good it. Good lord, this thing's so slow in the rain. <laughs> no. Oh lord, it slides down so much worse. <laughs> oh, there's one deer. Where's the other one? There's two of them there. Well, that that one wasn't that one that one ain't ain't fighting. Oh. Hey, it's a uh, that's a different deer. Unfortunately. Um, there's three deer. Oh, there, there it is. There it is. I see a boar. Oh, all um, right. Oh, you shoot the boar. I shoot the deer. All right. All right. Three, two, one, go. That should be right. Hopefully I didn't fuck up. Ooh -wee. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you had a good night. Um, painting platypus, by the way. Thank you for the 19 months. Welcome back. 
It has been a good day. Very much, um... Eye-opening to a lot of different things going on. Another good one? lard if you want. Otherwise, I'm just going to throw it out. I've been putting it in the truck. All right. Where, where's my bait? Where's my bait go? I don't know where my bait went. There it is. All right. You want to see the email to Sincere? My dearest Sincere, I hope this letter finds you well. Listen. Today was a miserable experience. And I feel bad that I have allowed this to go on as long as it has. Look at that! We have to fix this problem. <laughs> because I didn't realize I was gonna, what I was, I was, gonna was doing to people. It's gonna slide. Yep. It's just, you know what? It's fine here. All right, I see a boar. And a mountain lion. All right. Go ahead and shoot the boar. Mountain lion's, mountain lion does not run off. Don't shoot it. Not yet. I'm going to try and chase it off. I, I believe in your aim. I believe in you. We're gonna scare it off. All right, that's a good direction for it to run. You can probably shoot it now. No, Lord. Shoot. <laughs> no, that's nowhere. All right. Try it again. It's down there. It's running up the hill, up the hill, up the hill, up the hill. To a bush. I don't see it. Oh, I don't see it. That's all right. What did you just shoot? I thought I, thought I shot it. I don't think I got it. Try that again later. <laughs> uh oh. Howdy. How you doing? Pull up, pull up top on the flat, please. <laughs> oh. Finally. I'm trying to get out. Give me a moment. Oh Lord. Where's he going? Should I run? Yeah, go over to the ball. What? Get over to the ball for me. Thank you. Also searching here. See if they do anything over here.
You've you already killed. You have never asked my ID before. Why are you now? Because you're hunting. All you right. Hunter? I need to check your license. Man. Hey, I gave you my my ID before. I'm Curtis. <laughs> I don't remember a Curtis, I remember a Max. Alright, well, we. Ma'am, I need you over here too, don't walk away. Here's my ID. Stay right there. Group up, shall we? Let's let's group huddle, group huddle, group huddle. What's the what's the matter, sir? So, well, firstly, I need to see both your IDs, and then I we, showed we need you to, mine. Uh, I need I need to see your ID. I showed you oh, mine. Oh, you too. I need yours too, ma'am. Yeah. Now, why do you need to see my ID? Because uh, we have pictures of you shooting wildlife, and we need to check if you uh, have the correct permits. Pictures of me shooting what? Wildlife. What kind of wildlife? Uh, I believe your take so far has been a boar, two deer, and the cougar you chased over the hill while shooting. We were scaring that one <laughs> off. By shooting at it? Well, how else I you didn't get shoot it, did I? It looked you like you were didn't. trying to shoot it. No, warning we shot, were scared sir. It away. Hey, Anthem, did you did you now. find a corpse over there? Was there a corpse? Uh, no, I didn't see any corpse over there. Exactly, because mm -hmm. we weren't killing it. Now, were we? However, no under the... <laughs> no, there's no blood or anything. Not that I can see. But it's raining, so who knows? Mm -hmm. However, under the hunting legislation, if we ask you for your license, you do have to comply and give that to us. Yeah, we do need to see those licenses, especially from you, ma'am. I got yours, sir, so I'll run your information now. Make sure you guys uh, aren't poaching. You can That's go ahead and run mine. I got all my licenses. All right, Bantam, do you want to sort out the lady? I'll sort out a gentleman. Yep. Ma'am, do you have yours? Now, I kind of want to level with you here, all right? Uh, now, why do I need to have some kind of who's a what's it uh, license you said? Yeah, you need a hunting license. What for? Well, in order to shoot or skin an animal, you need to have a license. And the fact that you have a hunting rifle with you, and I guarantee if I were to grab a GSR test, you're probably positive, it means that you would need a license in order to be hunting in the mountains. Or anywhere, realistically, but... I see, I see. Well... I don't believe that is uh, in accordance with my own civil rights. You know, I believe it's my God-given right to own a firearm. I don't believe I need to be a regulated and assimilated, and I don't think I need to have that. Okay, ma'am, where do you live? I don't have a domicile, sir. Okay, well, what country are we in right now? Well, I suppose this the U.S. of A. Correct. Which means in order to have a firearm, you need a license. Which means even to shoot that firearm, even though you're using hunting purposes, you still need a weapons license. And in order to hunt, you which means in this state, the act of shooting and skinning, you need a hunting license. Now, you can bait perfectly fine. Don't need a license for that. However, in order to shoot and skin, you need a license. I see. Well, um, I simply don't agree. I think that is a violation of my own rights. I think if I'm going to live out here, I need to be able to defend myself from these critters running around. I think I should be able to have my own firearm. I should have my own ability to hunt for my food and take care of myself. You're 100% allowed to have those rights. In fact, you do have those rights with the proper identification and licensing. You don't just have those rights because you were born here. Otherwise, we wouldn't have laws and we wouldn't have licenses.
So you right, do have so the right to hunt, and you say, do have the right to say, hunt ha, a firearm, ha, but you need ha, medically, um, what if I don't have these licensures? Well, if you don't have the licensure, then you're poaching at this point. You're, you're acting, Poaching? Uh, yeah. You're what taking you wildlife mean? without the proper licensing, and therefore that would be illegal, which means you would be going to jail. Uh, and we'd also be seizing the pelts in which you have uh, got, because they were obtained unlawfully. Mm-hmm. What kind of... This, this is clean, a, by the a way, violation man. of my rights. No, no, the violation is the fact that you don't have a license. Well, it going? what if I, I did not go know I needed those sort of things, considering the way that I live my life? What does that mean? The way you live so, your life? I'm a bit of a, a nomad. I, I kind of do whatever I feel like. And whatever I feel like is not living under the thumb of the government. All this uh, supervision, whatnot, all this licenses, who do hickeys, who's the what's it's. I did not know I needed any of that. Am are you a sovereign citizen? I think she's trying to be one but not a very good one. I am a citizen under this same dome that you live under. Which is the federal government. We all live under this dome. Oh my god, a deer. That was his deer. Okay, but the dome it's has just... the same rules for all its inhabitants. Well, now that that's where we disagree, I think. Well, ma'am, mm. even if you don't know the law, that would still be ignorance on your end, and ignorance is no excuse for the law. So, unfortunately, uh, even though you say you don't know the law, maybe you should look into the laws uh, before you do something, correct? You're not just going to go buy a car and not know the road laws, right? You're going to want to know how to operate the vehicle. That way you can maintain safety uh, procedures and standard procedures. Like, and does she have a license? Well, I don't, uh, she's not giving me I don't in fact sure own a car, so yeah, I sure. think that sort of argument kind of confuses me even further, to be honest with you. Why would I need to learn about cars when I don't have a car license? I don't have a, a car to, to drive. I don't need to drive on the road. So if that confuses you, then shooting... If, if getting, if not knowing about cars confuses you because you don't have a license, so you don't need a car, then if you, I'm assuming at this point that you don't want to give us your ID because you don't have a license or are you just being annoying about it? <laughs> I, I beg your pardon. I am not being annoying. I am defending myself because I have rights. She does have rights. Ma'am, you do you have the right him. to shoot. You do have the right to defend yourself. And you do have the right to own a, v uh, a gun. The issue is, is that you have all of those rights as long as you get the proper registration and licensing associated with those rights. Exactly. So freedom ain't free here. That's the, that's the problem, right? Freedom ain't free. So like think, think about if everyone operated ID. like you operate, right? Like just didn't care, didn't follow the regulations. Ah, uh, cougar here, sturgeon there. Um. I don't know, snapping turtle over here. Suddenly, Where's your nomad proof life. that you're even officers? He shot uh, I can show you, actually. I can I can show you if you want. What? I mean, he, he, here you go. Officer Bantam. Former LSPD, now UPD. But, oh, it's you. <laughs> it's it's Bantam. Yeah, it's yeah tum -tum. I met you earlier. I met, I met you, you earlier, earlier at the yeah. gas station. Yeah, yeah exactly. He's he's yeah. clear, by the way. He's got a license. He's, he's so you guys were gotcha. watching us just up the hill? Well, yeah, yeah, we gotta make How sure you guys are. How long were you there for? Uh, <laughs> ten, ten minutes? Five ten minutes. Probably not even that long. Why are you minutes, stalking yeah. us, you freaks? You know that's illegal? No, it's called no. investigation. Hello? It's Curtis. I cannot oh, man, believe you. If you, want the, if you, want, the, if you want the reason we're up here, we're looking for fishermen, but there ain't any, so. Yeah. Figured we'd do uh, mountain patrol instead. Now. What is going to happen to me if I comply with your demands? 
So, uh, so hold on, Ben. Give me the background. The, because we we've, we've got pictures of her shooting stuff. So yeah. I'm gonna like if she complies and we get her ID. Um, what what was the background like before that? The so nomad, sovereign citizen type. I I missed the. She the she early basically stuff. doesn't believe that she believes it's her right to own a gun and shoot animals for her own food and doesn't believe in licensing because she doesn't believe in the government telling her what to do. Okay. Essentially. So you don't. You, I mean, you don't have to believe in what the government tells you to do, but if Why you want to. Why do you even need her you, ID in the first place? What if she doesn't have it on her? Oh, then we can take her to the station and get her fingerprints, um, and that can be a whole nother oh, ordeal. That, that oh like my lord, lot, that, that sounds a whole lot, lot worse. I don't want to be documented. Yeah. Put and it in a number system. Oh this my lord, she, never she, come. she's living like a real American. I'm gonna right have a hissy. I'm gonna have a hissy. Then, then give, right. give us your ID. Anthem, you're gonna turn this into Waco, man. Let's chill. Wait, okay, I, I don't think Waco. Listen, officers, uh, we, we already can talk, had Waco. We, we, we can talk about Sandy this, Shore. all right? We can talk about this. Yo, now, so what, we're, we're what, what is easy. actually the problem here? Well, we don't know if there even is a problem. She won't give us her ID, so we can confirm if there even is a problem or not. She has now, a second amendment, doesn't she? The right to bear arms, I correct, do. with proper licensing. Now, where does it say that? In the legislation. And we can, I mean, if you if you would like to accompany us to City Hall, we can run you I'd through like the legislation. I'd like to hear this legislation. Why don't you read it out on that fancy tablet of yours? All right. <laughs> you looking at it? Yeah, I'm grabbing it. You'll, you'll find it faster, honestly. <laughs> I'm, I'm being such a pest. Oh my God. It's okay, yeah, but... take your time. I mean, it's only raining. Yeah, but I like the rain. I don't I Wait, don't B, want what? her to run yet. I don't want her to be that way yet. I want her to give them I a chance. Run, what are you doing here? Run. <laughs> I'm just hanging out. What are you guys doing? I'm having my rights violated by these two individuals. Uh, no, they're not being violated, Ron. Hey, Ron, you believe that? CFO is probably pretty clean right now, to be honest. Oh All this rain. San Andreas State Department of Wildlife job. Regulation. No, so all officers are yeah, best of the authority for you know, I'm, I'm gonna head over there. Man, no. Inspections of hunting and <laughs> Easy. Hey there. Hi, how are you? My name's Emma Jean. Thanks for the help. Oh, oh Julie, it's a pleasure to meet you. My name's Ryan. <laughs> okay, what was I saying about not running? The rain, it does not like the rain, I tell you that. <laughs> so how are you? I'm alright. I was shooting at a mountain lion and they totally caught us red handed. Oh my goodness. Oh my lord, I'm, I appreciate the save. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Where you I going? feel bad for poor uh, Curtis. I hope he gets out of there. Oh, he said not to worry about it. He call you? I no, no. I'm not no? allowed to say. I'm not supposed to tell you. Well, I heard him say something like "get on the bike," so I would imagine he trusted you. I hope you ain't taking me nowhere I'm of your regret. Oh, you gosh, no. Where do you need to go, by the way? Where you want? I don't know where I'm supposed to I take think you. I think it might be best if I. Oh! <laughs> oh my lord, are you alright? Oh no, where is he? Oh god! Yeah, hit me on the back real quick. Hit me on the back. Go ahead. Quick tap. <laughs> alright, oh, you got you. it? Thank you, I'm okay now, thank you. Oh boy, that was scary. I probably ought to, uh, get somewhere I can maybe hide this gun. Oh, okay. What about you thinking? I don't know, maybe some dumpster somewhere? Oh, okay. 
Well, yeah, we'll head over here. No, we will drive over here. I come here to cry a lot. You come here to to what? To cry. Oh. Yeah, you um, go to place for crying. Are you all right? Oh yeah, no, I'm great. Because of the crying. <laughs> That is scary. Oh my goodness. You like it? That is tough. That is... I like it. That's good. That's good. That's really scary. My daddy gave this to me. Oh, yeah. You like really in your like skulls or something? Nah, just hunting. Oh, okay. okay. Well, um, uh... Excuse me. Is that on me? Oh, he just run. Yeah, we're great. Yeah, absolutely. I, uh, <laughs> you know, you are, you are free to go how much you think. It's okay. Great, that is <laughs> perfectly great for me. I love it. Thank you. Okay, okay, no worries. Uh, hmm. Where shall we go? We may start with your M M J M J. Which are they? Emma Jane. Oh, okay. Where would you Where would you like to go? I think I might need just to lay low somewhere and for later. Well, yeah. yeah, yeah, I could do that. Right? Okay, all right, goodbye. I said the yellow jack uh, is where we're gonna go. But hey, the best all place right. to lay low, I think, is Polito. Also, because it rhymes, you know, lay low, Polito, it's good, it's good, right? I can't believe the pee pee man came and saved me. <laughs> of all the things that could have happened today. <laughs> that was not on my list of things I expected. <laughs> Wait, there you are. All right. Thank you very much. Um, you very do, welcome. do I owe you anything? For the, uh, no, assistance? No, absolutely not. No, I, you know, right. I don't care about my... I don't, I, you know, I'm just, I'm just here to be helpful and be on, you know, now I see it all, I was kind of sad. You know what, no, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna, it was nice meeting you. Good meeting you too. <laughs> Oh my god, I honestly, that was very unexpected for me. I, So I was in the middle of saying, um, I don't really want her to run because I knew that if I ran, she was going to get caught and then... Am I sitting at a weird angle? Um... Is this better? Is this is this any better? Hello? Testing one two three.
Okay, well, sorry about that. Um... I didn't want her to run and get caught like that. Uh, I wanted her to have an opportunity if she uh, if she needed one um, to cooperate with the police and see if they would work with her. You like that little trick? That was great. I didn't expect them to come on a bike. I thought it was going to have a car or something. What a strange What's little piss uh, man that guy is. I, I had to dump my stuff in a dumpster back by that. Um, there's a gas station with the purple dinosaur. The gas station? What'd you dump? My gun and such. All right, we can pick that fuck up in just a second. It's too, it's too early to hunt, anyways. Um, let's go ahead and go get them pelts sold, and I'm um, betting them rangers are gonna come back uh, to the pelt store to see if we bring any illegal pelts. So let's not bring any illegal pelts with us the first time around. All right. All right. Yeah, they uh, they took your pelts though. They I, I told them it was the ones on the right, so they took them. That's fair. Uh, well, that's the cost of doing crime now, ain't it? <laughs> I would say so. I don't see it as a crime, but they do. So and they got the jurisdiction. It didn't sound like they was gonna um, cooperate. All right, but yeah, next time just keep doing what you did there and stall. That was brilliant. You didn't, they didn't actually get your ID, did they? Nope. <laughs> All right. That's real smart. What were you gonna do if I didn't call uh, call anybody down? I don't really know, to be honest. I I running was thinking. Would probably be a good thought. I was thinking about running, but then I thought, you know, maybe if I play ignorant. Um, I might be well, able to tell you some heart charge, strings. You're never getting a license ever. And, unless you talk with the rangers, and I don't see you doing that. Alright, let me move these over. Give me one moment. Alright, just put them all, all the way at the bottom of that dumpster there for me. Did he put garbage right. in my truck? Oh my god, he did. <laughs> oh, it's full of food. He gave me food, and he gave me an empty bag. All right, well, I'll take food. All right, let me move uh, all these over. I'll let, since you've gone through so much trouble today, you can sell all these. I don't care. All right. As long as you don't mind that, I I'll, uh... I mean... Yeah, we didn't get much from this trip, but that's all right. We got the other one as well. It's the least I could do. And next time we got to be a little bit more vigilant and looking out for them officers. <laughs> I, I was I told not you that they paying failed. attention. Told you. I told you they'll do that. And sure enough, they did. They surely did. I've not been more glad that I missed in a while. <laughs> yeah, that was a good lie. Cook on your feet too, ain't you? All right, this is as loaded as up as I can get it. Let's go ahead and sell this batch. I'll let you sell it all. <laughs> Sorry. Now, uh, do you still have your uh, your charismatic Meowchi Mocha ice cream? I do. You're gonna need to eat that and share it with him. He likes ice cream too. You think that he's gonna be waiting for us? Mm, oh, that's a good point. 
Uh, sit in the back, put your head down. Perfect. <laughs> it's so obvious. <laughs> it just stay like that. I'll take it off road so they don't think too much about it. <laughs> oh my god, bro. <laughs> uh, just stay in the truck. Um, here, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna do a little math. I'm gonna see how much I have right now. I have $2,100. I'm gonna do math. I'm gonna sell them all and then I'll give you the money. All right. Cause I don't want you risking anything. Obvious. Taught, but they loosen it up sometimes when I pull it out of the garage. Oh my god, I cannot believe this day. I'm glad I stayed on. Yeah, he said he's gonna do the math, not meth. Although he might do math, uh, meth as well, I don't know. It's possible. Uh, ketchup, thank you for the 47 months. Oh my goodness. Ugh. How we looking? this. My math's correct. That's about eighteen thousand dollars from that alone, and we still got more to grab. Oh my lord! You see them? They're taking pictures of me. Keep your head down. Oh my lord! Keep your head down. Oh no. <laughs> They're coming. <laughs> what is he doing, bro? <laughs> Time to 
follow traffic laws. <laughs> oh no. Do they think I don't see them? <laughs> Oh my god. Don't say anything. Don't respond to me, but I don't think they think I see them. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull ahead. I'm gonna hope they don't see you. I'm gonna have you hop out behind a building, alright? No, oh, they're up. Up out, I'll come get you later. Get in that building. Or hide somewhere. Oh no, they're gonna find me. Oh my god. <laughs> he is so good. I cannot believe that this is working. Oh, good lord. Oh, he's running! <gasps> oh no! No! Curtis! Curtis, no! Oh, I can't do anything. I can't do anything for him. I am so sad. I'm so sad right now. Why is he running? Will he be fine? I mean, if they're following him, if he's running, he's already... I don't know what to do.
I'd rather go to jail with him than have him... But I don't know. I, like, I have nothing. I don't... I have... Me. Come pick me up. What's the? I'll, I'm back where you left me. I'd rather They're you. They're trying to pit me. They're pitting you. <laughs> Come pick me up. What are you gonna do? I'm going down with you. I don't think that's a good idea. They're gonna try Why? to get me for accomplice the poaching. What do they have on you? I apparently, I, when did we shoot a panther? Oh lord, they must have seen the one that we had in the... Did we shoot a panther? I didn't think we scanned one. Uh, that, that one that was the, the black one? That was definitely oh, a... Oh shoot, uh, that one! Yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot <clears throat> about that one. Oh, I wouldn't have let them search my car. They had nothing on me! Damn it, I should have thought, th thought about that one. Oh well. Are you still being pit? Oh, uh, they're trying, but they, they ain't gonna pit this thing. At least not well. I'd, I'd rather go with you than have All right, you go down with me. Alright, I'm coming back to me. get you. I we could surely try, but... I could try and call Ron again. They're gonna impound my vehicle, though. I, I'd rather go down with you, because you, you've been a solid one for me today. I, I don't want to leave you in a, a pickle. It's fine. It's unfortunate, though. I mean, it's not going to be too much of a hit. I mean, I made a lot of money today. Uh, where are you at? I'm back at that building you left me at. I hid in some bushes. All right. I'm coming on by. I'm also going to call Ron. All right. All right. See you shortly. All right. No, what are they doing? Oh, why am I standing? What? Hello? Down. <laughs> There's still a chance to outmaneuver him. I mean... <laughs> bro, bro, stop standing. You're not getting away in this way, Curtis. Yeah, right. <laughs> like two A's and like two more. I don't want to have to put. I don't, don't want to have to pay me, please. Oh, We're I'm gonna not have going to. to. You. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. oh Lord. Stop They're going to kill us. Oh, They're going to kill us. We take poaching very seriously. <laughs> They're trying to kill me. Just give up. We got rats. Give up. That's all you have to do. Just give up. You right. have the right to remain silent. Curtis, you swore to me you were clean. <laughs> I was clean, I thought. <laughs> okay, well then, Curtis. Where did you get, yeah, then you can talk to I us, man. I honestly don't remember. <clears throat> Where do you see this going? I see you no, in a jail cell. Make a deal. Well, 
we where are do what? I see this going? Oh, another or trail. What? We can make it to you, Save Valley for the day. Oh no. <laughs> we get up, we draw reckless a bit. How's about that, man? That's how reckless can I be in this thing? you again i'm gonna be very sad he never okay. assisted me the first I, time curtis i won't be mad i'll just be disappointed <laughs> oh lord oh my god oh my god what in the world i don't know that local's trying to kill me yeah. local local gang on top go with wrong go leave him alone go with leave wrong him alone. <laughs> no, you don't. Don't get I'm off. I'm going mad at you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> cup. oh my god. One taser for each person. One taser for each person. No, I got one. No, lead. wash. No. <laughs> oh, 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 in the way, why? I've got 195. I've got your lethal. I'm doing it. Go, I'm going. Leave I'm me. Here. Leave me. Right, okay, where's he going? Where's he going? Go, go, go. Big stay with this one. I'll stay, I'll stay with her. Go, 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 go. I'll stay with her. He went towards uh, Sonora. He's in a giant camper. We can't lose him, right? <laughs> how, how do we lose a giant you sure camper? About that? Wait, Ron, Ron's behind, like, behind you. Ron's behind you. I feel Ron's like you all Okay, watch this. <laughs> Run, Ron. Yeah, Vaughn's got a warrant <clears throat> for helping them earlier. That bike is an S plus. You're probably not gonna catch it. Hey, right, ma'am. Gonna take your mask what? off. What? Right, ain't no or way we what? just lost a camper van. I'm so <laughs> <laughs> because you want to do a vest. That's a fur what? <laughs> Y'all lost the camper. Okay, listen. Nice. Uh, I want to hear it, lady. I got You're what I best. wanted. I, I got what I wanted. You, what you did you medical? want? You have no clear I, goals except I not to give us ID. I don't know. Uh, I don't think I, I need medical. Nope. I'm good. Yeah, Max probably on Max probably on the S plus plus, but I'll I'll give him a call. You need no medical. I'm I'm all set. Okay, well, Miss Jean said, well, guess what? I Emma, got what I wanted. Emma Jean. Okay, well, you know what I got? Your name and your fingerprints and all that good stuff is gonna be in our database now. Hey, Bentham, I don't mean I'm to break up the party, disgusting. but I kind of want to go secure the pelts before the guy in the yeah, camper van go. goes and clears everything out. What pelt? He was poaching. We're not. Yep. No, he was. He had pants uh -uh. pelt. Uh-huh. Prove it. Uh, drop me off at SESO. I'll stay with her, and then uh, we can go get uh, you can go get him. Because he's going to go sell those pelts, 100%. All right, I... There's no way... <laughs> McTavish, boy. Tully. He didn't even try to save. No. Yeah, we, we'll try and get you Moto, but I, I don't see Moto detaching from the S++ for a poaching call. Honestly, sure. if you're chasing only a bike with Ron, I would just say break off for now um, and just go help on the S++. Aww. Because you're going to lose eventually staff. if you're just one unit.
Right, I'm actually so despair that that camp of I camp. Uh, go join me off at SDSO real quick so we don't take care of I can. Team. Yeah, alright, lady. I'm surprised you don't have a cabin in the woods surrounded by booby traps the way you talk. I wish I did, and then I could go there and have them booby traps triggered on all you guys for chasing me. Well, technically, we, we weren't chase chasing you. You got in a car. Yeah, we were chasing him. There you go. Wait, where are you going, man? What are you doing? Uh, wait, this I was is just time sensitive, man. I know, but we don't oh, want to yeah, take okay, her. Okay. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> that, you I'll go, go, you go on that, I'll take her, yeah. We can't no, take her no, to a no. Y'all can take me. Huh? No, Fine, that's I not how this works. In the car. Because then, no, because then we can put you in danger. Why and not? I ain't doing that. Because that's not how we operate. You don't, my think, custody, you don't think putting means... me in, in a database with the government is putting me in danger? I well, feel maybe, like that is, that is more of a risk you're putting me under than anything else. Well, maybe, but I can't be sued for this. I guess search you again one more time. Oh yeah, 100%. He's getting a warrant for that. I don't think she has one. I need to look her up still. So. Right, I'm going to search your possessions, okay? For what? Uh, because you're going to prison. <laughs> All right. I'm going to take your mobile fingerprint here, okay? I guess so, because I can't I do nothing about it, because y'all is tyrants. What tyrants? Y'all were poaching. Prove it. We did. We both witnessed a panther pelt in the back of that camper that you willingly got into and were willingly putting pelts into. Yes. Does it really? Grab. Grab all of those. I am willing to bet that these two individuals were the two that were fishing. Which is willing, why they had so willing which, to is bet. Why they probably willing had so to few bet. Pelts Do you have so any evidence that we was doing that? You okay, are she, she, willing to I'm bet. I'm pretty sure her being uh, defensive is telling me a lot. On those, you know, not really PC, but I'm willing to bet uh, these two were fishing. Excuse these two were catching me? illegal fish, and then they went hunting after. No, we can't prove it, but. You can't. Oh my lord! You can't prove it. Yeah, yeah, but... no, hundred percent. Uh, yeah, we can't prove that was you, but I'm willing to bet it was you, which it doesn't hold it up in court. Work. But it means we're on to you, Emma Jean. It means we're on to you. I'm gonna be looking for you in all the fishing tournaments and all the hunting spots. We're gonna find you poaching. Hmm. How do you spell your name? It's Tawanda to you. <sighs> you don't even have an ID. I need to make you a profile. Are you flossing on me? <laughs> no. Prove it. You don't have a hunting license, Emma. So you were poaching. I was not poaching. What is poaching even? It's taking animals that you can't legally take. It's actually not even a thing anymore. I'm out. Look at me. I don't want my picture taken. Well, I don't care if you want your picture taken. I can wait here. 
Wait, who did you get? The guy or Ron? <laughs> you got Ron? <laughs> oh no, Ron. All right, bring him to SESO. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. Hey, uh, Breakaway, I also need you here. She doesn't want her picture taken, so we're probably just gonna be sitting here for a while. Well, I'm gonna have to go in the cell and probably tase her. Cause she... She doesn't want her picture taken. That's how forceful y'all are? Y'all gonna come yeah. in here and... Oh, I got plenty of time. I'll, I'll wait here. Yeah, you do your thing. I got plenty of time. Well, yeah, because if you, if you don't listen. Uh, well, we need to go in the cell and get her cuffed so we can get a picture because she's turning around every time. I, I, she, you know. Yeah, she also doesn't have a hunting license. We were right. She was, yeah. <sighs> Emma, Emma, Emma. Wasn't me. I didn't do oh. it. I didn't do it. It wasn't well, me. No, it was. It was you though. We we. Wasn't me. You. Prove it. No, we we well we Prove witnessed it. you. You witnessed me shooting a, a what was it? We can give her a complice to everything involved since she got into the original scene. She self inserted herself into the scene so she can get complice for everything involved. <laughs> it's just like if he had shot you, and let's say then she actively got into the getaway car after, she could get accomplice to the shooting, even though she didn't do it. Yeah, but it's, I mean, hunting wise, we know that they were hunting together as well. Well, you can talk about when you get here. I think it'll be a bit of a bigger thing. Are you gonna let me take a picture, Emma? Or what? Just because I want to take a picture. Why? Because I want to. Emma, if you look. Emma, look. Ron is here to pick you up. You think I'm stupid? You want me to answer? You want me to answer? I turned answer? around. Barely. I'm ready. Want ten thousand dollars? Just gotta look around all the way for three seconds. What are my charges? Hmm. Let's see. I'm being a butthead on purpose. I know he can. He just is gonna have to do this, but uh, I'm not gonna make them come in here. I'm. I'm not gonna do that. Yes, but it doesn't matter. Uh, the fish, uh, the fish next to that pelt, and we know he was using the one for the pelts, is in close proximity that we can uh, articulate that they're both the same. Like that would hold hold up a court all the time. It it holds up with drugs all the time. Uh, if like there's two dumpsters, uh, I I've seen it. Like when it holds <laughs> up. Yeah, I think they read me right, right? I mean, it's up to you what you want to do. I, I still think it's proximity enough. I'm being charged with proximity now? No, you're not. 
You said I was gonna get charged with everything they was. No, I said we could. You mean right or right? But, but why? Because. I want to ask her a question. Have you, have you, have you read right? Uh, yeah. <coughs> way over. Uh, be, way before we got her in the car. Okay. And what's your favorite kind of fish? Huh? Do you like fish? What? What do you have on her? Nothing. Literally. Like, just food. And a mask. <laughs> so that was literally it, and that, you know, animal meat and shit, but because she was hunting. No oil, nothing. No, 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 no fishing stuff. No fishing pole. Yeah, right. Because uh, I weren't fishing. Just um, yeah, pelts only. <laughs> uh, ten two, McTavish. Oh no. Well, I'm giving. Uh, I'm gonna give her this thing and then uh, unlawful taking. We still need a picture of her though. She does this every time. Emma, there's a panther outside. You want to see it? What about what about a Bengal tiger? Uh, ben, I'll talk to you. Let's talk outside for a sec. <laughs> I'm waiting. I was waiting for Ron to get here before complying with the picture and stuff. What's your favorite fish, he said. <laughs> I'm really glad I dropped a lot of that stuff off. <laughs> Imagine her profile pic on the ground taste. Nah, we'll, we'll comply with the picture. She's just being cantankerous while she can. I know they have to, um... They have a bunch of stuff they still need to gather, so. Okay, that's fine. Emma, how about I make you a deal? If you let me take a picture, I won't put you in the system. If that's how you want your picture taken, that's fine. Wait, a journey? Yeah, that's the suspect. <laughs> Chase oh, no. Oh no! Yeah. No. All right, well, that works. That's a that's a picture. Make sure you check the plate. Yeah, so it was kind of a dick move to get on a get on a bike while I was reading the legislation that you wanted me to read. Yeah, that, I feel like that's why she wanted us to read on the tablet. To be honest with you, it's like that's the equivalent of being at a traffic stop and being like, "Here's, <laughs> here's the license. I'm just gonna go check that," and then driving off with the with the <laughs> turbo turbo nitrous. <laughs> yup. Immediate left hand turn, alley rat. Well. Y'all have your stuff that you 
are pushing on me. I got stuff I'm going to push on you. Like what? Is this the part where you become an eco-terrorist? What? You just said you got stuff to push on us because we're pushing stuff on you. Does that mean you get out of prison? You go become an eco-terrorist? You know, go slaughter tons of animals? That, no, I'm, I'm saying... What? Is that not what you're doing? That is oh, a bit of a reach, no, Phantom, we, Phantom, we, mis we misunderstood completely. Yeah, I thought this was like the start of like you guys just becoming like serial like killers of animals, poachers, I guess would be the thing. I don't know. This is sure. this what you're gonna do? Just is... be. Why I poach? Mean, you don't even make money said, poaching. They said they were nomads. They eat the food. That is true. You like panthers? They're literally is sovereign that... citizens. Sovereign citizens aren't a thing. Yes, they definitely are. Okay, but they're not legally a thing. Okay, but yeah, she doesn't have a license. She's not legal. That well, yeah, true. I guess. From where right. I'm, I'm standing, y'all pushing all this on me is the dick move is what i was trying to say earlier but i think oh. it got misconstrued we're actually not pushing that much on you to be honest yeah we're actually pushing only two things on you emma yeah her name's emma jean by the way she doesn't like emma emma jean yeah okay. emma, emma, emma jean all right emma okay. jean you're looking at a uh, resisting arrest and unlawful taking of protected fish or wildlife wasn't me. Accomplice. Ac accomplice. Accomplice. Wasn't accomplice. You. Accomplice Wasn't to me. unlawful taking. Now I'm giving you the full thing. We saw her shoe. She did it. What? Hold on. One second. One second, Betham. Hold on. We... Y'all y'all saw me shoot what? A boar. And deer without a license. Doesn't matter if it, you didn't shoot the panther. The fact of the matter is you still shot pelts that you, you animals and took the pelts that you can't legally take because you don't have a license. And therefore, it's unlawful. All right, all right, all right, all right. Pantham? Pantham? <laughs> Click outside for a sec. That's, that's... If that's the reasoning, actually, that's the wrong charge. If that's the reasoning they're going with, that I shot a boar, uh, <laughs> I should be getting hunting without a license, not unlawful take. If they're not charging me for the panther, they're charging me just for the boar that I shot, it should be hunting without a license. I deserve, I deserve like 10 more charges on top of that, but I'm just saying if that's what they're telling me, <laughs> that's not correct. But she's not going to know that. I hope... I actually hope he's correcting him on that. If that's the case. Alright, it's, it's split up now. Yeah, why? Why do they do that? It's so dumb. <clears throat> hey, you're getting one thing without a license. Emma. What me? What do you mean it wasn't you? Hold right, on, I'm gonna go get the Polaroid. I'm gonna print this bitch. I'll be right back. Are you actually gonna print it? Yeah. <laughs> Are you actually gonna plead not guilty? Is that what you're going with? I I suppose. I th you want is that lawyer? what I have to do? No, you don't have to. It's up to you. You can plead not guilty that you didn't do these, or you can plead guilty that you did do them. Then that one, um, not not guilty. Okay. Do you want a lawyer? No, I don't. I don't listen to them government cronies. You yeah, know yeah, they kinda. they just are gonna help you rather than help me fix this problem because 
obviously, this is way bigger than I, I thought initially. What do you mean? Y'all just want to control everything. Well, no. No, we A person we just make sure. can't simply exist off grid. Well, you off can. The radar. With licenses. How is that? That does not make any sense. Yep. That is not off grid. Well, then you gotta not get caught. What? What? <laughs> no. <man. laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to go on to her level right now, okay? Just, just, you go know. Next. <laughs> just go next. No, we're trying to get down to her level right now. Um, I've, I've got the receipts. <laughs> Does she have a phone oh. on her? Uh, no. Fuck. Give her a phone. If it doesn't. <laughs> just give her a phone. Give her a phone. Give her the phone with the photos on it. I, I don't need a phone. Here's a phone I, with the I photos. I don't need... There, there you wanted go. the receipts, no, ma'am. it's not coded in the tinfoil, and I, I don't want none of them... Um, 5Gs? DVD, HD, MR, uh, 5G. See, this is... How are you not going down to her level right now? We, ha we haven't even told her about the fucking cell tower that's sitting right above the hunting spot. That is what? Already a, she's the she's definitely a... Right above it. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's definitely already irradiated. Yeah, there's like 5G like oozing out of that cell tower. Listen, when I migrated to this dome, I did not know how bad the government had oversight in here. And I think I might need to head out, but I don't know. I'm going to have to think on this and see whether or not I want to stay in this dome. It's a nice dome, but not for sovereign citizens. What do you mean a dome? There's no dome around this place. What do you? I think she means metaphorically. What? No, there like is have there you is know? literally have you a dome. Like, it's like it's a above us. You know, yeah. you never notice. You go too high, them birds tattle on you to the government. The drones they got, they t they tell yeah. the government well, okay. you're going no, too no. high, and then She's right you here. can't you can't go any further. And neither can you go any any further into the ground. So clearly there is well, I think it might actually be a sphere, to be honest, but I think um there's a sphere and that looks kinda like a dome to us at the surface because the, the top part is like you know, that's the only part we see. But the, the part below ground, um, there's caves and whatnot, so obviously there's there's a dome going around the bottom too. You can't go further than a certain point. They tell you it's because there's some magma, but it's actually uh, just the government uh, protecting us from whatever's outside. I think there's some kind of hellscape going on out there, and the, and the government's protecting us from it. But um, my friend Curtis, but he, you don't he trust thinks, the government. Well, he thinks that the um, there's a government utopia outside, and we are some kind of experiment. And, and this is why I think we shouldn't allow people to hike on Chile. They eat the <laughs> mushrooms off the ground, and this is what happens. That's true. The mushrooms is the good tower. for the soul. Oh, well, they also get you high at times if you eat the wrong or die. Well, the, yeah, wrong some, ones. the the ones those ones or are the right it, ones based on how you want to. Some of go. them make you feel real good. Yeah. yeah, those would be the that. bad ones, right? Yeah, wink, wink. That's some of some. You eat the right, right one, and you you start seeing a dome. Yeah. Or the wrong one, break away with cops. You eat the wrong one, not the right one. Wink, wink. It's kind of like that movie, the the red pill, blue pill. You you eat the right mushroom, and you can tell what the government's doing, and you can see the dome, and you can tell everyone else. That's what that's what I did. If you could see what the Big government way. was doing, you would have seen us taking photos of you. Not Big very way. effective mushroom. Well, that's not my fault that you're on the side of the government drones, the birds. You might actually, you might actually be a 5150. Where's Pixie, where's, where's Pixie what? at? A, a 50 hood? I think she qualifies, uh, Pixie, Pixie potentially. Around. Yeah, She's she talking might. about domes and ceilings and yeah. immovable barriers and all this other nonsense. God. I have rights. 
You know, my family was once attacked by death I am itself, free to move. And even I don't believe in a dome. That is so outrageous, so far out there. I mean, currently you are free to move. Let me Just ask you this. One by one you ever square. gone through an airplane to another place and been able the to open the door? Did you just hear what? that? No. Anthem, do I need to put you in one of these cells? Did you eat the mushrooms? No. <laughs> okay. You must have no. got too close what to that cell tower. What the fuck was that noise? No. What the fuck was that must, noise? Must have got too close to that cell tower. Yep. Anthem, did you eat the mushrooms? Did you take no, those no. mushrooms out of my pack? <laughs> you did not just I... hear the, like, that vibration in the ceiling. What? Anthem, I'm going to have to. No. Until I'm so <laughs> sure, man. Just until I'm sure. <laughs> Let me go. <laughs> It's probably you, just you, new it was probably I need, just new I need to know what the square root of 16 is before <coughs> I can let you lay you out. I need to know the square that your brain's root of 16 is properly. 4. All right. And what's the capital of Washington? Like the state? I'm pretty sure the city doesn't have a capital. Okay. But... Well, you know, you never know. People people are not smart in America. It'd be Oregon. You see, no, you see what, what I mean, you Seattle. Did you Seattle, Seattle, Seattle. Seattle. You you see what I, I'm talking about here, uh, Mr. In Cuffs? Let me go. It, it takes only a second for your buddy to turn on you, and then suddenly the government's no longer on your side, and then you got to fight for your own rights. You're right, lady. That's the government man. What if what, what if he didn't let she... you out of cuffs? Well, then I would just like probably go home in cuffs. I don't think so. I don't think you was free to leave. I, I don't think you was free to move. As we all are. Well, that's shackles, not cuffs. That's difference. What? Well, we we have shackles and cuffs. Sometimes we shackle you and cuff you. I mean, right that's now you're when free you can't to move. move. Yeah. It's just within I, a certain area. I am not free to move. I am not free to go. I'm not free to do anything. What? Apparently, because I need a license or whatnot to be in your system, and I don't want to be in your system. Well, then you can't be hunting. We can. That I, sounds I'll like an direct, issue. I will direct Not you to the nearest meat. Costco where you may buy meats and other <laughs> sustenance for your survival. But that will be but, within code. No, no, no. See, that's that's Costco too. They want your they Don't want lie. your number. They want your membership. They can sell we really you in premiums. Can we really say Costco is up to code? Can we really say that? Just don't buy the steak. <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah. Let's not lie to her. I don't know if Costco is really up to code. That's like saying they always push good. them them credit cards on you, and then you got to buy them, and then they give you a free discount or something. And it's not actually a discount; it just puts you in debt. Well, yeah, but it's good. Yeah, it's good value. They told me so. That you're you're setting yeah, yourself would never up lie. failure. What do you? Costco wouldn't lie to me. I think they would. They just want your money. But I already pay them $100 a month. They're not that greedy. That, exactly. Yeah, like that is the point. Yeah, but no, they Why like Why are you doing that? Shop there. You, you should be able to free, be free to move among that store and, and buy whatever you feel like you want to buy. Well, you can. With but you got to pay. Membership. And you got to give them yeah. your name and your phone number. And they sell your email to some company that spam calls you on your cellular phone. And then you get exposed to all them 5G, 4G, DVD, VCR. VHS. Okay. <laughs> Have you ever seen the DVD logo on a screen where it like goes like from one angle to the other, then you wait like ten minutes until it finally hits the corner, then you're satisfied, and then you wait another ten to fifteen minutes to dab it again. And the old CRTs? Yeah. yeah. When I was did like fifteen years ago. Did y'all get huh? either one of them out there? Or yeah. is yeah. it just me? Ron where Ron Rudders, I think. Ron uh, Ron's the MRPD. The MRPD, yeah. McTavish does it. McTavish is not a country cop. He is a boosting, rooting, tooting, <laughs> car chasing hillbilly. He actually only pit you guys for the sole fact that he wanted to go to an S plus plus. He wanted to go to a fast car chase. <laughs> yeah. Un <laughs> what? Un 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 yeah. Uh, all right. he, no, he did not. Well. He did not do that, Bantham. Bantham. All right. <laughs> They get it processed because at this point she's probably on. Actually, how long has it been? Yeah, it's been a bit. Uh, I feel like at this point you're gonna end up letting little... her walk out the front door. <laughs> well, no, because it's only by the time she gets I'm here. I'm free to move. Tough, tough time. I'm free to move. I'm free to move. I, I knew it. Right. I knew you guys were wrong. 
Oh, no, no, you're still... Okay, so you're pleading not guilty for resisting arrest and hunting without a license. 15 months, 30 months parole. Yeah. And a $1,275 fine. What? Well, yeah, there's a $1,000. I don't got that kind of money. I yeah. He so suck. Uh, you can probably open it. Open it without a cuff. Uh, we're gonna regret this. This is gonna be this is gonna be an embarrassing strike points moment. <laughs> no, no, I think it's nine. I think it's nine. A, yeah, I just have a feeling it's nine. I'm. Ah, uh, yep. All right. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> All right. All righty. We'll send you up. Okay, I'm a gene. I. All right. It's not that much. What's the what's the total time? Fifteen. It's only five uh, five months off. So it's ten twenty five. I feel like for a sovereign. Eh. I mean, I'll leave it. I'll leave it up to you. Whatever you wanted. What do you mean by sovereign citizen? Now I'm <laughs> just saying the money what? probably are you, is more. Are you a sovereign <laughs> citizen? Love her. Like, no, no. Oh my I'm God. just saying the money hurts more. Yeah, but she said the crime. All right, well, it's your decision. I'll leave you. I'll leave you. All right, Emma, we're going to send you up. Am I free to move? Yes. Yeah, Am I free to go? Am I free to leave? Am I free to move? Wait, 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 Emma, you are I, I promise I'm not gonna do nothing stupid. No, I, I'm come not on, gonna Emma. attack nobody. Emma, you are free to go. It's right. tempting, but I ain't gonna do it. No. Where do you, I go? Is it in here? Did. This way. In here? This way, he's, 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 this he's way? guiding you somewhere. All right, but I'm free to move. Yeah. Yeah. I'm okay. I'm free to move. Uh, yeah, this is Bantham Show. The Bantham Show. All right, this way. Did you get your stuff? Where, where's my stuff? You should be able to get it right there. Got a megaphone? No, I don't have a megaphone. Did you get your stuff, Emma? Sure did. Okay. <clears throat> All right, we'll go out the front door. Hey, Emma, you are free to go. To Gary here from D the DOC. Gary's here to pick you up. <laughs> oh my god. What a couple of buttholes. I know you guys can't see this, but... I don't know if you guys can hear me. I'm not sure uh, what is what is happening at the moment. Might end up calling it a day. Hey, Ron. Oh, hey. I appreciate the uh, the save earlier. That was uh, yeah. mighty kind of you. Uh, sorry you ended up in here. Regardless, um, I hope we can, you know, make it up to you at some point. Oh no, no worries. I'll, I'll be honest. I was gonna end up in either way. All right. Well. Yeah, both gonna happen. I think. For me, I think I'm gonna hit the sack, but uh, do you know if, if they got Curtis? 
oh no, he got out scot free, yo. I was actually just talking to him. I may uh, use my one phone call. I might go do that myself. Just tell him thank you for the day. Okay. Hey, yo, it's nice meeting yo. You too, Ron. Okay, goodbye. Go make a phone call to uh, our buddy. Yeah, it's not you, it's me, I promise. Because we're probably not going to be able to see anything. Well, I gotta pick up this phone. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to be. Hello, who is this? Hey, Curtis. Oh shoot! You it, did get yeah, caught. Yeah, we got caught. Um, me and Ron's in here. Uh, I'm good. I think I'm gonna serve my time in here, and then I'm gonna head to sleep. But I just wanted to call and say thank you for the day. Thanks for the save and all that. And then, um, also I think. You might be in some trouble. I think they saw some stuff in your car. I heard them Don't talking worry, about it. Don't worry, it's already all sold. <laughs> oh, all right. Um, well, I think you you might still be in some trouble for it. I'm not they're gonna too look sure. For, they're they're going to try and look and probably put a warrant out for me. I'll just hide up in Polite or they'll never catch me. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you of for course, yeah, all, the, all the information today and... I hope we see each other again. You let me know when your family's around. I'll, I'll come by. Of course. I also want to pay you for, for you know, however. What do they, they charge you for? Um, Something about hunting without Ooh. a license. Hold on. And then... Hold on. Uh, what was that? Hunting without a license and what else? Hunt, hunting without a license and resisting. Hunting without a license something, and resisting. Something like that, I, I think. I'm not too sure. They said something about it. That's it? They didn't hit you with anything else? That's it? No, they were saying that I was getting a uh, poaching, but then <laughs> I asked them what I was getting that for, and then they said um, it was something to do with that panther, and I think that might be something they're looking that at. That panther you. don't exist no more. <laughs> it's like something All the, right. of, of that man's leather uh, build now. They ain't never getting that back out. <laughs> All right. Well, I wish you the best of luck. They didn't. I think it was like fifteen hundred dollars. Fifteen hundred. So, yeah. All right. Like I'll, that, I'll, I'll, I'll make sure. I'll make sure you're paid. All right. All right. Well, thank you for everything. It was fun, and I, I'm sure we'll get up to some stuff again sometime. All righty. All right. You have a good one. You too. Bye bye. Bye. Okay, chat. Um, I really don't know if you guys can hear me right now. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and call it for the day since Comcast is being a potato. Um, I don't think we're back. I think it's still... I think it's still mucked up. Yeah, it's still pretty bad. Um, I think I'm going to call it there though because uh, we've been live for about 11 and a half hours. It's been a good stream. Awesome pushes for... Uh, 2,400 subs today, which was amazing. Also, Death31, thank you for the tier 2 27 months. I appreciate you. Um, yeah. This has been, uh, another, another instance of Comcast being a butthole and ruining a moment. That was really gr good. Um... Props to the officers for putting up with us. That was, um, <laughs> that was what I wanted all day. That's all I wanted was that one, that one interaction, and I got it. Finally, we got it. And we, we got some, some fun stuff out of it. But, I hope they enjoyed it. I hope, uh, Kermoto enjoyed it, and, and Mr. Rudders, he's hilarious, so. Oh no, we didn't avoid jail. We got jail. Honestly, we should have gotten more, but uh, I think it was just they didn't have enough to prove everything or push certain things on people. Um, why is she free? I'm not free. I'm in jail. I'm literally in the jail. I didn't put my jail clothes on because I'm lazy, but Oh, you know what? I think they... The stream is really delayed right now. That's what's happening. You guys are seeing me get jabated. Okay, I think what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call it there. I'll let you guys watch the VOD if you wanna see the last bits of it. Um The stream has been blessed. One final blessing for those of you watching the VOD. Alright, I'm responding to chat right now for those of you who may be watching the VOD. Um... Let's see... I'm gonna see if we can get a raid on Ron. Cause I don't think Kermodo is live. All right.
right, you guys stay safe. Be kind to yourselves and one another. I'll see you all tomorrow. I uh, don't know what we'll be doing, but I think I've got some stuff planned. Ziggy's awake. <gasps> Ziggy. We're going to raid Ziggy. Um, also, Kit, Kit, Kitty Kit, thank you for the 23 months. Welcome back. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Goodbye. I'm going to tell chat that we're closing up because I don't know if everyone's still behind. Thank you for the RP, Kermodo. My internet's pooping out. I'm sorry for the, the stream being weird right now. But we're, we're raiding Ziggy. Show him some love, guys. I'll see you all tomorrow. Goodbye.